Oh shit. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to Twisted Mind. How the fuck are you guys doing? Today's, by the way, pardon me, I just woke up from a deep sleep. I was having crazy dreams. It was very cyberpunk themed because I've been playing the game, right? A lot of murder. May have raped a few people. Not me, but I may well, have seen not. some. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just uh, kidding. It's a joke. It's a guys. joke. Calm it's down. Serious, Everyone yeah. on DLive, take a chill pill. Here, I'm going to put this in the uh, chat. Hi, chat. How are you? Um, I'm just, I'm, I'm rushing. We're on time, but I'm still rushing. I put on Twitter here. Uh, you guys might want to retweet this. By the way, Ralph may be phoning <laughs> in soon. But hear this, hear this, hear this. Maybe. We'll see. I know he's a, he's probably drunk and he more might make this segment more interesting. If you I mean honestly, the drunk Ralph, only interesting happen things happen with drunk Ralph, right? I don't, we've never had a Absolutely. dull day with with Ralph being hammered, have we? Um, never. No, it's always uh, it's always interesting. Chicago gifting five one month subs to people on this channel. Thank you so much, Joy Jojo Shabadoo, the based Asian Mister Stellar RC Chaos X and Nerf all received those subs. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. At ten k lemons, we'll give you some extra show. Uh, thank you everyone for the support, guys. Uh, Tuesday for eight diamonds. Saying happy Friday. Woohoo! Tuesday. It's nice to see you. It's nice. Ralph just said he has something to say. Whoa! Hey, I got hey. something to say. Whoa, okay. Uh, we got D. Shattenry for a diamond saying, Ralph. Yes, yeah, so okay. I just read that. Wow. Uh, again, we're just getting started, ladies and gentlemen. Um, or can I say, ladies and gentlemen? Get it? Do you, you read the ladies title? And gun you know what, Andy? It's a Woski Live News Report. Andy. What? Fuck it. Let's fucking go. Friday night, Whoa, guys. Kyler's I'm gonna hitting. hit the bottle. Every ninja kikini, it Kyler hits the bottle, and there Fuck, it is. I'm gonna hit the motherfucker all the time. <laughs> Larry <laughs> Nefty for ninja kitty makes Kyler smash the bottle. There we go. One more hit for the starting of the show for having PPP on. That's right. People's populist press is coming on. No step on snake for a diamond stick. It's Friday, boys. Let's go. Um, uh, are you playing Cyberpunk later, Andy? Cleaver Punk. I'm actually. I bought a new katana for twenty thousand dollars. It's got like damage seven hundred. So I'm no. not. Whoa! Whoa! No. Oh god! It's one no. minute of Kim Star saying no. the N word. No. One hey, uh, minute. No. Oh god! No. This reminds me of. The, this is actually thematic. No. Sugar Ray with fifty dollars no. and Kim Star no. still in my. Okay. No. Okay. Wow. Okay. okay, I stopped. Holy shit. That's that's a way to start a stream, Kyler. That's that how high people are. Do you understand, Kyler? Today is wait, 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 wait. Whoa, this hey. is why we can't this is why we can't do fucking ninja games for shots. I, I will die. Like that's already like seven shots right there. Okay. 50. That's insane. I just one we're more. just getting one that's more. Insane. I'll how about I just guys, you know I'm gonna get drunk tonight. Color, just take I'll, I'll say, you, you I'll have say, to take how, a about, how about this? The more like things pick up like this, the, the faster I'll drink. I'll just pick okay, up. Okay, yeah. I'll but just you, fucking you, you have going. to take a shot after that one, though. Oh, absolutely. That's $50. I'll, I'll, like, that's, like, seriously. That's like, that's that's like a drink, that's like too. A chug. I'm going to take a drink, too. Uh, we wow, got that was a big one. Sukure for $50 Woo. saying just wanted Keem for 30 seconds, to be honest. Thank you so much, guys. We're already almost at the goal in like fucking 10 minutes. Um, Jesus, got, God. Uh, content consumer for a diamond saying, does this make... Oh, and by the way, PvP will be here at 1 a.m. I told him, you know how I like to always start the show for 20 minutes, talk to the chat, talk to Kyler, say hi, before we get deep into it. Because uh, let me tell you something, guys. This has been... Years in the making. PvP, us, Ralph, everyone, we've been at such a brutal war with each other. But it's the holidays. Put the guns down for a minute. At least well, for a minute. Well, personally, I've never been at war with nobody. I'm just some asshole, so. Kyler, if you don't say you're, you were at war with me, you're not. With you? Yeah, fuck you, Andy. Oh, yeah, I'm God, on PvP I side. Yeah, oh. I'm with those guys. Oh, you are them. No. Fuck you. No. I um, will say that it is kind of interesting for me because I guess I would say that I was, 
I wasn't the bit. I li I like PPP and Godwinson. Their videos are funny and stuff. I think they're entertaining. But it's like I'm a fan of Ralph too, so oftentimes I'm I'm conflicted on that. It's just like, yeah. well, I mean, you know, it's 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 a sticky situation. But look, we you know we're here, we're talking it out, we're duking it out, you know. Yep. Someone smoke crack at fifty. Amen, brother. Why me crack? Amen. Amen, brother. Andy. We got a lot of things on the menu. We might have Ralph phoning in. Uh, we do have. Um, now again, we're not all BFFs. So Brian Stelter, right? us. We already know about that article. We got it on the docket. Oh, Don't dude, worry. we have so Don't much. Even. The menu, by the way, we have cog cucking cucked by his girlfriend live. Uh, Pardon me? Did you hear this? No? No. Well, PPP said PPP did show prep. He goes, I want to talk really? about this. He was even like, Do we do like so I'm like, whoa, we got so you know, much. We got you know what? Okay, Dick say Masterson what's... on the menu, Cog, Baked Alaska. We've got all the all the old and we have obviously a discussion with them about us, you know, about Ralph. The, things are going to get so weird tonight, guys. I hope you're going to be drunk. Like, if you're sober tonight, it's there's, Friday. there's, there's a problem. You, there's you a doing? problem. Sober. Seriously. Hey, Andy, you know, I, but I've quit drinking. I used to beat my wife when I drank. Well, look, suck it up, buttercup. Take a couple of drinks for Uncle Andy, okay? Don't be a it, fucking funny, funny guy. Funny person. Like the movie Funny People. Right? But just like that. Uh, I will say, too, real quick, that um, like an observation I just had. I obviously I consider myself on like the worst key, like the the, the the Ethan Ralph, the the, the 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 kill stream crew side of things. Like that's kind of where I dwell. But listen, no other guest has brought on show prep besides him. I don't think anyone's ever like that's true. Prepared. As he, I mean, he's winning me over. Yeah, Slowly. I mean, like, he's like, I don't know. He's like yo, a worst key. Are we gonna be a, a? Are we gonna do a a, a discussion before and, and prep the show? I'm like. Well, I'm thinking of that. We my words, never buddy. That ever. <laughs> we can never do that ever. I said, send me what you got. And he did. And he and I woke up from my nap and he sent me more things. And I'm like, God damn. This is and I'm like, and by the way, we're all yapping it. All yap. All will, all, all will be yapping. The only, the only thing that does suck is Ralph didn't do his show tonight. Whoa, keep. Oh, we got another 20. I'm going to be house before fucking PPP even gets here, dude. Wow. I'm like already Sugar Ray down for to the 20 H. says we get getting lit in house tonight. Catch up, F slurs. I I've got oh no my choice. God. No, got the, I'm, I'm I'm hitting the bottle. Hit the bottle. Ba baked just got released, but what does that mean? We're gonna be looking at the police report. Well, you can you can get released, but it's like it, it it you still have a court date to like they're you're being charged with something. So they release you because they probably determined he was an immediate threat to society. He just you know made somebody. So like they just told him. Yeah. You know, you know what I mean? He's, Wait, he's well, going to be watched. We're, we're going to get into it. I definitely want Wait, our friend. I guess what I'm saying is that he's not black. So. Whoa! That's true, Which though. is a that's true. reflection of how fucked up our justice system got, yeah. is, guys. I'm not saying that's a good thing. I'm just saying it's a fact. It's I, fucked I, I up out here. The, I wouldn't use the word, word fucked up. I'd use the word observant. Uh, they observe the near Color, let me just pound through this because people will be on go, in 12 go, minutes. Go, go, go. I don't want to miss anyone here. Um, yeah, yeah, I read that one. Uh, about a cyberpunk, I might play it tonight. I, I might. I'll have to lower the settings. It's fucking annoying. Subraction general for a diamond saying, hit that bottle now. Bro, Color, fuck. You're going to be fucking. Okay, Kyler, just, just pace yourself. Pace yourself. Pace, you please. said whenever they donate, no, they tell me to hit the diamond. bottle. That was a diamond. Andy, pace I yourself. drank like half this ball last time. I'm good. I only drank a little bit. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking. By, whenever, by, the end, if, if, by, by the end of the half bottle, you started talking about brutally arring like women inside. Like, it was fucked. Yeah, no, that's 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 what. Well, you know what they say: the true you comes out. Okay, gone, so. uh, we got. Uh, I'll drink to that. We got Cuba for a diamond. St. Kyler, Chris Brown, the bottle is Rihanna. <laughs> that's someone, good. That was good, actually. I, no, I actually, that. um, uh, yes, that's true. You're right. Yeah, but I was saying it sucks that Ralph was on vacation this, by the way? because usually, uh, kill stream, you get the host, you get people pumped. You have all the people who have their browser to tabs open when the show was over and they don't chat or the people who I'm able to promote it to, which yeah, brings another few true. like so it's going to be it's it, it's but Ralph's on vacation. He's doing this thing and he looks, looks like he's having fun. So I'm not complaining. Um, 
Um, can, can we can we get a sticker? Can someone take a screenshot of me hitting this and get a sticker of it? Yeah, yeah, kind of, yeah. Go. Someone, I'll do a post. I'll okay, do a post okay. For someone, a someone just clip it and then you can send it to us. Ready? Okay, I think that's good. Gucci. I'm, just I'm got, taking a break. Uh, I'm, 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 oh, I have easy good. Fuck that e, by the way. Good. Easy E hitting on 14 year olds. I'm not even. The, the, we're going to talk about the IRL community as well. We got easy money is the best for a diamond thing. Please don't play that anti Semitic me D drop. Me D? Isn't that what you just did? I think you played it and then I read that. That's weird. That's kind of, that's, that's weird. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to stop drinking for like 30, 20 yeah, minutes. Stop. I'm feeling it. Drink some I'm water good. too. I'm going to drink some beer. How about that? I'll drink oh, some wow. Beer. Okay. Wow. You're getting fucked. Uh, D chat me for a diamond. Uh, it says pass out the coal wars clause. Okay. <laughs> we got easy money. It's the best money for a diamond saying how much to live stream getting Pavizervac? What? Pavisor vac? Where? What is, is this a donation? Where a, yeah. are you getting this from? Uh, Pavisor. Easy money is the best. And who is Easy Money is the best? That's a scary name. Larry and MD for a diamond for a ninja kini. God damn! <laughs> nice and donut. Whoa! Say like, I'll be drinking my scotch and eating my methadone tonight, guys. Based. I, take your hardest, the hardest drug you have. Uh, Ray take again em. for a diamond saying, take a shot, LMAO. Okay, Kyler, cut. Don't, you don't have to agree with all the, okay? Take, just, take methadone, do it. Uh, easy money. The best I mean, money. If, you're if you're taking methadone to wean yourself off of other, that's fine. That's prescribed to you. It's it's the proper thing to do. So. Exactly. If you have it, you have it for a reason, I'm assuming. And easy money is the best money for a diamond. Scene. Pretend the bottle is Janet Ye Yellen and tongue kiss it. And we Whoa. got Tuesday for a diamond saying cheers and cheers to you. Cheers to all of you. Nice to see you, Zweebull. Evelian 02. Evelian 02. Evelian 02. MTMD. We see we have uh, some stickers of our of our pal, Gypsy Crusader. Uh, we got hit the bottle. I wish he was my pal. Uh, oh, god damn it. All right. Wait. Look at that sticker of me going "fuck you!" Oh shit. Also, uh, speaking <laughs> of Randy, and speaking of stickers, um, once open link. I hate Discord the way they handle images. It's really annoying. Oh my um, god, Keem! Keem stars going off. Keem star, another. We're not saying it. From... He's saying it We're censored, so it's fine. Wow, Sugar Ray for twenty dollars. By the way, saying I'm paying to make Kyler pace himself. Guys, okay, all we've right. already smashed right. the goal. Now I'm cooling on it. I'm cool. Now I'm cooling on goal, it. Okay, Kyler, I'm cooling pick, on it. Pick a new goal. Go ahead. I, I'm, I'm drinking the beer. I'm sticking to beer because liquor before beer, you're in the clear. I had the liquor. I'm gonna drink a little bit of beer, so I'm in the clear. That's how it works, right? Mm. Also, I sent you, Andy, a picture of me hitting the bottle. Can you make that a sticker real oh, quick? Yeah, Is that okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah time. Fast. We Is have okay? nine minutes. Yeah. we have nine minutes. Yeah, you're good. Before. You're good. Oh yeah, I don't I, want to I impose. Have to actually, I have to message him and just send us an send him an invite to our Discord. Also, um, while you're doing that, I have I have like a long sleeve shirt that's like uh, Captain Picard's like costume. Should I put that on instead of this? Uh, I'm, in, no, I'm in the no. I'm on the bridge. I'm on the bridge. I can nah, just change shirts real quick. Nah, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do it, nah, Andy. I, nah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I'll be nah, right back. Nah, nah, nah. All right. Okay. Uh, yeah, by the way, if um, I'm feeling generous today, uh, hang on. There we go. If anyone needs to be unmuted, you can be unmuted. Don't be a fucking F slur in chat. If you're going to be rude in chat and mean, and just a piece of shit and annoying. If you hit caps lock and all your messages are in caps, you just rebanned. But anyone who needs to be unbanned, uh, you can DM me on Twitter. I got open DMs. Uh, it'll be a message request. Let me know. You got you got one. Get it? Um, cheers to Big Dog. Cheers to all of you for being here. Um, PPP is going to be here in about eight minutes. Uh and hang on, let me message to him. Right, go. Let's fucking go. Starfleet up in this bitch. Let's fucking go. At... I like how Andy was like, no. Nah. I'm like, Andy, what you don't you know is there's nothing. There's nothing as a goal. 
There's nothing you can say. Oh, oh, you should have said that on air. I was about. To, I was. I was saying nah, so you can you, stop. No, you, you said nah you're... like 10, 20 times. You gotta say it like immediately because I'm drunk. You gotta. I'm like a child. You're drunk already? What? Dude, I fucking yeah, drank like surfer. five shots of Jaeger surfers in a row. In surfers in chat. What's up, surfer? Why don't you suck my fucking cock? What are you doing? Yes, you have been un unmuted. He's a drunken surfer. That that is, I can confirm, the real. Uh, a surfer there. Uh, we got Rain again for a diamond saying, Starfleet up in this bitch. Make so, it so. Make it so. I want you all to understand tonight. It's we have going massive to be, hogs and we will fuck you. Oh, yeah, we will, we will fucking, we will reorganize your throats as Kyler once said. Um, wait, did you think? Wait, that? I said that? I did. I, it, sounds, no, it sounds like something I would say. I think we read it somewhere and then we went, that's what we do to <clears throat> girls, right? That sounds familiar. Um, I, I, I probably would say that, but if I didn't, we'd definitely agree with it if we read it. So. Yes, 100%. I'm in. That's 100%. Oh, I'm no. in. Let me know where the throats are at. I'll fuck them up. Let me know. Yeah. Uh, they won't shit right for a fucking week. So, wow. <laughs> That's kind of insane what you just said right there. That's from uh, Bad Santa. I stole that from Bad Santa. Uh, we got Rain again. For, oh, okay. At least you admitted your thievery, your hack thievery. Rain again for a diamond saying, Star fleet up in this bitch. Edward scissor up hands for a diamond. Uh, double Romans for you both this evening. Let's get Can some... we do that? Can we do that, Andy? Mm, yeah. Okay. What if I what if I what if I got a, what if I got a stretch? I got a stretch and like I, I can only stretch like this. You know, like that's the I, new I, sticker I... of the channel. All right, we got it. We got it. I should go for gifting, and that's just a double. We invented that. That's the get it's get twisted. No, there, there's some Ready? planets Connor's on Star doing. Trek. Ready? What? You're Wait, sharing oh, your not camera sharing my, my camera. No. Here's our new, sorry, sorry, sorry. Here, here's okay. our new thing. Okay, you ready? Yeah. I have to switch my fuck. I, I don't have my settings. You just switch your fuck? Uh, wait, settings? Wait. I switched my fuck oh, once. Yeah. It was unpleasant. I have to wait. You're good. Just stop, just stop sharing. Good. Stop good. sharing. Go to Discord. Go to my yeah, settings. Double Romans aren't even bad. That's true. It's not even bad. It's just it's how Romans said hello. No, but the, the, we have our own though, Kyler. You're ruining it. Okay, sorry. Shut the fuck. Oh, imagine I just gotta start getting mean to you, no, Kyler. This is what it is. It's like this. You ready? It's like this. Get twisted. <laughs> ready? Three, two, one, go. Get twisted. You didn't do it right. One more time. One more time. You you, you do like a get. It's like get twisted. Okay. That's what you do. Right, okay. One. Okay, you count it off. Right. Three, two, one. Get. Get. Twist. Twist. Get ready again. Three, two, one. Go. Get. get twist. Twist. All right, go. guys. I'm gonna be streaming for about another twenty Hail minutes. Hail Hydra. I appreciate it if uh. Oh. Thank you, Jakeda, no for the one dollar, no, nice, and now we have DP not, not DSP. I hope you guys are liking the stream. <laughs> they show the rules. <laughs> he goes, "Did you guys watch the Game Awards? The cuck of us no, two you, stole you the awards." You couldn't Honestly, pay me to I'm watch. Do, I'm done. The I'm, only the only good gay, thing to come out. Of Andy, did you see what happened there? Though one good thing happened there. Sephiroth is in Smash Brothers. That's now. it. Yeah, I yeah, did see cool. that. But that could have happened without the Game Awards. I don't give a fuck. Fuck yeah. the Game Awards. They can suck fuck my dick. If you watch that, you're gay. Uh, Shakori, get the, I'm just kidding. If you watch it to just, but like, like I get it. There's like reveals and there's trailers and stuff. You want to check it out? I, I get couldn't it. But get like, I, fucked. Yeah, I no. couldn't get fucked. It's I'd turning I'd into the goddamn monster. I'd rather put a bullet in my own head and watch that fucking gay shit. Like seriously, if you watch the Game Awards and you're not watching it just to make fun and get mad. And you're watching it like I'm excited. Honestly, you have no hope in this world. Your mother should have aborted you. I'm sorry. I'm not even a big abortion guy. Uh, but you're not even the right kind of abortion. A fucking coat. A hanger. coat hanger. Yeah. You should have been Russian fucking. Style. You should have been a fucking a dead looking baby seal creature <laughs> on the fucking back alley <laughs> staircase. Okay, guys, that's all I'm saying. Amen, brother. Andy. Thank you for people popping the press. Press is gonna be here in about three minutes. And by the way, we've got so much on the menu. It's actually. I'm gonna say this. This is weird. It's too much. It's too much. It's too much show. It Kyler. might bleed over into Monday, honestly. It might. Be, it might. We might just do a 24-hour show with PPP. Uh, Cody, 
Yeah, let me just cover these real fast. Then we're going to have a PvP in here immediately. Shikori, give, give the one one sub to Wesley Cope. Shikori, give the another one one sub to Queef Shut Wrangler. Up, Thank you so fucking much. Uh, we got Queef Wrangler received another one one sub from Shikori. Shikori, give the one one sub to My Name is Nobody. Shikori, give the one one sub to Edward Scissor Pants. God damn, Shikori is giving up those. Okay, if you get your subs, get your subs. Eho Anderson donating a ninja guinea. He says, get twisted. No, oh, believe me, I'm already there. I'm already there. Oh, God, we have some show to go. You have to come. Oh, we got. No, I'm, I'm not. I'm not. It, do, it's, uh, you, you oh, Evilion 02. Hang on. Evilion 02. Evilion 02. Says you need to do this, the bottle sticker. Yeah, hang bottle. on, hang on, real fast, real fast. You're good, you're good. Uh, Shakota, give the one month sub to George L.L. Pierce. Shakota, give the one month su sub to G.K. Nukem. We got Red Saber Nero for a diamond saying, Get twisted, motherfuckers. And we got, I do all the new uh, uh, new followers here. Shakota, give the one month sub to K. Mike Gaming. And Shakota, if they want my sub to Thor's. And now I'm going to make the sub sticker real fast. And then we're going to get um, the one, the only. I'm going to call him Big Dog. I don't know what you're going to call him, Kyler. Big Dog? If you don't call. Like, I, 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 I would ask one thing. Even though we, 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 we do battle it out with PPP, we have to at least be at least respectable and call him Civil. Big Dog. Civil. And call big him Big Dog. Big Dog? If you don't call him Big Dog, you're getting fucking blasted. You're getting bad, bitch. Wait, whenever uh, I hear Big I'm Dog, I think of I think of this. Big Dog. Hang on. Let's delete a sticker here. Let's delete the uh, the Dennis the Menace Grandpa one. That's stupid. Yeah, that shit. No, that, hell. that was used twice. Whoever played that guy in that movie can go to is probably in hell right uh, now. He, he's probably dead, to be honest. He probably had cancer or something. So. That's uh, awesome. Like, cancer like, rules. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna That's pee. not true. I'm gonna pee. That's not true. I'm gonna pee, I'm pee real go. fast. One sec. Go pee, 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 pee. See what I did there? Goddamn, guys. Tonight's a fucking blowout. I'm hitting the fucking bottle. If I hit the bottle while well, Andy's not here, will you guys. Oh, shit. There it is. I'm hitting the bottle. I'm hitting the bottle. Hit the bottle. Hit the bottle. Walter Matthau is dead. Well, fuck that guy. I don't, well, that's that's kind of rude. That's Walter Matthau was was a good actor. I don't think we should disparage his name. I, yeah. That's a joke. We're just joking. I'm not. Hit, should I hit the bottle again? Should I hit the bottle? Should I hit it? I'll hit it. Look at June. Look at June. Ah. I don't see how people don't like Jägermeister. It goes down smooth and it tastes like good and plenty. Like it's amazing. It tastes like good and plenty. And it gets you a special kind of fucked up. Like like yeah, like 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 wine and vodka and whatever whiskey can get you fucked up, but uh Jaeger can get you a special kind of fucked right. up. Let's start. Do you understand oh, what I'm saying? We got Larry MD for a diamond, Kyler. I got all the new songs for tomorrow's music show. And she's going to give the one more sub to Larry and MD. Follow Kyler's music show down there. It's Kyler I see. Hit the follow button. And let's stop cock teasing. Let's get him in. The big dog. Ladies and gentlemen, we're going to get him in right now. We've got PPP, a.k.a. Big Dog, a.k.a. People's Populist Press, is big dog. on is on the line with us. Do you hear us? Wow, the fucking momentum is done. Hang on, give, give him a second. He's in the room right now. He's here. There he is. Boys, can you not get my video feed up for fuck's sake? Yo, I am, I You're am, not sharing man. your video. Share your video. Click your, click your video. I was before, but it says I can't stream into the channel. Oh, it's doing that gay shit. Hang on. Talk Sucker. Hang on, hang okay. on. I'm going okay. to hang up the live call. I'm going to phone you all privately because I could do it. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with this thing. All right. I so, get. I wait, 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 wait. I could change permissions real quick. Let me see. Hold oh on. yeah. Okay. Let Hold on. Let me. Let's, should, I'm drunk, so let me see. I think um, I think Discord does that, so you don't come in and put a bunch of gay porn no. immediately. You don't. You're, you're sober as a judge, Kyler. We need to get some more yes. shots in you. But... You're right. You're right. <laughs> okay. 
Captain Picard has a high tolerance for liquor. <laughs> Make it Drinking so. The, Romul the Romulan ale there, buddy, you're used to. The Agar is not on blood wine as he, well. He's yeah, actually, he's playing on blood wine. He's actually using his cost to hide the should... cancer problem he has. It's true. I changed permissions. You should be able to use your camera now. And now you know what I'm gonna do? Okay. I'm, I'm gonna do a share so all three of us are on, on the screen. So there we, I fixed it. Tech support, Kyle. Whoa. There we go. Hey God, hey God, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do one thing right here. I'm gonna put us all, all three of us on the screen at the same time. So we don't. I'm not switching oh. flipping cameras like the last time. I fucking that. That was fucking brutal. That shit sucks. Oh, yeah. That, no, that it, changing camera shit is sucks. I don't it, like it. It's going to look slightly unprofessional, but you could all suck my fucking cock if you if you don't like it. All right. Yeah. Why you suck my fucking cock? Yeah, see, my fucking cock. See, see, there, sure, so, <laughs> Kyler, do you remember what? There he is. Whoa, PvP, your camera Holy is like better fuck. than it usually is. What the fuck? Did you buy a new camera? I know there, boys. <laughs> That's right. I'm in the I'm in on the grip now, boys. So we have to upgrade the equipment in on the grip. Yeah, speaking of which, someone just donated $20. Yeah! And, and Keemstar said the N-word about three times. <laughs> how, how you like that, PvP? Fucking gay. <laughs> no, well, it's... fuck Keemstar there. Keemstar's gay there. We got to support the big time Jew. You can find my doll. No, it's support my doll. We got Shukare for $20. I can't. I can't. He the goes, gay slur. <laughs> He goes. He says. He says. I've been waiting so long to hear this base guest. We've been teasing you for months, PPP. Even though we've never even asked to have you on. You know that, right? I'm like, one day we'll have him on. Trust me, it'll happen. Uh, it, so people who don't know, we've had our back and forth, right? There's been shots fired across the bow from from both sides. So, 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 what what made you reach out? What? Why are you here? Let's ask that question first. Before, well, I just I I got tired of kicking your guys' asses so oh. much there. You know, I figured I figured I'm gonna lay off a little bit there. I've been dominating it too much there. No, but honestly, I've always wanted to uh, to do something with you, Andy. We tried to reach out to you in January when Godwinson was here. We wanted to go to Niagara Falls, hit up the strippers with you, Falls View, <laughs> all that good shit. Didn't happen at the time. We thought we, you were lost forever into the abyss there, but somehow we uh, pulled yeah. it fucking through. Well, I'll tell you it, what The happened. crossover is here. It's we, surreal. We, we talked about this, right? So... You had messaged me or whatever. I, I had followed you back. And then we were we were back and forth with each other because you made a video about me or whatever. Because you, you, you and I thought at the time, claimed to have messaged me and I ignored you. So I looked like a dick. And I was like, when I talked to you last week, I went, what the fuck are you talking about? You never messaged me. I thought you were trolling me. You were like, Worski. Scroll up in the messages, and I scroll up and I see January a video of him and Godwinson yeah. at the bar going, "Come over here, Worski." So it looked like I was ignoring him, and I went, "Wow, this whole thing's been a miss." On your uh, okay, wow, don't I feel well, so? We thought you fit in with the brand uh, of drunken degeneracy <laughs> here that's been established, and we thought you'd fit in with Sir for an eye. You know, that's what we thought. Surf so rules. That's what we were going with. Oh, that's well, I'm glad you're sucking his penis already. Hopefully you <laughs> fucking aren't too toothy with my blow job there, Kyler. I'm hoping I wish, you're I wish I could really say the good thing that for. Surfer says on YouTube. I wish I could say him on here. Well, you could if you weren't a pussy. If you didn't have to get I'll say it. I'll say it. <laughs> You gotta get paid, so it is what it is. Yeah. I, I I don't I don't get paid. Unfortunately, I just get to be pimping as the big dog. That's the the price of being the big dog. Is big you don't dog. get fucking paid. Big it's dog. Money to thing to the big dog there. Just sleeps big on dog. a couch there. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> 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 uh, is, is Surfer there? Can he say hi to hi uh, from the Surfer's side? in the chat there. Surfer, you want to say hi, buddy? 
Oh, hey, guys. You know, yeah. I'm sort of like two minutes behind, so I'm not really on fire. Hey, hey, surfer, yeah, surfer, fun. surfer. Double Romans. Let's go. Double Romans. <laughs> double Romans. Are you sort of look like Michael Jackson from Thriller? <laughs> you know, if you want to throw your Romans, you just give her one of these. <laughs> Let's go. There we go, guys. Those oh, yeah, already fucked. You're gonna be demonetized. It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's the Roman. It's Roman. It's fine. Yeah, we're, we're, no, Roman, no. we're Romans here. Romans. Yeah. Like you're doing better on the stream elements than the fucking. Uh, yeah, yeah. Eli. I, I, I don't. I mean, people support on both. We end up doing the goal that both are combined. But the, uh, <laughs> yeah. So we have. It, it was funny, even though we were at each other's throats for a long time or whatever, and now we're putting down the weapons, at least for the holiday season, right? We've had a lot of mutual people that we actually despise, and we've been making fun of at like 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 at the same time. I think that's where we started talking, where I was like, wait, PPP's video on Baked Alaska is fucking phenomenal. Like the whole Baked ban Bonanza. Oh, <laughs> the, the Baked Bonanza. <laughs> A little bit of base. <laughs> there you go. A baked banana. You want to grab me another beer, sir? We're getting smashed tonight. Everyone, everyone, what cheers. Kind of, what, 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 what kind of beer are you drinking, man? Like well, this is the like uh, Steam Whistle me. Pilsner. This is Canada's Premium Pilsner. It's the good beer, folks, from the Roundhouse in the shithole of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. It's Steam <laughs> Whistle. Only I like a good Pilsner. The whole beer, so you don't get a hangover. Yeah. Wait, you, you really don't. This is the fucking uh, bourgeoisie beer. It's like $55 a fucking case. <laughs> the beer is like, ridiculous. <laughs> Yep. It's a fucking scam. What is it? Fifty bucks? Yeah, it's fifty like bucks. It's a scam. It is a scam. These goddamn fuckers in the government <laughs> charging me all this money for beer. You Doug well, Ford told me I voted for that cocksucker Doug <laughs> Ford, and he promised dollar beers. I haven't got <laughs> fuck all. No fucking dollar beers for me. I just get this shitty fucking government lead. Duck's penis there. Yeah. Edibles don't even work. You just have to order the edibles from the black market there because Dougie is a fucking incompetent buffoon. Fuck you, Doug. Yo, yo, yo fucking, uh, I was telling Kyler that I, I was buying six packs of, uh, of tall boys of Heineken. For fucking 17 bucks. He's like, what the Jesus, fuck? I forgot I you, about that. that. God, it's 17 it at the Walmart. Yeah. It's seventeen. I'm like, yo, this is like, and he's like, uh, I paid uh four ninety five for fucking six it, 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 beers that are eight percent okay. alcohol. Tyler, what is this shit you're drinking? What is this? This it's is like um, some orange beer with the no, no, glasses on that. it. No, it's a Belgian style blonde ale. ale. It's a Belgian by what company though? Anthem. Is it a shock? Oh, yeah, anthem. Anthem. It's an no Oklahoma, Oklahoma company. Fucking like Xbox game or something. Explain shit. to you Canadian liquor laws, Kyler. The cheapest bottle of liquor, 26 or it's like $25. It's insane. It's true. There's no like. Oh, 100%. It's true. That Crown Royal I had this week was I paid. Twenty nine ninety five for a twenty sixer of fucking Crown oh, Royal, uh, yeah. It, and then I, like, you had an America, and you're like, Hold, look, dude. When I was living in the states Andy, for a few months, Andy, I was, was an It was so Andy. easy to be an Alki, dude. Yeah, this this, this is awesome. twenty bucks. That's insane to me. Wait, yeah. how, is bucks. that forty? Or 20, uh, that's, that's, that's a fifth. That's a fifth of Jaeger. A Last time PPP decided to drink 45 shots in a night. Yeah! <laughs> That's not advised. Wait, was that, the, was that the show you guys did where the camera was on, on fucking Surfer for half an hour and he just kept saying the N-word while high? He just said, I don't right. know if that was the show. Well, election night. Uh, oh, the election night. I, I got Election that. night, I didn't do much coverage until like, it was kind of over with. I turn on the camera. I'm just sweating profusely. <laughs> Even worse than I normally am. Just the greasiest fucking dude. People turn it into a reaction gift there. I guess I'm just like fucking mean magician here. Every facial expression I do is like a work of art. 
Yeah. I'd be immortalized there. Every, every frame is a painting. Over. Every frame is a painting. This this with me. That's true. You know, the neck yeah. beard on full display. <laughs> Racy, masculine, Moscow emanating. But there was no the neck beard. Yeah, but there was no asshole spread on that on that stream, was there? Oh no, but you know, I'm thinking maybe this New Year's this New Year's they're gonna do a throwback a no. power move. Show my anus a, again. A power move. You know? <laughs> it is it's the ultimate power move. It shows I run this game. I dominate the game to show my asshole. Amen, brother Andy. Amen, Amen, brother Andy. I showed my asshole and it was the ultimate power move. Because I had nowhere to go from up but from there. There was no way I could advance myself in hard takes. Spinning lava. That's true. That's lava. true. Yeah, yeah, that is. I like how, you know, it actually is, like, unironically the most power, like, the like it's a power move, right? Like, yo, you motherfuckers are watching yeah. me. Check out my fucking asshole. What the fuck asshole. you gonna do about it, yeah, pussy? What are you gonna do, what pussy? You gonna do about Imagine it? You're in, you're in the prison shower. I like in this community to being in the prison shower. <laughs> if you just bend over and display your anus to everyone in the shower, say, come and get it. That's what it's like. Somebody, nobody, nobody came and got it yet in the prison shower. There's still time. Running There's this still time. Oh, uh, maybe fuck. maybe the cancer patient Picard's coming for my anal virginity now. <laughs> Hey, listen. I drink. I drink two hard. things: Earl Grey and chemotherapy. All right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh, holy oh, fuck! You're, you're, you're fucking. You're fucking coming in hot. I love it. Uh, I'll get, get a get a get a liquor glass out. Uh, well, we're getting, oh, we're, no, we're getting we fucked go. tonight, guys. We're getting oh, fucked. Guys, tonight's show, awesome. tonight's show is going to be one for the books. Like, it's going to be only fucking have nuts. one shot glass. Yeah. Oh. PvP drinks 45 shots. Shattered. Well, what did you expect? I shattered the fucking glass. I was That's more than a 40. <laughs> what were you supposed to do? I you heard, conquer it? You fucking break I it. Had, like, 50 fucking shots and puked all over the broke dick farm sweater I was given for free by Jenny Juice after I fucked him at a two grand a month he bows to me he sends me the free merchandise because I run in you Jenny Juice wait oh yeah I just got uh, we got whoa 30 bucks on on fucking uh, on stream elements thank you so much Shukare saying, bro, I fucking love this guy. Yo, fucking PPP for third chair. Who knows, man? We don't know. know. We don't know how the future's future is crazy. The future goes, uh, right? Captain. <laughs> captain, are you going to shoot a shot with me, Captain? Of course. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course. Yeah, 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 everyone, bottle. cheers. There we go. Clay. There we go. It's our first call in the bottle. Oh, ah, yeah. ah. ah, it goes down smooth. God fucking what? damn. Jaeger, Andy, do you have, they have Do they have Jaeger in Canada? Yeah, yeah. Get some Jaeger. What do you the mean fuck? do they have oh. do you think that this is some impoverished third world <laughs> land in Africa? You could have fooled me. They have, could have fooled me. They have Jaeger? <laughs> could have we live me. in igloo? Is there Do I live in an igloo with a gas powered TV? My TV is powered by fucking propane. Yo, yo, you man. know, like, yo, yo. Uh, fucking, I'm like, oh, I'm getting fiber internet. Kyler was like, they have fiber internet over there? I'm like, yeah, it's not. What do you mean? Like, of course there's fiber internet. You have to order the only thing that I know shit. About, oh, wait, 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 wait. The only thing I know about Go. Canada is is Kev, as, as uh, John Candy, <laughs> um, Second City, oh. Canadian Bacon, and also a Degrassi. And PPP. That goes without saying. Surfer and PPP. The national treasure. Okay. Look, the national I treasure okay. up there on I... par with Penny Hawks. <laughs> and fucking... I'm, I'm sorry. Only I'm sorry. Oh, but also, the Canadian, the Canadian oh, icon. Degrassi, Degrassi. You know Degrassi. Do you watch, are you a fan of Degrassi? I've not watched Degrassi because I'm not a word I can't say on this show. I guess funny guy. Ooh, ooh, I can't say it on this show. Holy, 
Holy fuck. Holy fuck. I, no. I mean, he's not. Oh, did you watch a show designed for 16 year old girls? as a grown man. Wait, wait, wait. 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 Okay, so like, listen, oh. like on the surface, the show Fuck. may seem like it's designed for teenagers, but if you watch it, it's there's funny. There's episodes about AIDS, and there's dark <laughs> episodes there. No, it's funny as fuck. It's just, it just is. I can't explain why. It's just funny. It's a funny show. You should check it out. <laughs> We should do a viewing with PvP no, one day. Not? Well, one day we, we, we should get and watch. Yeah, and watch we should make a. I don't know if that's gonna yeah. take place based on the vibe I'm getting where we're discussing Degrassi and stuff. <laughs> I don't know if this is the right show for me. I don't see this is uh, this is oh bad branding God. for me. Oh. It's a little bit of a bad brand <laughs> move for me, there, guys. I was, he's right if i was following you know daka daka or whatever mm -hmm. watching one of his videos there then he, he uploads a degrassi breakdown i'd probably stop stop watching to be honest hey guys <laughs> this week on, no, this week no, on degrassi drake <laughs> kissed the girl at the dance guys <laughs> No, oh, guys. Andy, wait, Andy. No, you've seen that, Andy. You know, there's it's some a, good apps that we've been watching. We watched it, we watched it, we watched it ironically. That, we watched it, we it's watched like it. admitting that your girlfriend has your balls in her purse or something. <laughs> there, Andy, no. don't admit to well, this, Andy. We watched it on stream, though, and we made, made fun of it, but. Anyway. There's a couple. Oh, of, it, it's, it, it's it's funny in the same sense like a a a a, 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 a uh, shitty horror movie is funny. It's like it's a B movie. It's just campy. It's funny. Actually, I want to ask you this, uh, PPP, because we're gonna talk about this. Cause we have a lot to talk about tonight, and we haven't even touched a fucking single thing. And there's a lot. There's a lot that's going on tonight. By the way, I, I'm oh, gonna, we actually, have an eternity. Well, uh, yeah, exactly. We, we have all night, but. I'm here forever, bitch. Let's fucking go. Yo, fuck it. I want to talk about this. W w were you ever... Now, our fans, our viewers... I hate the reason the word fan. Our viewers here hate Baked Alaska. We're not Baked Alaska fans. We don't think he's interesting. We think he's actually a, a piece of shit. We, we are baked disrespecters. We are, as they call it, baked disrespect. Are you a baked disrespecter or do you like baked? Do you look at him as your moral compass, high ground? Do you think... Do you respect him? Do you think he's nice? How could you have any respect for Tim Giannette there? A man who, let me remind you, Let's was go my, by his real Milo, name, Tim Gianna, Gianna, Milo, whatever it is. He was, he was Milo Yiannopoulos' personal ball fluffer and assistant. Imagine being Milo's manservant. Not only a manservant to a homosexual, but a homosexual federal agent. And you're his manservant. Rubbing hey, his ball sack upon command, putting dildos not, in your mouth. He did. Not, that. Even, did that. Wait, wait, wait. not even fed and um uh homosexual, but also I think that he may be towards the um inclination, if you get what I'm saying. He might be a um a a, 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 a American of finance. Well, he is a, a, a Jew. If we not say that word on the show, yeah, you could, you could. Are we, just, are we yeah, not allowed? Yeah, to yeah, name no. I was being coy. I was being coy. He was being coy. June Heyman, June Heyman, June Heyman. Every day, Kyler's June Heyman on the show. Uh, yeah. So <laughs> that's actually Jesus. pretty close to that. That's actually true. good. That's true. That's true. I saw somebody. One of fucking uh, uh, Bates uh, ball fluffers were in, in chat there saying that I'm a I was I loved him until he called me a cokehead. No, 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 he was always a fucking weirdo. When I actually stayed there, when I did that IRL stream with him, I actually ended up leaving his. He was so fucking weird, and I ended up staying in a hotel. And he was calling me on the last two or three days I was in LA. Like, where are you? Where are you? I'm just like, I don't want to hang out with this guy. He was weird. We made fun of him when we made it back after that whole fuck his first downfall when Medicare went after him. But he was always a weird fucking dude. In fact, I never even knew he who he was before I hung out with him at um in LA. 
He I was like kind of him. under the radar a little bit before that, and he's kind of he 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 has gained a um, high profile in his home state of Arizona. If I knew, way. if I had seen oh. that footage of what he did in the past, embarrassing himself, I would have never hung out with him in LA. I just thought, oh, it's another content creator. You know, it's like, oh yeah, I'll do a, a few Hold shows on. with him or whatever. Oh. Go. Hold on, we gotta get what. I want to get into the backstory of Baked Alaska. I sent you a couple of clips. Grifter. That I want you to play. Grifter. Yeah. Because I want, I want you to understand who Baked Alaska is. So Grifter. I'm going to send actually over to Andy again here on the Discord. Okay. This clip of Baked there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Getting, this is, this getting is... made. Because this is full circle. So what Baked Alaska first initially got known for was going to Charlottesville, right? Again, yeah. say what you will about that Charlottesville. Was... Well, the, that, that, that was the flashpoint of his like notoriety on Twitter and stuff and other circles. Yeah. Yeah. So he gets known for getting maced and playing the victim for being maced. Wait, what did he then do? Somehow, you know, real fast, what did he do before that? That like he worked for he, BuzzFeed. He worked for fucking BuzzFeed. He worked for oh, BuzzFeed okay, okay. and then he worked for Breitbart. I oh, think. Oh yeah, after. yeah, yeah. For the dangerous and F tour. And it, it yeah. turns out that that Bart wasn't so bright after all. Yeah. Well. Okay. <laughs> 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 I've been told that in the fucking. So here he is at Charlottesville getting maced, okay. and then I have the other clip, which is him saying, "I love you, Doctor Duke." So let's remember who this guy is supposed to be, right? And, and, and then we'll watch the quick turn okay. as soon as it stops being the profitable grift into, oh, I was brainwashed. I was brainwashed. I was brainwashed there, you know? into making memes for the all right. Now, now I'm going to do one now. thing here because I, I have to rearrange the screen since uh, it is now there. This is actually way better. Cool. So now, now it's uh, black. Uh, Yo, know, PvP, you can hit my uh, live my live channel there so we can all watch on the exact same time and i have it's Discord. black it's black oh because i don't have it open it's there yet. Black. There there you go. Go. whoa it's black. i don't, don't, don't want to hear like, that you don't want to hear crying, that right BBB? No. Crying like a bitch. okay here, here let's watch this shit let's watch this shit which by the way the uh how, how this scene started was they're just walking through the streets and bates is like wait a second i think i was maced wait Oh my god, help! Help! And he starts running and he's running. And he starts going, he goes, he goes, milk! Milk! I milk. Know. And he's like, baby crying. need milkies. <laughs> baby <laughs> need milkies. And then he goes, and then it's like he's in Call of Duty or Battlefield or something. He starts going, medic! Medic! <laughs> I always think it's a joke that these riots. Motherfuckers are yelling like they're in a video game for a medic at these riots. Like, no medic is coming. You realize that, right? I don't... <laughs> yo, the medic is like... Yo... Anyway, let's... Oh, is it... oh, but, but, but this goes perfect with... This is like full circle because of how this story ends, right? So we're starting from the beginning. Exactly. It starts just how it ends. It's like poetic. It's like a fucking, it's like a movie. I really don't know if it's in a bit, like, by the way. It's like poetry, it rhymes. Yeah. It's like, po yeah, poetry, it like rhymes. You stole it from rhymes. me, Tyler. Pottery, it that rhymes. You literally stole the line from my mouth, you fucking Picard bastard. You. <laughs> ah, make it so, bitch. <laughs> hey, wasn't there a website God called Ineedmilk.com or something that was about baked? Yeah, there was. I don't yeah. know if it's still there. Bye, bye, Kyler. I need wait, wait, Kyler. I searched yes. by the fucking URL bakedalaska.com right now. It's available. Yeah. It's available. Okay, let's go fucking go. Let's fucking right. go. We, buy, go. we buy fucking URLs here. We own, he owns <laughs> me. Dot, wait, Derek.shove.n. I N. Derek Chauvin. Neefloyd.com. Okay, anyway, let's, let's watch this. Here we go. This is seeming oh. like a racialist show, boys. I don't know if I can be associated with this optically. Oh, no. It's a positive against them, though. We love everybody. We, we, we love Floyd, yeah. We're, we're we happy. We, we hope he, he's, in, he's in heaven. Uh, the riots Baked actually Alaska. helped our show blow up. Um, I looked it up. BakedAlaska.com is $20,000. Go ahead. Got people no, start no. donating, you guys. Start donating. Yeah, no, I'm just kidding. Get I'm just it kidding. going. I'm in. <laughs> $20,000. Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, I, I too Sorry, love man. lazy black people, boys. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is what 
This is free speech. No, it's funny. No one who was who's been maced by baked was anywhere close to this, <laughs> like this fucking injury. Like it looks like he was like raped and shot. And Mer leg. He got shot in the leg. He like raped. Come all over his face. You could Photoshop a big black cock aiming a dick. It looks perfect. I'm sure someone's already done that before. Oh, it's done. You don't, oh, you don't, like, you don't even have oh, to. Oh, you sorry, don't even Chad. have to. There's photos. Hey, stop. Whoa. Wait, sorry, Chad. Sure, I didn't... Says that you can't, oh, you can't <laughs> see the video. You can't yeah. see it. They show it up for a second. We fixed it. We fixed it. We fixed it. I'm fixing it right yeah. now. Not showing up. Wait, wait. Hang on. This is the first time we actually had an audience reaction of them yelling at me that they can't see the video. But in the actual show, which is actually pretty interesting. So hang on. I, I, I'm fixing it here. I'm going to put us three next to each other. Here we go. This is the new show format there. All right. I thought you guys did this for a living. <laughs> I do it for you a know, survival. We never have guests on. Rare. We rarely have guests on. You're one of three people ever allowed on the show, to be honest. Right. Wait a minute! You guys can't even get guests on this show. We don't. We what don't. am I doing here? No, what? no, no. We we refuse them. We don't want them here. Oh, I see. It's a select. It's select a select group, group of people. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's okay. true. That is 100 so percent true. Well, people, it's not, like, it's not like the other the other show that comes on before this well, that will just take anyone. This well, show hey, hey. is selective. <laughs> well, well, we uh, we were asked to bring on people, and I'm like, listen, if you want them on, email them yourself. I don't have time. I don't give a fuck. I really don't. We're like, oh, hey, so what are your thoughts on Biden winning there? It's like, you know, whatever. I don't give a fuck. I'd rather just fucking watch the the Degrassi with Kyler <laughs> and get high. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, shit. The music's perfect, by the way. Yeah. Oh, no. Poor, poor Bank. You don't feel any, any uh, sympathy for him? Oh, especially knowing what we know now, he deserves to feel this every day. Knowing what we know now. Like, <laughs> he knows how this feels, which is why it's so fucked up that he does it over and over again to other people. And it's not even dude. that. Uh, uh, PPP. Whoa. He said, he's, wait, 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 he said, wait, 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 Egg Alaska is on record of multiple times saying that he wouldn't wish this this on his worst enemy on his on worst his enemy. enemy. Yeah, and the, you know, I know what you're asking yourself. Like, is is a bouncer at a club his worst enemy? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But... Yeah. So, boys, remember, keep in your mind that shot of Baked Alaska's face, and and then compare it to how the bouncer later reacts. Yeah, getting that... made. Well, we hey, more hey, made. Yeah, we have a sh sugar rave for twenty dollars. Thank you so much, massive dono. Saying baked is a f slur. I think we could all, you know, I don't even have to look around the room for that. Uh, and thank Why you so much. You suck my fucking cock. Thank you, uh, sir, for Honey. that. And then we got anonymous for four. And thank you so much, sh sugar rave, for those massive donos, dude. And then anonymous for four twenty, saying first time donor, big fan. Thank you so much, anonymous. Appreciate you. And this is my first time boner. I'm a big man. But, but okay, yeah. But, <laughs> hang on. I want to search. I, I think the best part about that you missed uh, on that clip. It's baked. Uh, I need milk. Like him yelling that. Have you, have you read D Live Dono? Oh, here we go. Oh yeah, I'll read them right after this. I'll read them right okay, after this. Okay. Because okay. they're piling up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are piling up. All right, just one second here. Here, let me move us. Okay, here we go. Uh, the big dog is the big draw there. <laughs> I, I need milk. I need milk. Oh no. I need milk. Acting. Acting. I need, I need milk. I need milk. <laughs> I need milk right now. Where, where the best part comes up, where he's like wondering what the chat's saying while he's crying. Oh, like, what are, what are milk, people saying? Milk right now, please. Milk. 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 Oh, fuck it. Oh my god. Help. Help. It's burning. Okay, it's burning. 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 Fuck. Oh fuck. my god. This is like a, this is like a scene in Oz where he's like, like one of the black men are raping one of the like the white dudes in the uh, thing. He's getting sucked in the ass by Adabisi at this very moment. 
mean the tits bit? Give me the tits bit, Alaska. Holy fuck. Ladies and gentlemen, he's blind. That's it. We win the world. If only, if only. It's the most embarrassing moment. I've just sent to you, oh. Andy, on Discord. Uh, this is where he just is like, I love you, Dr. Duke. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah let's just finish this because I, I want to hear him say, what's the chat saying? What's the chat saying? <laughs> we got you, mate. Help. Help. We got you go. can't see anything. Just calm okay, down. Calm Take down. a breath. All right. Take a breath. All right, I need man. more now. Please. <laughs> it's a VIP. I'm sorry. He got hit with bear mace. This gathering has been declared to be another. Okay, yeah, it's a, a, a unlawful gathering. But um, hang on, hang on, real fast. Let me just uh, I read these. Uh, yeah, Go. yeah. Can we have a lot here? Go. Uh, Go. Hang on, let me, let me just put on my notepad here. Um, and Shuka Ray, thank you so much for uh, that massive support. Hang on, where where are we Double again? Romans. We got. A big digger neck for a time. Whoa. <laughs> no, Whoa. I, I, it's the name big digger neck uh, for a diamond saying, Amen, brother Andy. Amen. Amen, brother Andy. D Shatner Andy. For, for a diamond saying, Make it rain those loonies. Neurox, to subscribe for a month. Thank you so much, dude. Renegotiate for a diamond saying, Canada with uh, the. Uh, uh, a factorial coal powered TVs on lock. Uh, we got my name's nobody for a ninja gaity saying she government Gouda for a she government Gouda for a diamond saying PPP equals a continental treasure. Wow, true, that's a, that's real, a, the real donor, that's real just donor. a Canadian treasure, uh, the continental donor. treasure, but when. Will I be the intercontinental treasure? I'm coming for that intercontinental title belt there. Be the fucking champ. Fucking big dog with the big arms. We got... Uh, oh, shit. Here we go again. All right. Governor Gouda for a diamond. PPP shall be the conscious of the USA. There you go. Larry and MD for a diamond. St. Kyler, join at Mr. Bill for a vape chat. Uh... Uh, B B Discord, Discord, Discord. Big Digger Nick for a diamond saying PVP's enthusiasm is great. Tuesday for a True. diamond. Thank you so much. Yes, I got for a Ninja Gini saying I'm late. I'm late, I'm late. <laughs> so here's a Ninja Gini. LOL. Thank you so fucking much. It's been hilarious so far. Uh, you will first, never be forgiven. Uh, first, uh, if she showed you her tent, she, you would, she would, you would, yeah. Oh, yeah, you'd, she sent me a fucking fold, nude picture. I would fucking. You'd fold it a second. First, last oh, yeah. one, Ninja Gini yells, Medic! 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 Thank you, first, Medic. last one. Uh, yes, I got for a diamond saying we can't see video though, but I switched it at the we time. That's, um, that's, that's, a whole, that's an old diamond. Uh, Mr. Bill for a diamond, please link this video. Uh, just search Make Alaska Maced. Actually, that's actually a, probably a bad one to search now because there's probably 800 more videos that are on top of that now. Search I Need Milk. I Need Milk. Uh, Sugar Tits for a diamond saying, read this dono. Cheers, lads. Mr. Bill for a diamond. I've gone through that. He's a bitch. And Jessica for a diamond just to support the show. And hi to all the new followers. And I see the Ralph Raid. Ralph sent all, all, all his people there. Uh, to watch the show. Thanks, Ralph. Hope you're enjoying your time. There you go. The winning is endless. The Whoa. winning is endless on this program. Now, now okay. So we we have two videos that PPP you set is sent. So he went from BuzzFeed to Charlottesville to far right to the they will not replace us. The the the, the, the chance, right? People. Yeah. Yeah. The Jays or whatever we call them, the blue Jays here. Um, oh, now, hold on, put on I love you, Doctor Duke. I just sent it to you on yes, Discord. Put, I, on, I'm gonna put on that on, put that on, and okay. then you Here know we. we're gonna we'll move on. Yeah. There's a lot. But then we're gonna see his abrupt shift into becoming uh, a leftist grift or disavowing <laughs> the right. Dude, I remember that day, man. I remember when I was going, "What a fucking puss!" All right, here we go. I'm gonna. Increase the screen here for y'all to see. All right, check this out, everyone. 
Baked Alaska is great. This is great. Baked Alaska, I honor you for your courage in this event, too. I love you, Dr. Now, listen, when you get back to the park, well, we love you, too. I never saw you. This is so gay. Where did you find it? What happened? It is. What the fuck? Oh, I just remember it from that day. Like, this is like, this is what he's known for. Like, just total, total laugh slur. We really respect Dr. Duke. I love you, Dr. Duke. I love you, Dr. Duke. We love you too, Bait. We love you. Too. That's so good. When we get so back to the park. Well, we love you too. We, we really respect. Love wow. We were. Oh, he's not a Bait. <laughs> we love you too. Yo, yo, what do you think Dr. Wow. Duke would say in. in, in and in, no. the love tonight. The rhythm of the night. Oh. <laughs> Well, here's the thing. He says, he says, I love you, Dr. Duke. But Dr. Duke replies, we love you. That's yeah, the classic. That's yeah, the classic. We, wow, yeah. We love you. you. We, we, love we, we you. all love and, you. I don't think they, even even the whitest of nationals want fucking baked, gone. Like, it's honestly, it's unbelievable. I'll, I'll say this about, about, about Nick Fuentes, America First, those guys. Look, those guys, it's like, you preach about, hey, you know, degeneracy, gay shit is, is wrong. Hey, we have to save the white race. Hey, you know, fucking, you know, Israel, all this bullshit. Yet they can't. Like, you can't. Like, look, if you were Bates' friend before, fine. But you should go, listen, I used to be friends with this guy. He's a retard. He doesn't represent any. He went on oh, wait stage a with Nick wait last a minute, week. Wait a minute. Go. Andy, 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 Andy. Go. So I've just sent you the clip that sh he should have never been in America first. He shouldn't have any credibility on the right wing because of the video I sent you. It's a bit shoot link, which is kind of fucked because it's been scrubbed from YouTube. Here is Bake denouncing the alt right, denouncing hey white What's supremacy. Okay. We we had played this on the show before. Actually, we played this on the show before. Yeah, back but in the day. Is, but we're, we're doing this is what honestly, he's about. We're doing the greatest hits right now. We're doing the, the entire hits. story all the way to what happened. And goddamn, when I sent both of you that that sheet, which we'll show at the you know at the end of this this tale, God, we were all fucking laughing. But here's what happened after. I love you, David Duke. Hey, you know Jews, what are you guys doing? when You're not gonna replace it. He went on, and then this happened. Hey guys, what's going on? Baked Alaska here. Hey, he does he not look, look really gay here? Hair. He looks he gay, looks right? So gay. Yeah. He's trying. He's trying to project this gay aura because at this time he was trying to get on the left wing grift. All of them could smell the grift yeah. from a mile away, and not even pedophiles like Vouch would touch this <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> Nobody will touch him. Amen, Nick brother White. Andy. Nick Fuentes thinks that this homosexual man here is the savior of the white race. This is the key to reaching the Zoomers. Some near 40-year-old fucking cokehead guard there who's a homosexual he fucked up Ashton Birdie's mind even more than it was, which is really saying something. Caused her total to break down. Well, I just want to ask you about I want to ask you about that. And to, the, and to the Spurg who writes all in caps in chat, yeah, I'm gonna fucking ban you if you're if you're fucking gay in chat and you're fucking writing caps 18 times trying to get my attention. Like you're cool. Like I don't. We don't allow show is, nobody gay. Show is gay enough as it is. Exactly. There's a lot of there's a lot of homoeroticism going on. Yeah. Captain Picard's head looking like a circumcised cock. <laughs> <laughs> My penis is getting erect just looking at him. Now, wait, he blamed this video on Ashton Birdie says Mega Man X. Is that true? It's bullshit. Baked Alaska doesn't give a fuck what anybody has to say. He only cares about his own grift. He doesn't give a fuck about that dumb slut with the big titties. No. He don't no. care. Don't Yo, care. We, so when he says that we he found that like video personally moved. Hey, did you ever see that? Okay, chat. Okay, I get it. The, the, okay, I shouldn't have said anything. Uh, but uh, the the fucking uh, that that clip. Did you ever see that clip? It was like the finale with Ashton Birdie and him at his house. Oh. Yeah, 
I never had seen that until like a month ago. And I'm like, wait, what the fuck is this? Because she like, she's an attractive girl, right? And she's like, she seemed pretty chill before. But wasn't she like always a bit off the wall psycho bitch or? A little bit weirdo, oh, yeah. Oh, I'll, give, I'll give you the rundown. So basically, Ashton Birdie starts posting videos to her YouTube channel. They are immediately very popular because on the conservative right, there is, how do we say, a lack of female voices, a lack of female representation. Which is honestly probably yeah. Which, you know, depending on your perspective is a good thing or a bad thing. But anyway, she posted her videos. They were doing well. So Alex Jones calls her out to Austin, Texas to audition for InfoWars. At this time, Paul Joseph Watson spit roasts her, fucks the shit out of her. Whoa. And dumps, and dumps her to the curb. PJW fucks her. He did it. But Alex Jones... According to her, she was sexually abused by Alex Jones, all sorts of lies. Wait, what? Alex, Wait, Alex, what? She says that she says that like she was sexually pressured at InfoWars and people were like uh, sexually harassing her. It's all just a cope. Because what happens is they send her out as an on the street reporter and she's doing okay, but then she just gets she's just an airhead, right? Like she's not actually smart on her feet. She was able to get away with scripted videos, with jump cuts, right? Disguising the fact that she's an airhead. Uh -huh. She goes out on the street, gets exposed by some dumb liberal woman, and they fire her from InfoWars. <clears throat> she has a fucking mental breakdown, fucking spirals, says everybody abused her at InfoWars. Stops making videos for a couple months because she wanted to make this her livelihood or whatever. Yeah. She comes back, gets with Baked Alaska. Baked Alaska puts her in that Yang Gang music video. If nobody's seen oh, yeah. Yang Gang, Yang Gang. <laughs> yeah. It's really it's fucking gay. Red. Really gay. It's yeah. bad. It's bad. It's one of the cringiest videos ever made. And he's made a lot of them, oh. and that's the worst one he's made. Surfer, Surfer likes Yang Gang. Whoa, he does. Hey. He likes it somehow. That's somehow, fun. Surfer likes it. Machine. Okay, fair uh, enough. Fair enough. Okay. The elliptical machine. <laughs> anyway, it's just the Yang Gang. Just imagine Surfer on the elliptical. He's fucking going Yang Gang, Yang Gang, <laughs> Yang Gang, Yang Gang. You know he's going. Oh, fuck. That's fucking okay. So, all right. So, so she ends up with baked Alaska. Yeah. Baked exacerbates her mental issues. Yeah. Potentially, she has a full-on mental breakdown, threatens to call the police on Bake, threatens to cut herself. Uh, yeah, that's Bake's the one we saw. Yeah. That... <laughs> Didn't she say she wanted, to have, like, five, she wanted to have five? I remember his lowest of the low before he came back on DLive this time and then now on YouTube and then Bant. But before that, he was. I just the last time I saw him, he had like 10 viewers while he was playing Kingdom Hearts with... Ashton mm -hmm. Birdie, right? It and was bad. It was It sad. was insane. It and was then, a low I'm, point. I'm going to take a leak of beer bag. Yeah, do it up. Uh, hey, hang on. I also, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll take a piss when Kyler gets back. But, All right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Basically, uh, fucking Ashton. It's okay, Kyler. You take your time. You you have a good long piss break, buddy. We <laughs> love you. Anyway, fucking... She fucking fucks off there and leaves the internet completely. Now she's apparently trying to become a mother there and a trad wife, but who fucking knows? She She's like self-diagnosed with the Spurgers as a woman, which is a big red flag up there. So yeah. I don't know who's wifing her up, but she does have some voluptuous tits. There, I mean, I mean so. you, can't, you can't disagree, right? You're just being you observant. Really no. Yeah, so it is like, what it like, is. But like, that's you, like you'd throw it, right? You you throw it. Oh fuck yeah! It's the Ashton and Ashton raw dog. <laughs> Ashton, 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 that's hilarious. If, if we got married, we'd have the identical name. Yeah. I don't know what would happen Whoa, then. Oh, that's actually fucking hilarious. I didn't think of that. Uh, I, I I thought of it because I had the fantasy at one time, but then I learned. <laughs> Don't fuck crazy. Uh, oh. Sometimes you do, but, but you always regret it. You always, you always. But you know what's funny? It's like when you regret it, you sort of like, oh, okay, you're gonna like 
smart enough for next time. Baked Alaska. But then he you only don't. sticks but then his you dick don't. in crazy. He, he sticks his dick in crazy every. Ashton, then Sammy. Oh my God. Dude, Sammy that's where. That's what I started watching you like a lot was I ran into your baked bonanza. We had done. We had watched that like live. That remember the Derek and Sammy and that whole thing. We watched it live like while it was happening on our show. Then I watched your thing on it, and then I was like, "Yo, this guy knows like what's going on." <laughs> like, like a lot of people are like, "Oh, it's just content." I'm like, "Yeah, but it's insane. This is crazy that this is real. Oh, this is like this is like you can't <laughs> write this shit, dude." <laughs> There's only one word to describe. It's greasy. Greasy as fuck. Grimy. It's baked I, I content. Grimy, yeah. Sammy. I see the stream I covered in the baked bonanza where he's in like Chicago, in inner city Chicago. Oh like, my God. At the, fried, at the fried chicken restaurant. And he's like on the verge of like full on getting like lynched by this like race riot mob of blacks. <laughs> like they're just surrounding him. They just surround him around the car demanding free fried chicken. Oh, yeah. Baked offered like a piece of chicken to this one black guy. This is suddenly like a swarm of black people. Where my chicken? Where my chicken? This, you know, the guy gets like some free shit. He gets free shit. He starts complaining. There's only one piece of chicken. Where my two You got no respect. You got no respect. Dude, he has he's just got surprised. Yo, I saw that scene. No. It's him. He's got the fucking um. He has the container there on the trunk, and then like all these like, black people he goes, "Yeah, go ahead, everyone, go ahead." I'm like, I would be running like at full speed. Like, get the fuck out of here. It's it's like feeding the seagulls. If the seagulls were like a bunch of gorillas with guns, <laughs> who could shoot you in the head? You know, that's what it would be like. No it's like feeding the seagulls. There was a scary gorillas. There was a scarier moment, by the way. There was a scarier moment that night where he's walking down the street and uh Chag had left somewhere and these two black dudes, these two homeless guys are talking to him. Uh, yeah. And then he goes, uh, hey, uh do you Kyler, you were there for that. He goes, Hey, do you have uh like a uh, a bait in Chicago. He goes to the black guy. The black dude's like, hey, bro, do you have any money? He's like, no, I don't got any money. Sorry, man. He goes, yeah, there's an ATM right there. And I'm like, run! Ah! Get the fuck out! Oh, my God. Fucking, uh, hang, on, hang on. Let me just catch up on these real quick. Raging Humanist for a diamond saying, I volunteer to be, and by the way, everyone who's donating tonight, thank you guys so much. You're also generous. Um, uh, I volunteered to be Nick's new uncle, fuck baked. And we got Larry Whoa. in MD uh, for a ninja guinea. Massive don't know. Thank you. He says, he says, I've been maced by police. It stings your eyes and nose runs, but you can see fine baked Alaska is act was acting. Honestly, I he was definitely like he's just a puss. I think I think like he's like one of those there's guys. Not, there's not one second of Baked's life where he isn't acting. Baked is the most fake motherfucker I've ever seen. He is the lowest of the low. I have almost more respect for child molesters than I do for Baked. He's only, Damn. He's only He's only slightly higher than the kid diddlers. I actually a little bit. Murderers. I get a little bit. I a respect, little bit. I respect murderers more than baked Alaska. I, I respect bank robbers more than baked Alaska <laughs> because at least they have some balls. Whereas he's just a fake ass motherfucker. Hang on, people are saying. Okay, one guy said the, the land of 420 just said. Uh, baked was uh, maced with bear mace, not pepper spray. But that's bullshit. He was. Hang on. Nah, here's, how I know, here's how I know uh, it's bullshit. So ooh. when you pepper spray, it was what bear I, mace. You, 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 when you see someone get pepper sprayed, right? Everyone around coughing, especially if it's indoors, or they'll like, get it in their eyes a little bit, unless it's a direct hit. Baked had sunglasses on, and everyone around him was completely fine. So if it was bear mace, everyone would be like, <laughs> like around him. And he was wearing sunglasses the whole time. So what? Like the bear mace like squirted on like a trajectory where it went on like a, 
an angle where it got in his glasses and got directly in his eyes and no one else was affected from that shot. That's bullshit. Look, look, it was we're not retarded. Oh, what we're actually not all- happened was they dropped the sperm bank and was pouring cum into his fucking eyes and it oh. irritated his eyes. Oh, okay. He should have... No. He should have been used to the semen in his eyes because Milo would squirt it in his fucking eyes when he tried to come on his fucking face there after Baked was done tickling his balls there. But That sounds more right. reasonable, to be honest, if you think about it. Hey, Christ. Hang on, let me catch up. Shout out that guy in the chat there. Hang on, let me catch up. On, I, I, I'll pound through these real quick. Uh, Big Digger Nick. It's so hard to say that name. <laughs> for a diamond saying LMAO, great. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, I think Baked Alaska is too tarred to know he's even grifting. I think he doesn't know what he's up. I think he's just a, like, he's like a shell of a man. It's not even like PPP. It's not even acting. It's like, it's like this it is a, autopilot. He doesn't know what else to do. He doesn't he know what else to do. It's he an autopilot, know you know? He's just, that's what he's used to. He's That's what he knows. <laughs> He is, a, he is just a reptile, just a full-on cold-blooded reptile who just tries to blend into his surroundings like a sneaky, like slimy a chameleon a me. crawling around on his belly a real fast like here. a snake. A Shuka Ray, I just tipped 10 on stream elements. Thank you so much, Shuka Ray, saying, I'll say it again, most based guest of the year, by the way. Uh, yeah, you're uh, you're making me laugh a lot, dude. Uh, uh, by the way, obviously baked wasn't bear mace. No, we. Uh, that's not even, I'll stand that's, by that's that. Even, it's fake and gay. That's not even questioning Shukare. Yeah, no one is. Nah. No one's arguing that nah. at all. Hang on, it's, I'm gonna fill up my wine, boys. I'm gonna fill up my wine. Be right back. Go ahead. Yeah, you good? You good? One you sec, good? guys. Are you get, he's getting the boxed wine together. There. He's hitting the bottle. I hit the bottle a little too hard, a little too early. I got a little torn up. I'm not oh, I'll have another shot. Tyler. You think I should? Do you think I should? We're gonna all do more shots. The surfers say I should do it. He does, here. Surfers I, here. I'm currently I'm chilling the bottle on my windowsill. It's chilling to, oh, to... We want to see you puke on stream like Cog the Cuckold. I did puke one time, but I did it like down here where no one could see me. That's so like it was going, buddy. the gray goose. I don't drink vodka. That's for fucking Russians. Oh shit, we may not have enough for two shots. Oh no, I mean That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Here's the here's the problem I'm having is like the the, the liquor made me tired. Like I took some Excedrin though without with caffeine in it. So yeah. I should well, be okay. I need to get you on uh three, four energy drinks like I'm on there, buddy. Fucking your heart's took, gonna explode. I'm like four hundred pounds. I used to be well in. I used to be on that. And then I then I I, I, I I cut the caffeine from my life and I, I, I don't like it. Caffeine's amazing. Caffeine belongs in your life. It's it's a uh, superpower. So I'm gonna um, hit the bottle. I'm gonna hit it for it. I'm gonna hit it for my for my Canadian brothers, PPP and Surfer. Let's fucking go. Cheers, ah, gentlemen. Ah, you shot. Yeah. Cheers. Okay. You fucker, you. Hey, real fast here. We got cover <sighs> Kuda for a diamond saying PPP equals a birdie equals Wignat equals based. Uh, Christopher Waffen for a diamond saying who invited Gilbert Godfrey on here? A government Gouda for a diamond saying baked equals lifetime breakdown. Uh, low is sticks. Uh, followed. How, how you doing? Gouda for a diamond. Baked equals lifetime failure equals total loss. Government Gouda for a diamond saying Kyler get on TRS. Um, okay. I'm there. I'm already there. Um, We're here. Uh, 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 we got to, we got Larry and MD for a ninja guinea. Thank you so fucking much, man. Massive dono saying, uh, Baked Alaska is a fucking lying pussy. He starts True. problems for content. I can't wait to see his ass True. kicked. True. A hole Anderson for a diamond saying, Don't forget who started this all. Sweet Aaron. Wow. True. Real dono. Real Jesus. Dono. That's picking kind of... boogers. Sweet. If you guys don't, oh, don't know, even. Sweet... Oh, no, no, no. Boy, not... Here mute, we go. Mute, uh, de- de- you can deafen and mute yourself. You don't want to hear I this. Hate, but... I hate this. This is the de- worst. Deafen and mute yourself until I do this. 
When I do that, it's okay to listen again. Just all. If you guys, if you guys don't know, Sweet Aaron is the lot lizard meth addict fucking drug addled thought that initially put the chink in the armor of baked Alaska. And Mr. Medicare laid into him, and then Sweet Aaron picked right. boogers out of her pussy and, oh. and ate them. Oh, and uh. <laughs> Ice, yeah. And Ice Poseidon's fucking remember that closet stream they had? Yep, that she was there. Yeah, those guys are fucked. Um, I mean, if you think about it, and the, you think of the kind of the whore that Sweet Aaron is, is it really wow. that? Is it really that nuts, Andy? Is it really that crazy? PvP, no. what do you think? Is it is it that crazy to imagine that this trailer trash fucking whore picked boogers out of pussy and ate? Is it that crazy? Well, not like, really. You know, it's, no, it's considering just considering. Like, Considering faked is fucking some woman last week who queefs in the bathtub oh, while she's shaving her vagina. Oh, no, bro. That video was brutal. PvP and Andy, not okay. It's okay, okay, okay. Listen, like the queefing is one thing. It's like okay, whatever. Your pussy burps. Okay, cool, whatever. Whoa. But she left her dog in a fucking cage for three days Insane. to die. To die. Look. Are you kidding? me? Come look, on, like every, like, I would say, and like big doctor for five days. This is, look, look, wait, 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 look, wait, 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 just disturb people, like and I don't want to. Right. This will happen. Surprised. But here's the thing, though: is like <laughs> I could, I could take one look at Alice and know that she lives like that. She lives like a slob. She's fucking broken. No. She's a broken person. That video, no, I saw that too. But that video, PPP showed on his like that clip that that we watched the other night. When I saw her room, I was like, "Wait, what the? Like, where, first of all, where did you find that?" On IP wins or some shit? Yeah, it's IP2 that always that win. Yeah, yeah. So, look, here's the thing. The funniest part of the video is she's eating cereal out of the bag, right? <laughs> like she's eating cereal out of the and, Ziploc bag. But and you know is, why? She's got milk poured in. Wait, she's wait, got wait, milk poured in. Wait, PPP. 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 You, you, know, you, know, you, know, you know why she was, she was eating cereal with milk out of a, out of a bag, right? She's too lazy to wash any dishes. Oh, wow. she's, a fucking oh, yeah. Yeah. she's too lazy to clean her shit. Holy fuck, she is dude. Exactly what it is. But Gross. there's one thing when some... But even I, a dirty fucking guy in his early 20s, isn't doing that shit. No, that's insane. That's insane. I've seen her use the dirty well, ball that her fucking Ziploc bag. The, the dishwasher made things milk. so easy. The dishwasher made things no. so easy. You can put a dirty dish in the even, dishwasher if you could one, it'll clean it. I'll even one up you on that. Yeah, people even, who live in poverty like this don't have wait, access wait, to wait, but wait, 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 wait. Even Ra Ra here's Ralph. Here's Ralph. Here he is. What's up, Ralph? Ralph! Oh. Okay, you know what? Can you hear me? Yes. Oh, what, a, what a surreal moment. <laughs> it's happening. It's happening live right now on Subculture. Oh, oh shit, bro. How you doing, brother, man? What are you drinking? Ralph, what are you drinking right now? I'm drinking a steam whistle from oh. fucking Toronto. <laughs> This is insane, I, by the way. This is like legend. Like, if you guys know anything legendary. about lore right now, this is legendary right now. <laughs> What's going on? Here? Don't so, know. Okay, don't now I switched it over to the phone. I can hear now. All right. My apologies. I've had a few drinks, gentlemen. You know how it oh, goes. We. Yeah. Oh, we. Are you? Uh, like most days. <laughs> like most days. <laughs> That's true. Like most days. <laughs> Uh, bro, bro. How you guys doing? I hope you're having a show. I figured I'd stop by. You know what's going on there? Yeah, yeah. Well, I eat the big dog. I eat the big dog. Was on some culture that I had to stop by. Hey, guys. Wait, guys. Wait, yeah. wait, 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 wait. We have the N word blaring in my speakers. Someone donated fifty bucks on Stream Elements, and it's thirty seconds. It's thirty seconds long of Kim's stuff. 
There's a $100 donation for this moment, Derek. Yeah. It's I can think of no better way to there. commemorate this moment, to this, be quite honest with you. This is legendary. Oh, Guys, yeah. if, if, if y'all don't know, uh, uh, you know, Ralph and PPP, I've had a back and forth for, I'd say, a couple of years now. This is very surreal. I don't I don't know what, like, I, th none of this is plan i mean we don't have a plan with this i mean i do ralph oh. i've been ralph i've been hitting the jaeger dude i'm fucking drunk <laughs> what's going on dude i'm hitting the jaeger dude i'm drunk as fuck standing Let's in the go. alley behind this fucking bar with my sandal propping the door open so i can get back in <laughs> i want to be a part of this legendary nine. fucking night a $9 Walmart sandal. <laughs> <laughs> That's correct. Nine full American dollars were spent on these fucking trashy sandals, and they're doing their job right now, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, nine, nine US dollars is like a million Canadian, Ralph. You know, <laughs> yeah. I'm going down. That's true. Hey, He's going to get me down on thank you, sir. Now I can put my shoe back on. <laughs> I, uh, I tune in to this fucking show that you're doing there, and the first thing I see is you put up your sandal flip flop. <laughs> you know, it was pretty bad. Wait. We got, it was pretty bad. We got another Team Star donation, another 50 bucks. My God. Shukare, I'm going to read those in a second, but guys, we have. 20 more seconds of Keen Star saying the N word. Hang on. It's it's so loud. Shout out to Keen Star! <laughs> God damn. Wait, wait. So, so, so Ralph, Let's wait. Let's get him on here. Wait. Let's have him reenact it live. Oh, oh. Well, Sugar Ray said based Ralph, and Sugar Ray said for another 50, based drunk Ralph. Thank you so much, Sugar Ray. And uh, yeah, Ralph, man, how, how's your trip so far, man? Man, it's been crazy, honestly. Dude. I almost fought some fat Cuban bitch on the street late yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> um, they doxed my address. They've been trying to get me kicked out, but I'm still going, Wolfie. You know how I do. Uh, you know how it was. Look, I'll say this. It took them hours and hours to find the fucking hotel. <laughs> they're really starting to slow off. It should have been faster. I, I thought the same there. thing. You motherfuckers just slagging off. Just from the it. corner of that picture, no. you should have had it within 15 minutes. Are no. like, you fuckers that fucking dumb? My like, people, seriously. My people had it within 15 minutes. My people <laughs> had it within 15 minutes. My people are hitting and the Jaeger right not, now. Hitting the Jaeger. Bro, bro. The key wait, wait, we wait. need to step it up in terms bro. of destroying you. Brian Dunn, Brian Dunn, King of Paws, has said he's coming for you, Ralph. He's in the oh, area. No. He's going to kick oh, no. your ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I guess, you know, oh, no. oh no, you know, his dad, I guess <laughs> he should probably focus on his dad and his child porn habits and Whoa. shit like that. No. Oh, oh. oh. Papa Dunn, no. Papa Dunn, what did you do, By baby? The way, oh. Ralph, Ralph, you know what, I, I laughed, I laughed when I, when they were trying to dox you, like before they did, I see this message on Kiwi Farms, that you tweeted it. Someone said, okay, everyone, look for the Airbnb with a painting <laughs> and a table. I, and I, I usually don't. You can't even find it. <laughs> <laughs> it's, because, it's because anybody who was anybody A-logging Ralph left town when the sub forum came in. Because it's just a cancer. All the, all the newbies are coming in, coming in like just a swarm of maggots. <laughs> They want, they want to make you the next DSP, the next Anision. And you know what? They might succeed. But look, I told them if they do that, he'll make more money. They don't listen. <laughs> they don't listen. Yeah, yeah. Set me up for life. Please don't do that. Oh, my God. Yeah. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> it is what it is. Josh Moon is a pedophile. You know, it is what it is. Oh, oh, oh no. It's sad. It's sad. It's sad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. oh, my I mean, little you can't say that. Take that about Josh Moon. They get really upset. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Oh, you know, oh. Joshua Moon sent me free t shirts after I cost him two grand a month. <laughs> free t shirts. Wait, wait, wait. How did dude, you. Dude, he could not choke your dick down fast enough 
And you were literally fucking it. up his whole life. I'm like, what in the fuck, dude? I don't even I know, man. It. I love it. Wait, I wait, love wait. it. Wait, wait, sorry, I love sorry. Hang on, guys. Danny pause, Bush. pause. I need some lore here. How did PPP, how did you <sighs> get lose him to ground yeah, I mean, basically, he kind of destroyed New Project 2. He was, like, making fun of Josh and, like, Jenny, Josh, this motherfucker came up with that. Like, all this shit, just roasting him every day. Jenny, Josh you. is like a fan of his. Like, like he's starstruck talking to PPP. Like, I, I don't even... It's kind of strange. It's really, it really is kind of strange. I don't know. It really... You know what? Life is strange. Life is strange. Life is strange. We're living it right now here live on Subculture. <laughs> yeah, but I, <laughs> it's just a real moment. It's like Eric Bischoff on the WWF. Holy <laughs> shit! Man. This is the man, Eric Bischoff, live right here. This is hugging oh, hug on the show. It's like wait. Austin and McMahon hugging the fans. They're angry. They're angry, bro. We got They're angry. It's the go away heat, bro. <laughs> we, got, we, we got another 20 from Shukare. He's fucking dropping them fucking dollars over on Stream Elements. And he said this, Shukare, thank you so much. He said, this is the best stream of his life. Like, this is fucking... This, this is, is incredible. This Are you kidding me? Also, Update from this bar, there was just a fight while I went outside to talk on the phone. Yeah. The police are outside and they're closing down the fucking bar oh, and I lost everybody. Oh, <laughs> no. Oh, oh shit. Look. Good. No, there's mad we get, There was some kind of fight in there. When are we yeah. get live stream? When are we getting the live stream from the compound? Uh, Where is Gator? Where is he? Yeah, you know, I was going to do one earlier, but uh, we stayed out a little bit later than I had planned. Um, so I'll do one probably at least before we get. I mean, I already know where it's at now. There's no need to worry about that. So, fuck it, man. Uh, fuck it, man. Fuck it. Yep. Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck dude, it. Fuck dude, it. That's, that's fucking. Um, I'm, this is fucking. Is Gator making nuts. Oh. Is Gator there? Gator making. Gator's not here. No. Ah, oh, boo. Oh! 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 <laughs> This is oh, uh, you, you, I, I almost went. I almost went. Uh, hmm? I was hoping with the Godwinson donation that you would bankroll Gator to go. Actually, I was gonna bankroll, but uh, he's got a test on Monday, so like, I was only gonna bankroll one. Oh, you oh. fucking nerd! <laughs> Come on, dude. <laughs> What a loser! It was all a loser. He's going down. Gators, Gators, awesome! Wait, what the fuck, Ricardo? What's up? The red Gators ice is in the chat million, too, by the way. We have, oh, dude. we have red <laughs> ice in the, the chat. What the fuck just happened? Wow! Holy shit! Four hundred and fifty dollar Boss Hog Whistle Pig whiskey dropped on the ground and broke. <laughs> It's not true, Ralph. It's not true. That's just the way it goes. 170 buck whiskey I'm fucking oh. drops. I gotta yeah, say, it's Ralph, I, it's good. I gotta yeah, say, no. you shot your own Vito. I called it a few days ago. You own Vito. You want to talk to me? Crush Vito. Well, I don't think he's listening. I don't think he's listening. Yeah, let me. Let's see if we can dox them. Hang on. What is, oh, you got another thing. Yeah, there he is. There he is. The Mississauga fucking goon. Wait, who's this? <laughs> who's this? Who's this? Who's that? Fucking uh, who? Greg Simon's hanging that up with you. Who? <laughs> What are you talking? I don't know what you're saying. I, I feel I feel more drunk than I am. Let's go go. On. Wait, who is this? What uh, the fuck? I saw it. Dude, yeah, I saw dude, it. You, 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 whoa! I don't know. Wait, Bro, wait. Pause the stream. By some homeless guy. Who is this? Pause the stream. First class. <laughs> wait, but shut up, whoever you are. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. First class. Just drop that fucking name. Yo. What are you doing? Can you punch this guy, Ralph? Who this guy is? Can you physically assault him for me? I'm back. Oh, was that Ryan Long? Was that Ryan Long? Yeah, well. Alright, I'm back. 
oh, world's wait, most wait, famous wait. comedian wait, who never wait, made me laugh. Wait, wait, you know, when you're VIP, wait, you're VIP. Wait, TV, wait, TV, wait, TV, wait, you know, I need everyone to pause for 10 oh, seconds. Yeah. Oh, I'm always TP pimping. You know how it is there. Yeah. That's the big dog. <laughs> Holy fuck. Yeah. Hit, hit two clips out on that block. That fat bitch used to walk it off when he left. Fuck, fuck that fat yeah. bitch T clip. She'll be tweeting about this for weeks. She'll be tweeting about this for weeks. PPP sold out. I bought in. He's gonna out. put I your big in. ass on the treadmill, you fucking heifer. <laughs> Holy fuck. We better make that fat bitch do some fucking hey, weight. Hey, hey, we fat you and we we make moves, we make money. If you're a fat bitch, you're disgusting. You're disgusting, and you should go. Taste it. Andy's put some pine. Andy's put pine cones in bitches. Still better than Jesus Christ. <laughs> and even you know, I wouldn't put, put it on that fucking fat bitch on the t clip. I'm ironically talking to girl. No, Pancom girl is like fucking, I don't know, Audrey Hepburn compared to this fat bitch. Are you kidding me? Like, <laughs> you, <laughs> yo, yo, Ralph, oh, Ralph, Ralph. Uh, hey, Ralph. Dude. Hey, Ralph, I Ralph. would eat ice cream out of Pinecone Girl's ass before I would Wait. even fucking shuttle tea grips in my general vicinity, that Ralph. nasty bitch. Ralph, Ralph, <laughs> Ralph. Hey, hey, Ralph, will you repl uh, re repeat that story, what I t told you on the phone after I, I fucked Pinecone Girl that day at... Uh, Give her a cold quarter pounder. We had ordered a bunch of... Uh, so Dick Masterson had ordered a bunch of McDonald's the night before... And there was a, <laughs> the gold, there was a bunch of quarter pounders left, and he invited the bitch over to fuck or whatever. He couldn't get rid of her. She like a bad case of fucking herpes or some shit. Like, he couldn't get rid of this bitch. And she wouldn't fucking leave. I, I called him on the phone. I was like, is that fucking bitch still at the fucking house? He's like, what in the fuck? Get rid of her. Give her a cold quarter pounder and send her fucking ass on the way. And then once he goes, no, nah, actually, I just sent her on the way, but I ate the cold cream in myself. <laughs> I'm like, she, I'm like, I'm like, sorry, bitch, there's only one quarter pounder left. Get the fuck out. And then, she uh, like, Where's McDonald's leftovers? Get out, bitch. Uh, um, that, he, the yeah. white whale would have ripped off Andy's leg to get to that cold <laughs> quarter pounder. <laughs> the white whale. I would have never let it go. No, I would have never let it go. Fucking legend. Oh. By, by the way, real fast, uh, I'll read all donos in a sec. But first, last, sent a nin fucking jet. <laughs> Holy fuck. Thank you. First, last. He's, Thank you. He, he's loving this. I'll read everything in thor uh, thoroughly. Uh, guys, everyone who's been supporting, thank this you. This shit's happening right now, guys. Yo. You got to understand. Oh, my God. This shit's happening. But this, is, this is legitimately fucking legendary. This is fucking incredible. This is like, this is like nuts uh, how, how this is all going down. But, you know, it's like... When I had to call in. I had to call in. I had to do it. We're live. I'm in the middle of Tampa. Ranting and raving, walking around these blocks. I had to be a part of history tonight. Ralph, are you hitting the bottle? Are you hitting the bottle? Well, dude? yeah. They literally I'm just came to the bottle. Hit the bottle. No, it was literally a broken no. bottle of whiskey. They said, "Have a sip." I'm like, "Okay, whatever." Like, I don't even know what's going on, really, but whatever. Ralph, I'm drinking a fucking fifth of Jägermeister with you, my man. Oh, dude. <sighs> This no, is fucking oh, my god. That would probably set me on the top. money Godwin sent you. With the money Adam sent you, you need to be drinking more, buddy. You need the expensive <laughs> bottles. <laughs> Only the best. Uh, Only the best. Merry Christmas, Godwinson. We love you, sir. Thank you for oh, hey, sponsoring this trip. I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a piss real quick. I'll be right back. Do it, do it, dude. <laughs> Do it. Fuck. Uh, uh, yeah. Tyler has to take a piss every like five minutes. Yes. Ladder of a woman. Well, there. no, no, it's the We need to treatment. get more shots in the Captain, <laughs> Captain Picard Skeletor here. Need some more fucking shots. <laughs> everyone, cri hey, everyone, Christ is king. You know, he's, he's <laughs> fuck off. Ethan Ralph has spilled more liquor on his shoes than Kyler could drink in a night. There you go. <laughs> Holy. So, it's the truth. 
Oh, so what's the plan for you tonight, Ralph? What are you going to be doing? Um, you know, I had to get a part of this segment. I had to be a part of history tonight. So I called in. I don't know. I guess we're about to catch an Uber. They just threw everybody out of the bar. People are stumbling around. I called you an Uber. I called you an Uber. I called you an Uber. Yeah, it's like poetry. Oh, I'm about to I'm a fucking gold star Uber member. Yeah, I'm about to call it up. They're going to roll up with the VIPs. Somebody's got to hold this shit down. <laughs> oh, Ralph. Oh, 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 fuck, buddy. Jesus. Oh, my God. I mean, Save me. you had me on the show. Thank it was you, great. Bro. I think we're gonna wait. do this. I think we're gonna do this again in the future. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, Ralph. Hopefully, you're drunk enough tonight to enjoy the Ronnie Ralph review, buddy. <laughs> I'll check that out, sir. <laughs> by the way, so I hope you do. The surfer was saying hi. By the way. Oh, hello, surfer. I Goodbye, saw Thanks yeah. for having me yo, on the show, yo, sir. Yo, yo, have fun, man. I'll see what you Monday, buddy. Fair. I'll see you Monday, buddy. <laughs> All right, all, right, see you all right, yo, peace out, bro. Love you, buddy. My God, wow, that was that was a segment, dude. Come on, like who who bring? Whoa, hey, whoa! Oh, cause he left. I have to resize the windows. One second here. Hang on. Hang on I'll figure it out. I'm taking a piss too with my girly bladder there. All right. I have a masculine penis. It's let me resize there. this. Let me resize this. Okay. I'm gonna I'd like to feel a dick inside me. Okay. I'm going to catch up on all those donos, guys. Give me one sec. Here we go. I'm going to link that one. And then got to make a second one over here. Sorry, guys. Because uh, the way Discord re reshapes all that shit. It's kind of annoying. There we go. I think we're good. We'll be back on track right now. Let me read these while everyone's taking a piss right now. Uh, sorry, guys. We were missing those donos, but I mean, what are you going to do, right? We got first last for a diamond saying, this dono is to charge Mr. Picard's phaser up. Uh, first last for a diamond saying, uh, BS on Bear Mace. His face would have been red. That's true. 100%. Uh, I'm just catching up on, on Donos. One sec, dude. Uh, Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, no defending baked Alaska. Are you autistic? Uh, we got first last for a diamond. I've been bear maced. You will cough uncontrollably. Yeah. Oh, we know that's fucking bullshit. Neurox for a diamond saying, BB, uh, PPP baby shot. A critical for a diamond saying, hit the bottle. Jay Starkey for a diamond saying, is this live? Yeah, of course. Obviously, it's live, dude. We got Jessica for a diamond. Uh, thank you so much, Jessica. We got um, first last for a diamond saying, eat boogers. It builds your immunity. We got Cooper for a diamond saying, how much fat black 40 ounce bounce does Surfer get? Um, big digger Nick for a diamond saying, oh shit, here we go. That's when Ralph jumped in. Let me just catch up on these donos real fast. Um, uh, Kyler, we're, we're uh, behind. We're, so, yeah, we're so, good. So, so one second. So we both. Bro, uh, as we both for a diamond saying Ralph, Ralph, Ralph. My name is Ralph, no Ralph, Ralph. My name is nobody for a ninja guinea. Ninja guinea. He says bigger, 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 uh, bigger. We got Swedge Fat's boner for a ninja guinea saying Christmas came early tonight. What a fucking segment. Aho You're goddamn right. Aho Anderson for a diamond saying run, Ralph. King of pole is gonna get your outline. Okay. Um, <laughs> I mean, he doesn't really need the outline. There's the sex tape, right? Well, I mean, Gri you got it. You got it. <laughs> could, could not grow preferred. You know what? Surprisingly, despite, despite the fact that a lot of my fans are gay, <laughs> Brian Dunn still hasn't propositioned me for gay sex, which I find kind of insulting. <laughs> you know, like I thought I was a sexy man, big fucking masculine man to fuck Brian's ass. But yet it hasn't come. His proposition, Godwinson, but not me. And yeah. I'm insulted, goddammit. <laughs> Brian's gonna... <laughs> Brian in the group uh, chat is bleeding oh, out in pain. His anus is bleeding out. Poor Brian. Poor Brian. We got it's okay, Brian Dunn, mad. you've heard the man. Let PvP fill you up. There you, there you go. go. Hang on, hang on. I, Brian, I, Dunn, Brian will tell you the war stories. Gamergate was like Vietnam, guys. For his <laughs> anus. <laughs> 
He was deep in the trenches there fighting Zoe Quinn. His oh. musket had run out of ammo. He was running bayonet charges against that? Big Red, that big fat heifer cunt. And Amen, pop. brother. Amen, brother. Andy. It was saving Western civilization one video game at a time there was King of Fall. Praise be. You know, All right, go ahead. I, you know, I met King of Fall. Remember when I was doing... Uh, and he fucking, was a greasy goblin, right? Yeah, I actually met him at... Bush Gardens in Florida when oh, I was staying did. with Alex. I've remember? seen the clip. Did he ask to suck your cock? Yeah, he wanted to lick my, my fucking my taint, actually. He wanted Why to you suck my fucking cock? Yeah, he wanted a quick fucking taint lick there. Uh, we got Conduct Roiper for a diamond saying the Christmas um, armistice will live on. Let's go. Nick calling for a diamond saying, is it true that baked is Jewish and favorite well, a I animal? Mean. That's two separate questions. Favorite animal is what is it? Favorite animal? Like it says, is it true that bake is Jewish? Question mark. Then favorite animal? Question mark. My favorite animal is a dog. Dogs man is Cats man's best for friend. me. How, how about you, PPP? What's your favorite animal? Well, I almost want to consult Sean of Sean's Animal Corner for what the favorite animal is. But I like myself personally. Walrus. walrus. I identify with. I identify with the walrus. Watching the walrus have sex is similar to my sexual activity rate. Really, there. Watching the walrus go. Fair enough. Uh, Part of a slow but steady. That's it going there. And we got uh, okay. Almost done here. I, I, I promise. Everyone was donating hardcore. Government Kuda for a diamond saying PPP belongs on. TRS network. Would you ever join the TRS network PVP? Well, it just depends if I'm going to sell out to the fucking federal government there and become a shit. No. It just depends. It just depends how much the feds are paying. Now, if they're going to pay the big bucks, I don't have to sleep on a couch anymore than maybe. The chances are they fucking pay less than welfare. So fuck it. Holy, she caught a gifted. Amen. She, she caught a gifted five one one subs. Thank you so much, Kaz, Slimer, the Land four twenty, Blue, and Mario Borzov. Uh, all received those. And first and last for a Nin fucking jet. Thank you so fucking much. Saying this stream needs a Nin jet and some raging humanist. Honestly, your, your first last, honestly, like I love raging and we love having him on all the time, but like it's already so much like like so, like we haven't even covered anything we planned. <laughs> no, no, no. no. We're two hours no. We, we have we have endless time. Yes. We have all the time in the world to cover this. <laughs> the twenty four hours. You gotta get through Diddler Dax. <laughs> Diddler gotta, Dax. Diddler Dax, pedo veto. We gotta yeah. shit on that carbo a little bit. Bro. We gotta make sure. We gotta just get it going. Yeah, yeah. Okay, hang on. Oh, I got the found through this. A Shikori for a ninja kini saying, let's go. Thank you so fucking much. We got. Jessica for a diamond saying this is getting clusterfucky. Uh, it's been intense. Shakori gifted a one month sub to Cart Cartman is sub till 2023. Cartman, stop accepting these subs, dude. Cartman, you're a fucking You're uh, a piece of fucking human garbage, dude. You're Seriously, a dude. I'm wait, wait, wait. I'm this not guy. mouthing any wait, 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 wait. I'm not mouthing Cartman, you are a that, that I, didn't saying, I didn't I, say anything. I didn't say anything. That's all he said. Relax, D. Live. He just said, "Fucker." Calm I down. I didn't say any. I didn't say anything. I uh, didn't okay. anything. We'll continue those donos later. But let's get back to the baked Alaska things, gentlemen, because we'll never get the fuck out. <laughs> we'll never get the fuck to Diddler Dax, and I'm excited for that. Um, you, did Believe you, notice, you and me, my friend. And did you know? And notice how and Pito Vito. Yo, at this point, Pito Vito. Yo, Vito is the yo Vito. He. he I, I, swear I God, want, he, he fucks kids. Dude. I want to break down with you guys how Ethan Ralph handled him. Now that we've broken the fucking bullshit for Ralph, I want to show you guys. I want to break down how Ralph dominated Vito. Oh, he, he did. dominated Vito the other day. Vito is just a little bitch, and I'm saying that is the biggest Ralph hater there is, straight up. But Ralph oh. still won. Vito is a pedo. The truth. Let's okay. go. All right. So Let's go. So, so here's Baked Alaska. We went over the first section fuck, of his past. Fuck bake. We got we got it. We fucked fucked bake. No, 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 no,
the fucking <laughs> arrest. I want to show. I want to. I want to talk about that. Like we can't just move. We will. We will. We have like four more hours. Exactly, and, dude. Yeah. Get Kyler. We we have fucking time. I I want. We're gonna watch this whole fucking video though. This is four minutes long. Hey, Kyler, we just okay, let's roll it, roll okay. it, roll it. Kyler, stop talking, Kyler, Kyler, stop Kyler, talking. Kyler. Oh, no, stop talking, roll it, roll Kyler, it. Kyler, we're not going to pause it, so here we go. I wanted to go. talk to you guys about something a little more serious today. Today, I want to talk to you guys about the New Zealand shooting. It's a little late to talk about, but I feel like better late than never. A lot of people are talking about whether the shooter was left wing or right wing, and I just found that really strange because, to me, all the signs are there that this guy is clearly a right-wing extremist. He had Whoa. a black sun, which is a white supremacist symbol, on the front of his military vest. I mean, I think it was clear as day. This guy was saying things like the 14 words and going on 8chan for... Meanwhile, meanwhile, now, <laughs> he goes around to get gas stations with a Keemstar drop uncensored, just doing that, and then going... Why are you offended? I'm going to mace you if you come up to me. <laughs> get the fuck out of here. Remember the 14... Remember the 14 words is the devil for all you America firsters out there who think he's saving the white race, the baked <laughs> respecters out there. Here he is denouncing 14. the 14 words. <laughs> oh no, server. We must secure an existence. Oh, God, 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 God. We must secure an existence for Tyler, PPP, no. PPP streams and PPP uh, yeah. content. Daka Daka. Daka Daka. Oh, it might be even tougher than saving the white race to secure uh, honestly, existence for yeah, my show. You're probably right. You're probably right. It's pretty tough. It's pretty tough. All the right-wing sites, not to mention, used very similar lingo as Richard Spencer, uh -oh. who we've been calling far Who's now a fucking cucked out bitch, by the way, a gay bitch. Oh, right Biden. Oh, Biden. Years. So why is it now the right wing is trying to make this guy left? Now, I can understand why the right wing is trying to use these optics, but it's not truthful. If you guys don't know, I recently left the alt-right, and I feel like it's my responsibility and duty to give a more honest take on the situation. Now, a lot of conservative pundits have talked about gun control, immigration, whoa, or have whoa. plainly just made it about themselves. But there's something about the situation we can't overlook. And that's that this shooting was highly influenced by internet online meme culture. And I know. Yay. I Come on. That's so fucking gay. Yo, you know, it, it, didn't he write a Imagine. book called Meme Magic? Or he had a ghostwriter do a book called Meme Magic or some shit? Yes. So he wrote a book called Meme Magic where he, he claimed that he invented Pepe. He was sued oh. for claiming he invented Pepe in the book. <laughs> What a fucking loser. He said he was a meme magician. A Man, meme magician. You want to hear a private story? It's funny. So I make it into his apartment when I'm in L.A., right? I don't even know who he is barely, but I know he's an online guy. So whatever. I'm chilling. I walk in. I sit on the couch. He goes, hey, do you notice anything? And I'm like looking around like, what is this guy? I'm like, what is this guy talking about? And he goes. He sort of like leans his head and I'm like looking around. I'm like, what is this guy like leaning at? And then on his coffee table, he's got presented up like a trophy, basically a book, the me magic book. He goes, and then he goes, and I'm like, with the book, he goes, I wrote that book. And I went, cool. <laughs> like, what? It was like three minutes. It was like, not even joking. Three minutes of like me going, what? Like, what are you pointing at? Like, I don't give a, like, that, that book with Pepe on I, I didn't even know who Pepe was at the time or anything. The reality is, not only can Bake Alaska not write a book, but this motherfucker can't even read. <laughs> fucking, this, 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 this man has never even graduated high school, for fuck's sake. He has the, he has the reading levels of a fucking sixth grader. Let's be honest. Let's be honest. He's a fucking reading level of six, 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 six. Kyler, you need some coffee or something, dude. What are you? Yeah, I'm fucking. I, I hit the Jaeger too much. Mm. Too much. Oh, that's good. not enough. Two yeah. more shots no, right now. Not. Two more shots. No, no, Kyler, no, 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 no. Kyler, you, Kyler, you'll be. You'll, you'll have your second wind in like Captain, 30 minutes. Give, give me, give me some time. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Captain this, Picard is struggling. This is. I need on your team, Earl Grey hot. Make it so. This is the hero surfer. Right, He's right. uncorking the Euro Gray. <laughs> Great <laughs> goose, my fucking car. Great goose, buddy. Yeah. Everyone cheers. Yo, PPP, cheers, dude.
Cheers. Fuck it, I just... Oh, uh, let's see what's in this. You're spilling it all over your laptop. That's tough. We're going to have to get the paper towel. have to get the fucking paper towel before you ruin your new fucking laptop. It's going to be okay, kids. All right, all right. Oh, yeah, you have a new laptop there? Yeah, it's it's the, what I've purchased with all the money Ralph paid me off to stop trolling him. <laughs> I made a solid ten grand. There he goes. Uh, Ralph paid paid me the big dollars. There. It's secret. You, that's why this all this is all working because Ralph copped out the money, dude. That uh, got another Jagger shot yeah. into you, Captain. Real you want to see you puke, Captain? No one's puking tonight. We're good. Uh, We're good. <laughs> I, just, I need. Kyler I need. What, Kyler? Kyler, I need, Kyler, are you not shooting a shot with us, buddy? I did it. Dead? I fucking hammered, bro. Like Kyler. I need to. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Kyler needs a nap. I'm like right on the borderline. Of Kyler needs a nap, bro. It's only thirty. It's only thirty-five percent, Kyler. Get 5% discount, bud. Come on. That's true. That's true. Don't, don't, right. don't be a Skeletor. Surfer <laughs> killed the I'm trying. Wrong. I'm trying. Hey, wake <laughs> up, Captain. <laughs> I'm awake. Captain. He'll be fine. He'll be fine in 30 minutes. He, he, he does this all the time. Tyler's trying bro. to get his foot fetish only fans going there. Amen. You like that? The gay, shit? sweaty men in the chat are getting I'm, turned on there. I'm great. If you're gay, it's whatever. Hang on, Kyler, Kyler, Kyler. Are you sure you're not at the glory holes each night, Kyler? That's absolutely not true. The you're hair, not at the wait, truck stop fact, glory no, hole. Actually, incorrect. No, hang on, PPP. This is this is the chemo, right? It does this to him every right, night. Play this. All right, play this all right, through. We all gotta right. move on. Yeah, gotta, yeah, I, we're I, never. I we're never going to finish this. I got to stop blasting Captain Picard. He'll be fine in so. half an hour. Make it so. Kyler, make it so. Kyler, just, just drink water. You'll be fine in half an hour. Sure. Number but one, I'm not make pretend it so. Okay. That this shooting is something that it wasn't. And while I didn't directly influence the shooter, we have to recognize what sort of meme culture did influence him. It was so obvious that this it's guy... Means was radicalized you, by the old yeah, right bitch. and became a right wing extremist. Everything oh, he does is green, the 101 playbook green, for oh. right wing extremists. And I know because I've hung around these guys in the past. He had the 14 oh. words on his rifle. He put his manifesto on 8chan full. That's, wait, pretty, wait, wait, that's pretty basic. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. The same guy that was screaming Jews will not replace us at fucking Charlottesville. What a fucking pussy. What a bitch. You tell us, Captain Picard. Look, tell look, us. look say tell what you us. will. Say what you will, but mean what you fucking say, dude. Like, mean what you fucking say. If you if you say something, mean it. Mean it. Right. Don't fucking go back Let's on this, this shit and then do this fucking gay shit where it's like, oh, the alt right indoctrinated me and made me a part of their meme culture. <laughs> Tyler, you're so, Tyler, you're almost you're almost off camera, dude. You're like falling. Oh, I've instructed Surfer to get the Maker's oh. Mark. Oh my god, is it? I should have told them as soon as Ralph joined the call to get the maker's mark. Yo. And we could have done shots together. Wait, I didn't Ralph feel, yo, wait, the, I have to fill up my wine and then I have a joint for later. Are you smoking weed tonight, yeah, BBP or no? We might get the bong upstairs All right. for tonight. All right. Get the bong. Get the bong. Get the bong. Get the bong. What are you doing? Right. Right, here, are you gonna grab the bong and the cigarettes? Here we go. Here we go. Here, here we go. I wish I had a fucking cigarette. Of memes and edgy an hour. And I know exactly what this is. I'm calling it out for what it is. This guy was a white You're supremacist. Pissy. He was all right. Wait, oh, he's wait, a wait, extremist. Oh, wait, he killed Kyler, Kyler, Kyler. 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 Let's, Let's, Oh, no. Kyler, we need to get through a minute of this, please. Oh. Let me talk over it. I'll talk. A ton of innocent Five. people, yeah. which is tragically wrong. Here, I'm going to fill up my right. wine while I let it play. I'm going to call go, it for go. what it is. I play also think I see people on the right wing diverting attention and saying, oh, well, what about the Christians getting killed here? What about these people getting killed oh, here? No. And while oh. those are tragedies as well, 
We Whoa. need to focus on these victims right now and call this attack yeah, what it bitch. was and, and find bitch. ways how we can de-radicalize people and get people to not act out in these violent ways when they were starting out just doing memes and having fun and it turned into something extremely hateful. And I feel called to do something about this. Bitch. The thing is, this person probably started out just saying jokes and doing memes online, but it escalated and these jokes became his reality. Next thing you know, he's posting an actual manifesto on a chan saying he's gonna kill a bunch of people. Right and now. there's a bunch of other right-wing people cheering him on still to this day. Oh, we no. need to start calling oh, this no. out for what it is. White All supremacy, is. racism, White supremacy, and racism. an extremist illusion Extremism. of reality. Oh, it's okay to make no. funny jokes. It's okay to make funny memes. And yes, subscribe to PewDiePie. But we need to start educating people the difference between internet okay. culture and cool. reality cool. before things awesome. go way ahead. It's okay when I do that Breton Tarot is a national treasure of Australia. No! no. 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 He's from New Zealand, Surfing! He's not even from Australia! No, Surfing, no! No, Surfing, no! No, Boys, it's too much. That's funny. It's too much. We've got the Baker's Park in now. Cheers, PVP. Fucking over it, Cheers, dude. Oh, this shit. By the way, oh, I'll tell you this, yeah. I don't know how well he drinks this shit. I'll be honest. I try no, and drink this shit terrible. to make fun of his dad dad. I still can't even fucking drink it. Living in a fucking you trailer. Literally you take two shots of it and you taste it in your mouth at 10 p.m. <laughs> the next night. You know, like it's just fucking gross. I don't know. I hope Ralph watches my fucking review of Crash Bandicoot as his dead father <laughs> who lives in a trailer park somewhere tonight. I hope that he does. Hey, it's hey, it's hey, actually hey, pretty hey, funny. Hey, Wait, wait, wait. PPP, my, my dad's dead too. Can you do a, a video of my dead dad? <laughs> does, he, does he live in a trailer park that he scammed the life insurance money for to pay for his double wife? Well, well, that's not that's not true. That's he didn't do that. But he lives in he okay, so PPP, you did you did a video as Ralph's dead father. My father died in twenty sixteen. Can you do a video where you're my dead father too? Is that is that possible, or is that too? Is yeah, it is it too scared? Look, I'll do a video like impersonating Skeletor, who I know was oh, your father. Oh, I'll, of you, oh, 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 oh. I'll give you some background information. <laughs> My dead father was a Vietnam veteran. He was in Vietnam, and he had. Oh, a they dropped the bombs on Poo fucking Denang. The fucking bombs, man. They fucking kept falling in the napalm strikes on the goddamn Vietnam, man. And I couldn't handle it. Jesus Christ. That's fucking face. That's fucking face. When I'm in a hurry, when I'm in a hurry, I grab a McFlurry, grab a McFlurry. Cop some apple pies, cop some apple got, pies. We got, we got the blue dream fries, super size. We love a Mickey D's. Peanut butter. does extra cheese. We love a Mickey D's. The pink lemonade strain. Pink Alaska. Oh, wait, 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 wait. wait. Uh, oh, PPP, I have some bad news. So. Where's the grinder at? If y'all, hang on, if y'all, hang on, if you all missed this, I have some bad news. So, Big Alaska, he was arrested, right? Uh, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring you some bad news here. No, no, no. Uh, we, that's not what the bad news was. What's the uh, bad? Let's go ahead. Can you get McDonald's in jail? McDonald's is not up. served in jails as inmates can only order food through the canteen or commissionary. No more Mc McGriddles. No! No more McDoubles. No more McDoubles. You're done. You're yeah. done. You're fucking done. How will Bake Alaska survive <laughs> without his McFlurry? It's Oreo Dude, McFlurry. He's not making it. Wait, would this he? Like, I think Captain I Picard, know, you need to make it to 6 a.m., Picard. Wait, There's still wait. three and a half hours PPP. in this show, Picard. PPP, 
<laughs> no, no, he'll be fine in half an hour. He always wakes I'm up. Like, good. I'm good. Chilling. I'm chilling. Wait, I'm chilling. but I have an idea. I have an idea. Since for PPP, since we're gonna talk more about Baked Alaska, right? I should, in honor of him, order some Mickey D's. What do you think? Yeah, my boy. <laughs> Should order some Mickey D's before that three, before that three a.m. close time on Skip nah, Dishes, my boy. No, twenty four seven here in, in Mississauga, my friend. Andy, Andy, do they really? Wait, 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 I can no. just pick him up I'll and throw him no. 20 I'll feet in the air. It's fucking nobody. I don't know. I don't know, Picard. You weigh I'll maybe a buck you. 20 soaking wet there, Skeletor. No, but we want it. No, no. I'll sock you out, dude. Let's fucking go. Skeletor <laughs> getting tilted after six shots. No. In the air. <laughs> no I'm, Skeletor I'm is tilted. No, 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 no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. can't make it no, with the big no. dog in no, the Ralph no, Mail. No. Oh, no. Oh no, no! If I was tilted, I wouldn't be here talking to you right now. Like, like I, I'm, I'm still cognizant. I can still talk, but like, I'm, I'm just tired. Um, I will say one thing. No, Ky- yeah, Kyler will be fine in half an hour, dude. I'll be fine in half an hour. I promise you to God. Yeah. I believe in God. I'll get a tea before I tea bag you, bud. I'll yeah. Get a tea. Here, here for me. Ma- uh, uh, for me, Alaska. I- what you gonna do about it? I just or I just almost doxed my. Surfers, I, I almost just showed my Surfers address on. He's gonna uh, whip out his ball sack. Well, everybody no, knows it not. is. No, he's not. Yo, Surfer yo, would never. Yo, yo, Surfer I almost, I almost just showed my phone Surfer. to show you my order, but my address was there. Don't show your address on stream. I'm on a fucking. Not gonna whip out his ball. Just show it. They oh, love you. Surfer's gonna whip it out. No, don't. Surfer. Please, please don't. Oh. Sir, I'll make an idiot. No, 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 on Bitwave. Four men pulling ultimate power move our, on Bitwave. Our, our only Ender our, will have to take it. Our only Ender's our, gonna have to take my pink starfish our, right up into his sniffle. I'll dominate you. Our only our only stream on Bitwave is just us showing our assholes and then booking it. Yeah. Uh, like the only stream I ever did on Bitwave was like reviewing the Ralph Sex tape. I reviewed on Bitwave. This was a classic, by the way. Wait, but wait, Ashton. What was, it was, it wait, what was your favorite part wait, of the sex tape, by wait, the way? Wait, wait, wait. Ashton, I'll fucking do- I'll side my favorite part. Too. Go. Don't worry, we'll take turns, but you'll love it more. My favorite part was when he <laughs> took his thumb right in the asshole, took a sniff, and then sucked the shit <laughs> off his thumb. Wait, you never say you never savored the aroma. Does anyone do you know anyone who's fucking <laughs> the asshole gone way up? Wait, and then took wait, it, wait, wait, wait. Oh, all of my all of my savor the smell. I'm a woman, I'm a woman, the I'm a woman. but I'm then a you woman. suck it off. Oh, I'm going to take off, and it's all shitty tasting. I'm, I'm going to take a mess. PPP, you meet me outside of McDonald's in Cincinnati, Ohio. I'll start on my <laughs> wrestling style. No, behind the Arby's. Do it behind the Arby's. <laughs> my Z wrestling style. Uh-oh. Oh, oh my God. He's whipping it out. Wait, wait, guys. I got an Indian again coming to my house. His name is... Gaggin deep, Gaggin deep. That's why I call my all my exes. You know what I mean, Gaggin deep. Every useless whore. Three thousand five hundred and fifty-six deliveries. I'd com- I'd kill myself. I don't know how he does it. I'm gonna tell Gaggin deep. I'm gonna film Gaggin deep when he's outside. Yo, did you see this? Yo, PPP. Hang on. PPP. PPP. Wait, 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 PPP. 
hear this. I got a guy coming to my house. His name is Gag and Deep, an Indian oh, guy. Okay. I worked with a Gag Deep Singh. No, you, know you didn't. How do you fucking say, hey, Gag Deep, how's it going? <laughs> you know? <laughs> no. But uh, what does he even short form his name? How does he anglicize his name? Does he just go by George? Yeah. How, do, how do you fix Gag Deep? Gag and Deep. How do you, well, here's no, the even, even worse. Though, wait, 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 even worse, though. Look at this. 3,556 deliveries. I'd commit suicide. I, 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 like, what? how do wait, you even do one? Wait, wait, wait. PPP didn't hear my challenge a second. Thing. Wait, wait. PPP didn't hear my challenge a second ago. Did you hear my challenge? Well, I I'm, heard you I'm, wanted I'm to wrestle. No, no, no. no, no, no. You're I'm not ready, ready to no, grease no, no, no. wrestle no. behind the dumpster of the McDonald's in Cincinnati, no, Ohio. No, I'm going to customize you wrestling style. Wrestling style. You look at this. I'll show you this. Kyle, look at this. Let's you go. think you can wrestle a man with this? <laughs> look at this. Take your shirt off. Kyle. Oh, no. Wait. Look at this. Hang on. Wait, what do you wait, think wait. is going to happen when these collide? Yeah, someone this collide. Yeah, someone I'll customize you, you wrestling style this, any day. This is the wrong way more style. than your whole body. I'll sodomize you outside of McDonald's in Cincinnati, <laughs> Ohio. Wrestling style. More than your skeleton butt. How about you some fucking cock? <laughs> You'll be rattled down into a fetal I'll position where your you anus is white. Your anus will be will, fucking stargate it, whenever I'm will, done with you. Look, it won't be twisted mind anymore. It'll be the twisted anus of Kyler. <laughs> twisted cocks after of I you, and Kyler. After I sodomize you, you'll be spitting sideways for the rest of your you life. You won't shit right for a fucking I week, just, a month. I don't deliver man rape to another man. It's not a gentle you don't know man anything, rape. PvP. It's a homoerotic Dude. play for dominance over dominate another you. man's penal. You I mean, won't know what is happening it will not anymore. Pink anymore. I think you may have a pink cavity, but it'll be yeah, red with blood. Blood. Red <laughs> colon. Red with colon. blood. I'll use the blood from your anus as the lube there, Kyler. <laughs> if I stick my fingers into your eye socket, I'll get the blood from your eyes to rub up my cock with lube. <laughs> and then I'll go in deep on you. Sodomizing you if I come forward with the blows to the orbital bone there, Tyler. I'm blows to the orbital bone, and you'll be blind. You won't have nothing. Blind, but you'll have a prostate orgasm from the peak penis in your anal snare, Kyler. Captain Picard, Skeletor, man. <laughs> Let's get back to shitting on fake the last. Wait, 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 wait chat. It, Hang on, PPP and Kyler. Just so you all know, <laughs> uh, the McDonald's and shit will be here in probably like five minutes. But I'm gonna head out and smoke this pinner real quick. While that, it's gonna be fucking gagging deep. will be here in a minute. Uh, I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna, I'm gonna film him and, and go, bro. I'm gonna film him, and I'm gonna go, bro. Do you enjoy I was your on life? the way to Subway. I was on the way to Subway today. Yeah. And I, on the way to Subway, encountered a black man. Oh, no. Now, in my town, black, black people are still rare. Black people are still rare where I live. You know, you Whoa. might encounter yeah, I'm gonna two, next maybe to you, three dude. black people in your time. But, you know, this black guy, he's got like a, a shopper's drug mart bag wrapped around his Jordans. I, I only I'd around run. only around one of his Jordans. The other Jordan doesn't have a shopper's drug mart bag. I took a picture of this shit. I'll send it to you. Couldn't even believe I had to, it was like I was on an African safari. It was oh, like buddy. I was in the wild buddy. and I had to take pictures of this buddy. animal without him noticing. Buddy, the black guy with the shopper's fucking shoe. But tell them about trench coat Santa. Oh fuck! So we used to live. We used to live on the dirtiest street in Peterborough, uh -huh. which was Bethune. Now, on Bethune, Bethune Manor, we used to live at what was called the Bethune Manor, which was like the biggest house on Bethune, which is like the crack shack area of where I live. Wait, anyway, wait, real fast, real fast. Mr. Bill, 
Jess threw a nin fucking jet. My God. <laughs> Oh, PPP, you're, no you're official third chair, bro. You need to come on more because you fucking... Do you real, dude? You yeah, Mr. Annoying. Bill, thank you so I'm much. I'm glad you're stuck in my cock. Yo, I'm yeah. stuck in your fucking cock. Hey, yo, Peter Burrow is not that far, dude. My fucking cock. I know. Well, you're coming one of these days. I, but anyway. I am. Well, I am too. Early, I, I am too. Early. Isn't it crazy, I, by the way, how PPP used to live in a manor? I used to live at the Bethune Manor where we threw big parties. Thank so, you, Mr. Bell. One of these days, one of these days, we walk. I walk out onto Thank the you. porch. And what do I see? But a man a dressed black. as Santa. No, he was white. He was dressed as Santa, <laughs> naked, naked as the day that he was born, but with a trench coat on, dressed as Santa, but with no <laughs> underwear. And he's, and he's leather gloves, and he's carrying a fucking cleaver in his hand down the street. No, he wasn't. And I just, he was. What he hell? was. He was just strolling oh, down the street. Don't forget that guy. And he's leather oh, gloves. And, and we're like, guys, he go, wait, guys, go guys. Ax milk and, and, rob it? And I'm sorry, um, uh, you and Color talk. I'll be back in like six oh, we'll minutes. We'll talk, all right. I'll be back worry. in six minutes. We'll talk. We'll Tyler, talk. this was the trench. This was the trench coat Santa. Trench coat Santa. No, is that a sight you want to see, or a sight you're afraid of? Like, is this like so, threatening? Fucking no! You walk out into the backyard. You're next to this park where homeless people shoot up heroin, right? Fair you're enough. watching from the backyard. It's like in real life, Jerry Springer. It's like if the Jerry Springer show was occurring on your porch. And at any time of day, you can walk outside and see the Jerry Springer show. I remember. Oh, it's like dinner in a movie. You, know? it is. you go out, so, you crack a fucking beer, and you see the family feud. And you walk <laughs> you know? out, and one day, honest to God, they're discussing how this guy fucked like a 16 year old, this whoa, underage girl whoa, 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 in the whoa. park, and he's like a pedophile. And That's you're having like this family drama of the pedophile arguing with his family about how he was righteous to fuck the 16 year old. Now in Canada, 16 is legal, so it wasn't a crime. But, but it's, it's like immoral. whoa, it's still immoral. It's like what the fuck are you doing, dude? It is. Come it's on. against the strong Christian ethics we preach on Christian True. mind every day. Christian. America first. America, America first. first. Rebel. Fuck Rebel. off, you. Double Romans. Fuck you. Fuck you, Nick Fuentes. By the way, Nick Fuentes has Nick sex Fuentes. with cat boys. You know, he disavowed the cat boy after the cat boy did the most base thing of his life. Yeah, the best you know, thing the, he ever did for the white cause. The best, thing, the best thing the cat boy ever did was give the Joseph Goebbels speech. Boys, but the yes, that was too far. Shout out to fucking St. Brenton Toronto. No, stop it. <laughs> Tyler is going to boot us from this fucking program because of your degenerate. I'm not, doing a goddamn, I'm not doing a goddamn thing. Let's fucking go, dude. Where the fuck? Now, where the fuck are the rest of these fucking, you know, they're only given, what, 37,000 lemons. They need to That's give nothing. more. That's nothing. That's nothing. Fucking I, I don't even, you know, this isn't, this is I gay. want an only night. I only won an only night taking donations on D Live. I made one thousand dollars shitting on Ethan Rowe. You know the first. It was you know it was I, the lemon heist. The lemon heist. The lemon heist was a historical event. That's something you Again, can't can't you can't write in the history books. That's something you had to be there for. I was there. Oh, you were there. You sent a full ninja. I, I know. Ninja. I did. That's true. That's hundred percent true. Look. Buddy, I gotta ask, why are you vaping instead of smoking cigarettes like a man? Because smoking cigarettes, like it, it, it permeates fabrics and stuff, and I have I have moving blankets up for soundproofing and acoustics, and it. it oh, I want to tell you this something. The vaccine for COVID already exists, and it's called smoking cigarettes. Do you know they found no, that buddy. nicotine in no, trials buddy. protects against the coronavirus? It's called not in well, a woman. Or Nicotine's in this guy. It's called smoking cigars like a oh, man. A surfer believes in only, smoking only cigars. Only women. I'll, I'll get a cigar. Funny guys smoke I'll, cigarettes. I'll get a cigar for you I next time. Smoke cigars. 
Children hit the bait. Hit the bait. My fucking cock. I'll get a cigar for you guys next time. I'll smoke a cigar in here. I won't smoke a because the thing is, is like cigarettes taste like chemicals and sawdust, but cigars taste like tobacco. I know what you mean. Like the cigarette. I'm gonna smoke it. Like, it's called a popper. So I'm gonna show you guys how it's done. You're gonna smoke a popper. What you're gonna want to do? Hey, what you're gonna want to do is. Cut off a piece a little of bit big. tobacco out and put it in the bong <clears throat> stem and then put the weed on top of it and fucking hit it until it pops. I done yeah, pop. So what you do is you time. pop. Now in the UK, poppers is this like ML solution that homosexuals yeah, you take sniff to get it and up make your ass. butthole loose. That's fucking gay. <laughs> well, you well so it's just pathetic. Fuck. Because even if you were a homosexual, wouldn't you want a tight anus to yeah, get fucked in? I don't even. Yeah, that actually is a fantastic mean. point. Like, wouldn't you want to give pleasure to your uh, fellow homosexual? Uh, I don't know. Like when I rape men, it's not usually for pleasure. It's a more of a dominance thing. Yeah, but it's just you know, it, it is what it is. You're, 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 it's, it's. This is your domain. You're asserting dominance over your domain. I'm gonna snap a pop here. Fuck, there's no lighter, but there's like five uh, over on the table. So I'm gonna go get yeah, one of this one. Buddy. Oh, there's it's this a, lighter that's kind of. Get the lighter, bro. Fucking smoke it. Smoke the weed, dude. I can't smoke marijuana anymore. I fucking go crazy. See, and Andy, Andy, a minute, a minute ago, I was in the chair like sideways. I was done, but Andy was like, "Give him thirty minutes. He's fine. Thirty minutes. I'm fine." I'm oh, you're here. back. I'm back. I'm back. You're back. We, we pushed you. We pushed you a bit too hard. A little, I'm just bullying you. Well, the last time... Everybody... Weird, well, well, the weird thing is it seems like that my alcohol tolerance, like, reversed. Because, like, um, like the last time I drank a bottle of Jaeger, I killed, like, three-fourths of it. And I was, like, relatively, like, coherent and, co and, and cognitive. Oh, yeah. But like I killed like a fourth of it, and it hit me harder than it did last time. So I don't know what happened. It's weird. Alcohol. Boy, you is need weird. to put on some weight. We need to get you lifting. We need to get you fucking eating. I have you know you're looking bands. a bit thin. I have resistance bands. Oh no, man, I... you needed to buy a whole set of weights before COVID started, like we did. If Bro, I flip I'm... this down, you can see the weights behind. Me. Are you are you strong? Are you strong? Oh, oh look at God, these buddy. fucking buddy incredible God. arms! God. So you're like you're like a bulky, like you're like a power lifter guy. You're strong and you're bulky. Well, the thing about being a power lifter is the only people you impress are other men. That's true. That's true. I'm, 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 dudes, dudes, dudes. I'm, I'm, wait, wait, wait. When you, I'm high as fuck, bro. Andy, what were you well, telling you me? Well, you missed me just smoking a popper. I'll have to smoke another one yeah, for Uncle I've, Andy. Andy. On the show. Dude, dude, no, I Andy, did. No, I did. Andy, what were you telling people a minute ago? 30 minutes ago? You're like, give, give Kyler 30 minutes. He's fine. He'll be back in a minute. Yeah, I'm, he's back. I told he's you. Fine. Everything's fine. He's even less than 30 he's minutes. Back. I was worried. I was worried he wouldn't make it to dude, 6 in the morning because we're going to yeah. have to go to 6 in we're the morning to six cover six what we planned. 6 in the morning. Well, well dude, morning. dude, dude, no, no. I've done. That's why I, I was being serious. But I'm like, give him half an hour. I've done. I've done over 200 shows with this motherfucker. I know. I know his fucking. I know. His I'm gonna go size. urinate real quick while you guys talk about me. I'll be right back. All right. Yeah. I'm gonna go pee. So I'm gonna, pee -pee. I'm gonna go piss out of my dick. My so fucking. Uh, I'm impressed. I'll tell you this, Andy. I'm go. impressed that Kyler has given into peer pressure nearly every time. One time he refused. But most he's been giving in to the peer pressure. He's based for giving in. Yeah. We love him. We hope he does more shots with us. Yeah. We hope that he pukes. Yeah, we're getting we hope that tonight, the show bro. gets even better. But yeah. uh, by the way, to drink and smoke more. So uh, that guy, a gagging deep, right? When he came, you know, this guy was driving in his car with a mask on. I'm like you're an Uber. You're you're not even an Uber. You have to wear a mask for visual presentation. Like, 
We're not standing next to each other. You open your window, I grab my food, and you're wearing a mask in your car the entire time. This guy, gagging deep, he's serious about his job, let's be honest. You know what? Props for gagging deep for actually having fucking some. I'm sure he's not like mundane Matt who opens their pocket. He has like extra stickers for the McDonald's bags. And then he like opens a little bit, steals a few nuggets out of there, you know? Matt, he collects people's Uber Eats food as he does the uh, deliveries. Oh. I guarantee you, Matt, every order that's like six McDoubles, he's juking like one McDouble oh, out. Dude. Or, you know what I mean? Like, he takes the patties. Every fat person order he gets, like every fat person order he gets, he's juking like one piece out. Yeah. And he knows that Skip or Uber is going to eat the cost. Because they will. Yo. They eat the cost anytime well, you can Well, you know complain. what's funny? Whenever you ever order any Skip the Dishes or Uber Eats, you ever go, oh, they forgot a burger. No, it's it's a mundane Matt style driver who's stealing that shit for their fat. He and it's not even by the way, it's oh, even it's sadder. True. It's not even for Matt to eat. This is even sadder. It's to keep his family from dying. It is. Look, I've ordered sixty dollar Uber Eats or skip the dish order before, right? All this McDonald's for the big dog because I need it to survive. Oh, I do. I Otherwise, know. it won't make through it. Fucker, I've got it to where like less than ten dollars of the McDonald's has arrived. I'm like, I was expecting <laughs> eight junior chickens. There's there's two, there's two in the bag. Yo, and I, the fuck is the rest of it? Yo, we have to, you know, like what is going on? And you know what we should do when I go there? We should mukbang McDonald's. I could eat a lot, dude. Oh, uh, I don't know if you can out eat the big dog. Buddy. Yo, I mean, look at this. Yo, Boris, you don't get a you don't get a quadruple chin like this with a neck beard. That would Plus, be... you can eat a lot of McDonald's. Wait, but how many how many double cheeses are you able to eat in one sitting? Honestly, if I pushed it ten, wow. I ate ten junior chicken, one pot <laughs> for a mukbang on the channel. I ate ten junior chicken. I watched. I bet that. you I can get to ten McDoubles. Whoa, I ate seven, eight of them. It's like oh fuck. And then if you try and push to ten, it's tough. Yeah. Past that, it's just degeneracy. Like, reality is, you're gonna have to go to the bathroom, puke a couple times, keep fucking eating. Oh. That's just Roman decadence and degeneracy. <laughs> Again, we're living in the equivalent of the Roman Empire after the peak, so oh, it is what it is. Yeah. And eating as they would historically in such a time, fuck sick. But uh, by the way, I think, hang on, real fast here. Let me read a few of these don't knows, man. People are really enjoying the show. This is a like fucking good time, by the way. Uh, Hukori for a diamond. Thank you so much. Ace of Death, 187. Oh, you followed? Cunt Tuesday for a diamond saying, first ever SC watched you since 2015. P.S. I'm a girl. Whoa, vagina, right? Vagina there. <laughs> I don't know. It is what it, it is. is what it the is. big dog gets so much pussy. He's not even oh, impressed dude. by women. It's probably it's too It's not much. that the big dog is an incel overcompensating for his insecurities. No, he gets pussy every weekend. And it's fucking... Look at this. Uh, A man tits like this. at all the fucking bitches. Amen, That's how brother, it is. Amen. Motherfucker, oh, I best be D cup at least by now. I'm pushing for double D's by next New Year's. Pushing for the 500 pound mark. Pu pu pushing to be hospitalized to a bed to qualify for disability. Thank you, Justo. I will never have to work again as long as you pay for the skip the dishes. Thank if, you, brother Justo. If you, if you, when you're bedridden, okay, and you can't like leave a room, you know, we have to like open the the wall. I'll film a doc. I'll, I'll, I'll bring, I'll, I know I've filmed some independent I'll films still, before. I'll still, I'll still be able to stream from my bedside. <laughs> I'm dying. I'm dying. And the surfers come in with a rag on a stick to wash my ball sack that's rancid there. Somehow, at that point in time, I'll make it there. It is what it is. It is what it is. I'm still going to make it big on the internet there to an audience of. Maybe a couple dozen viewers. <laughs> it is what it is. It is. Yeah. Okay. Let me just pound through these uh, real fast. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, I love the Gilbert Godfrey energy. It lives on. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, best guest ever. 
uh, Nurox for a diamond just to support the show. And another diamond, a third diamond, a fourth diamond. Thank you so much, Nurox. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, so if Kyler is Picard, Andy is Riker, who is PPP? Well, I'm so logical. I must be data, right? I don't know. <laughs> I, might, I might just be the fucking, the bones of the crew. Uh, I don't know. What am I, the quark? I'm fucking desperate for the Jew gold. I'm going to be the fucking, what's his name? Uh, the DS9 the Ferengi oh, guy. What's his name? What's the Ferengi? I'm fucking. Kyler would know. Is it, is it quark? What's his name? The Ferengi. You know what I'm talking you're muted, about. You're muted, Kyler. The, the main Ferengi. You're guy. muted, dude. You're, you're muted. muted. It's quark. It's quark. Oh, well, Kyler, you're I'm muted right, the whole time. I'm right. I'm right. I'm a bit fucked up, so I'm doubting myself on my Star Trek lore. But I do enjoy Star Trek. Although, I have to say, <laughs> I really, from what I've seen, DS9 is my least favorite of the show. Why? Why? But I haven't. Why? Why? Oh, I'll tell you this. I haven't sat down and actually watched, like, seasons of DS9. I've watched maybe 20 random episodes of DS9 just come on cable but i've watched all of tos all of tng and all of voyager and tng is the best it. right tng is the best i still like the original series the original is good for but a different reason for wait, a different reason problem problem it is wait it is. sorry Go i on. ordered a blt they have bacon where sure. the fuck tomato where's the fucking lettuce bitch hey, no, that's not an amen. That's the fucking. They fuck. That ought to be. Look, they're going to hell, brother. Andy. No, those McDonald's. Here's what happened. No, 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 wait, wait. Goddamn show, Andy. They're going to the or... fire in the bridge. No, no, where no. the worm never dies and the fire is never quenched, brother. And that's where those McDonald's fry cooks are going into the deep pit of hell, where they'll be tormented for all eternity by Satan and his demonic flock of demons. Wait. Corrupted from all that is good and righteous because they left and let us off the Wait. DLT. Now go ahead, brother. No. I'll let you go. They got pickle and pickle in here. Pickle in a BLT. Yo, I'm going to fucking, I'm going to, I'm going to call fucking Uber and get my fucking $14. Not to, the, not to the fifth, not to the sixth. It was gagging the, the, I, the eighth, I suspect. To them. the ninth. The ninth layer of hell is gagging deep sing going to for stealing your goddamn lettuce. There, gagging Andy. deep is going to fucking hell. Fat, drunk and fat, I'm mad. Gagging oh. deep. Even if it spilled, you would have enough time because there's hardly even enough water in it. By I the... fucking knocked it last night while I was sleeping. Uh -huh. And somehow I saved it before the water ended up everywhere. Buddy, buddy, when was the last time you changed the water? <laughs> Two weeks ball? ago. Oh. That's honestly oh. not bad. That's honestly not bad. There are many who have left it for more than two weeks. Everybody listening who smokes Wait, what water knows. For what? Water for what? The water from the bong I haven't changed in two weeks, but I'll oh. tell you that's not bad that's compared not bad. to some people. Some yes, people out there never do. Oh, wait. Was that Dick Masterson? That was no. Dick Masterson. Yes, you fucking die. All right. All right, let's do Bake being arrested, and then we got to get on to Diddler Down. We got to no, get the wait, dick. Some on, no, wait. First, look, I want to. Listen, I wanna, every time. Wait, 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 it, look, I, ha I have to read the donos, but I get one diamond. And it becomes a 10-minute segment. So, guys, I need to get, like, six. I'll shut up. <laughs> okay. Cunt Tuesday Fuck for a diamond. Diamonds. It needs to be raised. God oh, damn, they need to step up and get some ninja guineas going for you, yeah, brother. Yeah, ninja guineas were like, okay, our attention's like put forward. The diamonds, but, it's like a double A. Go ahead, go ahead. A diamond's like 80 cents. I bite my fucking ass with 80 oh, cents. Okay, Connor, no, dude, we can't on. bash the people who give diamonds, man. No, I disagree with that. I people, don't. I'll but, say it's this. It's a tip. Give They're supporting. Ninja get it to 50. If it's not at at least 50,000 Andy takes home, I'm never coming back. So figure it out, kid. No, you can't figure even. Figure it out, kid. Okay. Take home 50K. Not 50K overall. That's bullshit because it doesn't actually show up as the lemon result after the fact. <laughs> We've learned this from the Ralph show. Look, I'm the big dog. I deserve these donos, even though I don't get any of it and I don't even give a fuck what they get. But them 50k at least because it boosts my ego it makes me feel like i'm a big draw there and you pay pigs will pay it anyhow 
Is it turns you on? You are a big draw, dude. Thanks, thanks, Scotty, man. Um, we right. got. Why don't you suck my fucking cock? Hang on, hang on, hang on, real fast. Cunt Tuesday for a diamond saying baked nose is Jewish. Nurox True. for a diamond to support the show. Thank you. Government Kuda for a diamond saying, Andy, remember when we were on TRS? Best times. Okay, go. True. Wait a minute. Dick Ritchie in the chat's going, these cheap ass fucking diamonds. How much has Dick Ritchie donated then? Where's oh, his donation let's at check, if he goes cheap ass fucking diamonds? Where is Dick Whoa, Ritchie? He's not even on the list. Fucking ass butter funny guy. Whoa. Where is Dick Ritchie? Because. <laughs> Calling wait, wait, did did fucking did, did surfer say funny guy in compliance with our rules? Yes. That's so nice of him. Like I <laughs> that was so funny. That was like that made my night, dude. You're like, oh, he's being a fucking funny guy. Because I've heard like me and Kyler when we watch your your videos, right? We would play golf like T PGA Tour on fucking Steam or whatever and we're listening to your fucking screams. We say the n-word whenever we I miss by the way. But whenever we oh, hear God. like cuz you're pretty offensive too in a way, but like surfer will come out of nowhere in the middle of your like like a 20 minute like fucking video. 18 minutes in surfer just goes, "By the way." And he comes in and oh, says something God. that I'm, I'm like, like this, this video's flagged off. now. I'm giving this like I'm giving like a doctrinal dissertation or something, you know. Surfer comes in. Well, that's why you're fucking wrong, bud. <laughs> you know, he'll come in and like I'm giving this promo on like an Australian loser there, and he, he'll come in and he'll blow me out. By the the way, whole promo is ruined. By the way, you did Everybody a whole video. You did a whole video. You did a whole video on Spoonie. And it's very interesting. If you guys don't know the story, man, the Spoonie story, he used to be like, he, I used to love him too back in the day. I was a big fan of his. But then he went, became depressed and became an alcoholic. Everything oh, fell apart. Wow, he did a Patreon. Wow, I'm scam the people. Best. I can't do retrospectives anymore. I'm he so scammed, sad. Right? But PB oh. did, did this whole fucking three hours stream on him two hours and 38 minutes surfer comes in and goes no one even gives a fuck about about uh about spoonie there anymore and then it's real. It's all real. the comments were like ppp i mean uh sorry surfer was right like it's just like he fucked up your entire your point uh, was gone he, fucks up, he just fucks up the whole show but <laughs> Like this is the thing. It is what it is. This is the dynamic. It's a lot of fun. Yeah. I'll tell you this though. With the Spoonie stuff, it is very sad. I watched Spoonie for years and years and years. I was, he was one of my favorite bit. creators. Yeah. You know, I, I'll it was tell sad you. Like, watching one of his recent, like a few months ago, we watched one of his streams, and he literally looks like he's about to break down at any moment, like crying, and it's just sad. I, I, I'm not even like. Calling this out to make fun yeah, of him. You're not exaggerating. It's like it's he, looks true. Like it's true. he looks like Grima Worm Tongue from the Lord of the Rings yeah. whispering yeah, secrets into the king, of, the king of Gondor's ear or whatever wait. the fuck it was. Wait, wait. The guy looks sad. You go ahead, Kyler. It's, it's bad. He looks, he looks done in rings, but I'll tell you guys one thing. Like, okay, let's let's be real here for a moment. Like, we're joking around, we're goofing, we're goofing on people, we're drinking and stuff. Let's be real for a moment. How fucking hard would it actually be for Spoonie to do like a Final Fantasy IX retrospective and dunk on it? Like it, it's not it's not a perfect game, but it has its flaws. He could hit. He has material there. Final Fantasy X. Well, well, he's got material there. Wait, 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 wait. He's got material there. How hard would it be for him to just make a fucking video? Like, like at this point, yeah, there's a lot of controversy, a lot of baggage. Well, like he hasn't done a, lot, a video in a long time. But if he, but I, if, I he if, 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 if 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 he did, if he more, did it. People would support it. People would yeah, support it. But here's but the thing. His he momentum is definitely gone, though. I would say his momentum is gone, but it would take it doesn't matter. It four doesn't matter. or five videos for him to feel good. He would have to force the first one like emotionally. That's but okay. I think he can Just do, do it. it. I think do he it. can. Do he would need some friends behind him to go, no, you're you're, you're reading these lines. Do okay. it. He has your friends. Look, here, here, here's the thing. Here's the I said to the guy, I will pay you $1,000. And I had the money from the lemon heist. I was going to give it all to <laughs> I had this Spoonie $1,000. 
you can make one more review. He said, "Fuck off." One more, just one he said, more. Fuck yeah. no, he the didn't. thing too is that he turns down like he legit. Fuck off? Yeah, he, 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 he now turned to fuck off. offers for content. Like people, if I'll pay you so and so, people will donate this. him. People will donate him two hundred, three hundred dollars, and he'll decline it, and he'll say no. People are you people, know. people are so nostalgic for that 2010 people, era content, like where it's just like, Andy, Andy, you will never understand. Now, maybe in ten years you'll get people like this. I doubt it. But with Spoonie, he made an impact on a generation of guys my age yes. who really love Spoonie. About like ten, twenty thousand guys. Some of those guys, maybe even two thousand of them, maybe even only one thousand of them, would still give him money to the, this the day. Interest of uh, yeah. yeah, the review was legitimately funny. It was. He it could was have fucking whole. The guy, the guy was... was making five grand a month on Patreon, boys. He was making one grand a month to play one Cards Against Humanity. And he game didn't. He fans. missed them. And he did one. one he and did he one, and he missed them. And I have the stream. I have the stream, and it's honestly, I think I'd say I'll do a stream today. I'm going to go over it and show how Spoonie missed out on making all this money. It's honestly, it's so fucking sad because it honestly, the people giving him money weren't that bad to hang out with. Sure, they were nerdy guys, but it's like Spoonie is a nerdy guy. So these are your time. People, yeah. Like, king of the nerds they all bow to you kiss your ass for a thousand dollars a month to play one card game most people in the world would suck a penis for a thousand dollars <laughs> like that for real they would yeah. a lot of you guys out there would you know that you are working at walmart or wherever it's true but look still, the guy oh, Kyler, would you even... suck a penis for a thousand i wouldn't suck a penis for a million that's bullshit that is truth for that my... is true. Truth. You're no. lying, no. but I would because no, no, I'm such no, a macho no, man. No, no, no. Tyler, people, what's the price? Hey, I don't give a people, fuck. People always say that like the true, the true yeah, you comes right. out when you're. Oh, wait, wait, the true, the true you comes out when you're drunk, and I am certifiably hammered right now. It's true. That is true. Yeah, I'm but you can also lie though. No, the true you comes out when you're drunk. There is no price on me. I'm There's sorry, no price. Like you're the fake drunk, Kyler. No, I am. Wait, 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 wait. wait, I, wait, have wait, wait, wait. I have one. Wait, wait, wait. I have one. No, Kyler, no, no, no. Andy, on. Andy, I want to. I'll say this, Kyler. What yes. if? What if I'm what? dying? I'm in my deathbed, and the doctor goes, "Listen, I got this fucking pill, but it's worth a million dollars." Kyler, you have to suck my cock. For me to give Andy this pill to save his life, would you save my life? Would you suck a cock for me, Kyler? It was nice knowing you, man. What? Are you kidding me? You are a piece of garbage, dude. Andy, 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 to do tomorrow's show, he would suck your penis. That... What? <laughs> saying? I'm not you sucking your show on Monday. I'm cutting to the truth. No, truth. no, 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 no. I can't. I can't. I'm going too hard. Do you want right? to know the goddamn I'm truth? Do you, 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 you want to know? No, 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 Andy. No, 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 no. Do you, do you want to know the truth? Uh, PPP, Ashton, I'll meet you outside of a McDonald's in Cincinnati, Ohio, and sodomize you wrestling style. I'll stick my finger in your fucking ass, dude. Let's fucking go. I just, I just don't believe you. Give me some oh. more passion on that take. I'm too drunk for okay. my passion, dude. I'm too drunk. I, I passed out 30 oh, minutes ago. Passion. Guys, look, look you you're, expecting, you're expecting two, you're expecting you two guys to have out of have me because I was know. fucking done. I was done 30. I was done an hour ago you now. I was like, done. I was you look like, like 3% Hispanic, so you should have the machismo. Actually, oh, I I took a 23 of me. It turns out I'm 99.4% European, a mixture of mostly British and French and German, and I'm 0.2% Congolese. It makes so I, sense. So I, I, I can say it. I can say it. I can say Cong I have the past. Somehow, I don't give a fuck. I have zero point zero zero. I say it all the time. I don't give a shit. Eat my dick. I yell out the window when I see a bunch of them. Okay, let's like let's let's keep doing the bait Alaska shit. Come on, like 
Holy shit, we gotta get through bait. Like we're two hours into the show. It's just a fucking nightmare. Dog. No, we're, no, we are. Wait, wait, Andy, Andy, someone's it's been two hours me and forty nine minutes, Andy, dude. Andy, Andy, and someone's telling me you missed a Larry and Dean and Jagini. I'm not. Du- I have five hundred fucking donations to read, but read no one lets me fucking read go, them. Go, 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 you guys. Go. No donations. The, the, These are literally. You guys go, just have go. to stop talking and responding I'm to not anything. Saying anything. Go. Okay. I'm pretty fucking sure that my maternal grandmother's maternal grandmother was a Jew. That makes me a Jew by definition. Because that makes my grandma a Jew. The reveals never which end. Which makes my grandma a oh. Jew. Which makes my mother a Jew. Which makes me a Jew. It's all down the fucking maternal line. Wow. Have you seen Quest for Ways? I think I found that out a couple days ago, but all I'm right. not certain. I'm only like a ninety percent certain of that. But I will. I will soon find out. I'm gonna ask my grandma whether it was her maternal or paternal grandmother that was the Jew. Okay, right. let us know. Find out I want certain. the update though. I need the update. I'm gonna I mute my mic. I'm gonna step away. Read however many you need to read. I'm gonna go get a beer. I'm gonna go get a grinder. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, a grinder. A grinder. Yeah. You want- no, one of these. No, it, it, uh, I don't smoke marijuana. It's a grinder. A you, grinder you is an apple. Or do you fuck me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, holy shit. <laughs> uh, by the way, everyone, cheers. Thanks for being here. Okay, we got Mr. Bill. Sorry, everyone, I haven't been able to read donations. It's like the show is Kyle jam-packed. Littenhouse. The show is Kyle jam-packed and like literally like every fucking. Tyler Littenhouse this is, is here. by the way, the most dense show we've ever had, I think. Like literally, <laughs> we, we've done about six minutes worth of video and three hours just talking. But here we go. Okay, everyone, stop. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, look at Baked Alaska's queer eyebrows. I was going to say that too, by the way. Uh, first last for a diamond thing. saying, did yeah. Baked visit Israel and kiss the wall? Uh, Raging Human is for a diamond saying, Spencer enthusiastically enjoys penises every day. <laughs> yes, I got for a diamond saying, could Baked be any more fake and gay? Mr. Bill oh. for a diamond saying, figure it out. PPP is Scotty. Beam me up. Uh, Beam him up. I remember Gouda for a diamond saying, PPP is most authentic, eat shit shrubs. Government Kuda for a diamond saying, if PPP doesn't hit a bong on stream, I'm going exto. First last Whoa. for a diamond saying, a Kyler on pit pool mode. Cartman for a diamond saying, I'll take every sub and then I'll take your mother's love. Whoa. Mr. Bill for a diamond saying, McDonald's should just own prisons. Larry True. MD for a ninja guinea saying, Whoa. play this 30 sec. Ninja Gini saying play this 30 second clip. It's clean. Okay, hang on. Let me just play it real play fast. It. But bitch. I'm just it. pounding through these chats. Sorry. Play that, nin- that was a great uh, reference to that. Okay. Rod, just stealing, wheeling, dealing, son of a gun. And I'm having a hard time keeping right. these alligators down, brother Andy. Amen. All right, all right. All right. Amen, brother Andy. All right, all right. I'm gonna pound through these. Okay, I'm, I swear I'm I'm running through these fast. First, last for a diamond saying Kyle ah, can't swole again. And, oh, yeah, so uh, after this, surfer's gonna rank the weed in the household. So get ready for the surfer weed review. Okay, okay and then we're gonna get into baked alive. Okay, I promise. Let me just pound through these, please. First, last for a diamond saying Kyle gets swole again and DDT the PPP. Uh, we got my name is nobody for a diamond saying my. Real friend keeps bringing me shots. Tuesday for a diamond. Thank you so much. Tater Farm for a diamond. My banker is a woman named Man Meat. Jessica for a diamond saying, please stop. Uh, about something like we were talking about before. Grumble's nuts. Is showing our guns. Uh, oh, yes. That's what she said, please stop. Too. Yeah. Christopher Waffen for a diamond saying, do the truffle shuffle. First last for a diamond. Thank you so much. Jessica for diamonds and Copper Cap Jr. here. She just chill out a little bit. Mr. Oh. B- Mr. Bill for a ninjet. Uh, 
And I, I was, th- I already thanked him for that, but he said, late night returns. Men talking shit like men should. Let's go. Thank you so much, Mr. Bill, for that, man. Massive dono. Ninja Kini from First Last saying, giving gas to Mr. Bell's, Bill's based jet dono. Thank you so much, First and Last. Mr. Bill for a diamond. St. Plumpkin for a diamond. St. God, I wish I had Kyler's chair right now. Mr. Dude, Bill, for, Mr. Bill for a diamond. St. Fuentes had sex with Catboy. Wait, what? First last for a diamond saying props to Fuentes and Cami ride the waves. Government Guda for a diamond saying PPP plus one. Fuentes minus one. Fuentes is dead by January 20. Create. That's kind of dark. Ahel Anderson for uh-huh. a Ninja Gini saying PPP and Twisted Mind are a comedy dream team. Legendary show lads. Thank Based. you so much, Ahel. Uh, Mr. Based. Bill for a diamond saying how to smoke pulper. First step, be a gay man. Uh, oh. Hey. First last for diamonds and Kyler, this a reminder to hydrate your meat bag. Almost done. How about you hydrate your motherfucking dick? How about that? Your mom's cock. A-ho hydrate your mom's cock. Yeah, Aho oh. Anderson, if we're talking about TNG, PPP would be O'Brien. That's true. PPP is based O'Brien. Based O'Brien. First last for diamonds and 13. We got Picard, we got Andy's Riker, and then PPP is based, oh, yeah. based O'Brien. I based O'Brien. Teleporter is the teleporter fear is cocked. Do you believe in an almighty God there? Yeah, we got th- three more, f- four more here. First last for a diamond saying 1376 for my fatty interiors. Melanin rated for a diamond. Uh, says Sig Kyler. Uh, Kamala's uh, okay, uh, situation monitor. Just subscribe for three months and I'll read the rest. Oh, wait, we only have three more. First last for a diamond saying Kyler based as fuck. No homo dongs. Yeah, Nick calling for diamonds. Say, PPP, do you always hang with cryptos? Ask him. Cryptos? What the fuck? Do you hang out with cryptos? Crypto Israelis or whatever there. I'm the only (laughs) one that's not a federal agent or Jew somehow. Thanks to my base Arab variant phenotype, even though I clearly look like a mongoloid. Buddy, you told me you were a Jew. I'm a Métis there. AT Nation, I need a tax benefit. I don't need to pay any more taxes. School for free there. I can feel it in my blood that I'm native there. I can feel it there are native blood. Let's, let's watch. Let's watch real fast the uh the fucking baked mason clip so we can talk about the charges. Like all right. Oh by the first way, twenty minutes. Oh have you seen this? New banner for IP2. Baked is not there. Whoa, he's been kicked. Lulz is. Lulz is on there. Yeah, but Baked is not. They don't on the sidewalk. You can piss. Yeah. There it is. So you're just sitting here trying to antagonize. No, are you taking that back? Well, I'm actually about to have you trespass. You're not removing. You're off my property. I'm off. No, you're not. This is our property. I thought you were against Joe Biden's ceiling. And then you're blocking our entrance. But Joe Biden talk. So he just goes, yeah, being gay is wrong. Yeah. And this guy's like, you're homophobe. So he's, can, I call that, can I call that phone number on his shirt right now? Or call it right now? Call it right now. Call him. Security, call it. security says that being gay is wrong. Is that right? Is that what the security <laughs> yeah. said? Is it for security? security is so- His shirt says uh, 602 542. Oh, yeah. You got it? Okay. There yeah. it is. Let's see, that. Let's see what this guy has to say. Yeah, this is it. This is it. It's probably closed. That's the bad thing about our show. There's no prank calls allowed because everything is fucking closed at the end of time. Everybody in bed there. Yeah, this show's so late. It's so ridiculous. Why do we do it this time? It's... The mailbox is full. I mean, wow, <laughs> mailbox is full. You want to know why? It's probably IP two people phoning this phone number and leaving messages like, "Yo, yeah, that's true." Yo, bro. Or no, yo, we, we, yo, we 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 say yo, fa right? You're a fat Alaska. 
You're a funny guy. No, you gotta get off my property. It's Dave with a fucking I'm not kidding. Get out of my door now. This guy, I would love to be this guy yelling in Yo, Bates. So his ego, he's seething. He can't like handle this. Like he Bates can't are... handle being the lesser man. No, he can't, he can't be clowned on. So he's gonna have, like wow. do. Don't fucking quit scream. blocking my door. Don't whoa. scream in his face. Whoa, whoa, whoa! whoa. whoa. Don't, don't push my bro. Now he gets emasculated. He gets emasculated. So like, look, if anybody pushes you, look, I've never been pushed that far back. I was in 11th grade. The best fighter in my school fucking pushed me. I didn't move like more than six inches, you know, and I stared him down. And then we both walked away. This fucking guy got just shoved clear across the fucking room. <laughs> like he was in WWE. A WWE wrestler had shoved him. This guy, <laughs> this guy, this bouncer somehow is like the ultimate Chad. He doesn't look it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, he shoved him like he's like the great Ali or Undertaker or something, shoving some jobber across the ring in a fake situation. Dude, I didn't even think of what you just said. You're right. I've never been pushed that far. That's impossible. Never. Guess, to me, that, never. that's like, you know, you're playing like cyberpunk and the guy's using cyber cybernetic arms and it's like fictional. <laughs> and you're like, that would never happen in real life. It It did. This guy has like some oh, sort of extra like strength, that? some you bonus. Even expect a UFC fighter pushes an untrained man, he fly that far. He's yeah. like a full eight feet clearance <laughs> by the time he turns around. Like, look how Holy far shit. away he is. Holy it's shit, you're like, right. You're look right. at how far back he flies. Now watch, babe. I'm Fucking yeah, the look of bum hurt on Bates' face. You're right. That sounds sums it up. Hey, what's this? Hey, blocking my door. Don't whoa. scream in his face. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> dude, look at that. <laughs> dude, that's, 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 that's almost nine feet, dude. That's like almost nine feet. <laughs> How did he do that? Like, the guy's bench press has got to be either, like, 800 pounds or somehow Bates <laughs> just, like, this little bitch that just didn't even know how to resist him. People who and fucking just fly out of windshields fly less distance than this push when they're in a car accident. That's oh, true. No. Right? That's true. That's a fucking... Look at this. He's like the this is uh what's it called? Uh Thor from the Marvel movies. Bitch, it's still a bitch push. It's because that's how oh, bitches get pushed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> well, pussy okay, he flies, he flies back. He Come flies back. back. Like this, he's ah. like on wire killing him back. Like he's in a fucking martial arts film. Crashing tiger mates. And they attach the wires. Right, like a crouching tiger, and it pulls crouching him. Crouching tiger, hidden mace. <laughs> don't, 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 don't push him. Don't, don't, don't push. Don't, don't push him, dude. Now here's where Big Fox stop. Okay, is this 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 shot Getting right here? Getting this fucking bitch mace out of his fucking uh, gay ass fanny pack. Look, look at the look on his face <laughs> where he's like. Fucking down, totally emasculated, totally humiliated, like he's uh, a total beta. Bitch. And he knows. And he's rolling. Remember, right. this he's is rolling, what, right? This is why where IRL streaming gets dangerous because he knows in his mind the chat's all gonna call him beta unless he pulls out the content spray, <laughs> oh, right? No, right? So he knows he knows unless he wants the chat to call him like but a beta and a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not quite. But, you know, you've once again one up Skeletor in this bid for dominance. Why do we have to dunk on him so much? I don't know. It is what it is. Captain Picard, the USS Enterprise. We gotta make play the cards. So. Make it so. Make, Yo, it so. make it so. Make it so. By the way, I don't. 
I mean, this is j- just more of me uh, uh, observing. If you look at his facial expressions, sort of like his mannerisms, even before he was shoved, right? It's he great. he looks used, man. Like those drugs are hitting him bad, man. I'm telling you, man. Like like believe me, I was a cokehead for a little bit, and you become like the the former a former shell of who you are. And Bank needs to cut it out, whatever he's doing, man. Seriously, if he's doing lines, look once in a while, you want to do them. I, I'm not gonna wait, judge. Wait, but every and, day. And- that's like, true. He's that's true. And he's like coughing and he's like, looks wait, sick, wait. dude. We, we know, we know he's on the coke. We know, we know. But I'm going to say, somebody in chat, Link, Flink says, PvP sure does enjoy bashing right wing personalities. Welcome to the fucking show, Retari. Bash baked Alaska fucking every other episode. This guy's worth bashing. You should be, you should be happy to bash baked Alaska. Not, he's worth wait, it. Wait. No, sorry. May I say one thing? I want to say something right, right now. PPP linked me an article. It's a um, a write up on this thing, and it's you know bashing baked Alaska. It's He's a, a um, fucking retard. It's on the news, right? Bashing. But on the news, they refer to him. They refer to him as a right wing guy. All right, to troll. me, and to me, who I'm a right, I'm, I'm on the right, and people watching the show. If you're on the right, you should be. Bashing right wing personalities. Hail Saint Tarot. How's that for a right wing personality? You F slur funny guy. <laughs> How about you just fuck off? How about you go to hell? hell? I a K slur fucking G slur funny guy. You. <laughs> so. <laughs> All right, thanks, sir. For, that's uh, that was just, uh, suck my fucking that's, cock. That's user generated content, by the way. That was just a green screen. People we don't know using. what those. We don't know what those numbers. Oh, those I don't even know. What's going we don't on. know. I don't even know. <laughs> but but here's the thing: is he, this <laughs> this motherfucker like, uh, yeah, he he's definitely like embarrassing the people on the right. So you should be happy that we're bashing him because I don't want to be like the news article refers to what I like. You know what I mean? That we would sort of be in. Right. And it's sort of like, I'm not, I don't want to wait a minute. In this. Everybody on the show is white. So nobody white, on the show white? should be left wing. Yeah. White, white. You know what I mean, is, I don't know how, I don't know how white people are still left wing. It's like a self hatred. I, 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 99.4% white European. But you know what? At least Justo gives us all legal weed and free money. So what can you say? Fuck it's it, Justo. Fuck it, man. Justo. Justo. Let's go. Justo's oh, go. going to fuck you up so hard you don't even know. But anyway, go ahead. Go. my door now. Don't wow. scream don't fucking in his face. Quit blocking my door. Don't whoa. scream in his face. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't, don't push my bro. Don't, don't, don't push him. Don't, don't, don't push. Don't, don't push him, dude. I'm not you fucking kidding me? You're a little pussy. <laughs> You're the shake, by the way. The shake. He knows it. Like he has it on the science. He practiced on Master Milo's penis. That's yeah. what Ethan Ralph used to call him. By the way, is Master Milo. Master Milo. <laughs> 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 He holds it for a while too, eh? Fuck you, dude. You're being a little. Look at that second one. Is done. Huh? But the bouncer is so alpha, where like he just no sells it. Like this is pro wrestling. Like he just he starts giving them orders like less than well, five PvP, seconds. PVP. I I explain it this way. Have you ever played the 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 the, the Demon Souls or or Dark Souls series of video games before? I have pretty tough there. His, his poise is so hot he, he doesn't affect him. His poise is like 43. He's like fine. He's yeah. fine. High level. His high so level high. poise. Yeah. High level poise. He passed the charisma check. Yeah, yeah. He rolled a D20. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, he attacked he rolled a D20. Like he rolled a D20 and it's like the fucking dungeon master went nothing happened when they sprayed mace on your face for 35 <laughs> seconds. He's he wearing hackles right. Yeah, somehow and he you, rolls a crit. You know, you you fucking grew up, and your your parents taught you like how to like defend yourself, and you know, you, he's you wearing Happel's ring. Yeah. 
He goes, chemical assault. Chemical assault. He's like, I know the legal term for this. Fuck you, bitch. And Baked was booked. Now, anyway, they just go blah, 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 mm -hmm. laws and stuff, complain. And then they're like, by the way, so they meet the police. Well, they didn't meet the police. Police met them. And handcuffed Baked. And they're like, yo, yo, we have the... Uh, he was defending himself, right? We have video of it. I'm like, why would you show cops the video? Like, this is like, that's the worst. The video like proves his guilt. Yeah, so look, the video is listen, I'm, call, I'm, calling the, I'm calling the bar right now. I'm calling them right, right now. I'm phoning the bar. We're phoning the Here bar. Here we go. I'm phoning the bar. And, say, Hi, I'm calling about an incident that occurred about a night ago at your establishment with amazing. Do you have any comments on that? Uh, I wasn't here the other day, but a couple of people out there were saying uh, something happened about someone getting pepper sprayed, but I don't, I don't know too much, too much about it. Do, do you think people should be pepper spraying people like that in a wanton matter, manner? Uh, I'm not too sure. Well, it's say no, buddy. What are you saying? Really it's not good. It's not good, is it? You shouldn't pepper spray people like that. Ah, oh, pussy ass bitch hung up on me. What a what a questionable character. What yeah, a questionable, questionable character. character. That's good. Yeah, that's what I meant to but, say. But, but he goes, like, like he asks him a, a question where you should clearly say, you should clearly go, yeah, of course, pepper spraying someone would be wrong. Up. You shouldn't do this. Like, like, ah, I don't know. Like, he thinks you're this, you're. This is so stop. He won't even go to bat for his own job. <laughs> it's it's no, the honor. Yeah. no honor. No honor. No honor. You know what? Probably we probably no uncovered honor. something. We probably uncovered that bartender probably hates the bouncer. Like the bouncer fucked his yeah, girlfriend he's or douche. something. He's like, you know what? I actually no, don't like, mind that situation that just happened. I'm going to. You know what? what? If the bouncer relinquished his duty, that kitchen staff would get raped by the drunken <laughs> patrons. You know, he ought to show her staff. I've been a bouncer. I've been a bouncer. It's not easy. It's not easy to be security. You know, you have to deal with some real assholes, you know, like fuck. No, he didn't. Is what he, it is. You're right. He didn't even go. Like, it, he didn't even go to bat. Like, you shouldn't pepper well, spray people. Of all, wantonly, on, first you know, of all, you it, shouldn't do that. It's two That's layers. First uh, of all, you shouldn't. But you shouldn't think people should be based like maced for no reason anyway. But then on top of that, it's, it's a guy who should be your pal. You see him. Hey, what's up, Jim? How you doing? It's your, it's your compatriot. It's oh. your buddy. Here's where, here's where we're going to look at it. We're going to look at it by the letter of the law. And then we're going to look at it by what the reality of it is at the bar. Right. So look, the letter of the law says... The reality is the bouncer can remove you from the property. And the bouncer did remove Bake from the property. 100%. Bake refused. The bouncer is an agent of the owner. He is an agent of the property owner. Therefore, he is exercising the rights of the owner to evict whoever they want from the property. You know, if you're a right-wing guy and you respect capitalism, you respect private property, yeah. you respect the fact that you can remove people from your private property. Even libertarians and ANCAP people realize if you violate the NAP, like they did, then you can be removed. So everybody by the letter of the law realizes Baked was removed. What does he do? He's 10 feet away. There is no threat to him. This is not self-defense. No bodily harm or threat to him whatsoever. None. He sits there, his back to the bouncer. His back to the bouncer. So if the bouncer really was a threat to him, the bouncer would have been on top of him. Boom. Boom. His right threat. Well, Truly, here's an interesting bouncer, thing. if he wanted to follow him off the property, could have and knocked him the fuck out. And probably still would have got away with it. A bouncer exercises restraint. Sits there, baked from 10 feet away, uncocks a pepper spray, from fucking six feet away, sprays him not once, but twice. And then the bouncer is still there and baked runs away like a pussy. So there is no self defense argument. The footage reveals him to be it's a piece done. of shit. And he was, he was, he was charged. But actually, I wanted to say that's what, we were talking about the that's why the letter of the law. Now, let's talk about why what actually happens at the bar. So what actually happens at the bar is sometimes bouncers are douchebags. Sometimes bouncers just want to start a fight at the club because they're bored. Or, and they'll yeah, come up to you and yeah. your group of fucking seven or eight guys, and I've had it happen to me. 
where the bouncers just pick a fight and start a 20-man brawl because they're bored as fuck on a Friday night and they're going to police a billiards game where somebody drops a glass or somebody's too drunk and they decide to be a fucking hero about it even though their bar makes its profit off alcoholics and fucking drunks. That's the truth. Like me. The bouncers come in. So look, if the bouncer pushed bait, bait came back and fucking punched the bouncer and knocked him out. That's different. That's a different story. The bait doesn't He's even come, come back and retaliate with a punch or a push of his own. He fucking uncorks a pepper spray, escalates it to the next level. And he's lucky that 10 other bouncers. Is at my bar, what would happen is eight other bouncers would come out. And, and we would nine, up ten ways. We would, we would nine way on one, beat the fuck out of Bake, put him to the floor and with steel toe boots, kick him again and again until he gets his blood. And that's the truth of what a real bouncer staff would have done. Bake was lucky to get away with it. He did because I'll tell you this. Any security company I've ever worked for that wasn't a big security company would come down on that motherfucker with the wrath of God. And he's just lucky some motherfucker didn't have a riot baton to fucking crack his kneecaps. He's, no, he's been lucky. He but he's been lucky that way every single every single time this Roll has happened. He rolls the dice. Even, even in Canada, you're lucky you don't get a fucking riot baton to the leg. Seriously? Yeah. Yeah. In America, oh. in America, it's a whole other fucking world. It where is. You are going to get beaten fucking senseless. I'm going to go. Got, I'm going to go pee right I've before I'll be right Do back. it. I've been on the other side of it where the bouncers come in and be douchebags and try and beat you up. I've been on the other side of it. I know. And that's not what it was with Bane. That is not what it is. He was not beaten up because he was white. He claims that on Twitter later. He was beaten up and arrested because he was white. What? Wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. He did? He did. No, he or didn't. not him. He blocked me. It's he blocked not... me on all, all the accounts. Oh, it may not have been Bake that say that. I'll be honest. It okay. was one of his supporters. Oh, it was his... one of his supporters who says he's arrested for being white. I'll Fuck be honest. I won't be a dude. Yeah, tag. it's all good. But it's pathetic. It's like if you think that you're like... He's been lucky so many times with the police. How many times have you watched a police interaction with Bait Alaska and you go, how the fuck did he get out of the... I'd be, I'd be in cuffs. I'll tell you how it happens because Bait Alaska is probably a federal informant. And even with these charges he faced today, somehow he walks out without a bail bond. Somehow he walks out on his own reconnaissance. How is that possible? Yeah. How is that possible that he's released without bail or bond? If it was me or Andy Worski, we'd be in cuffs today. Yeah. Seriously. Cuffs today. If somehow baked his Our able bail to, would be like $10,000 or $5,000 or some shit. Five, five, five grand at least for that. Yeah. Now he's charged with three misdemeanors. We'll get into it. He is probably... Worst case, going to face three to six months in jail. He's probably going to get away without jail time, but let's hope not. But it, honestly, watch. But honestly, even though these charges have been filed, watch him walk on all of them and it'll all be sweeped under the rug. But because there are people like me around that just don't give a fuck, I will still report on the fact that he got off on these charges. And I'll tell you, if he gets off on these charges, even though he's guilty of sin, how can Nick Fuentes say he's not a fed when he's hanging out with Milo? Who, by the way, the is a fed. No. No. Oh, hold on. But Milo Yiannopoulos is an informant in Signs v. Kessler. And in Signs v. Kessler this week, Milo's privileges as a journalist have been revoked. He has to reveal all his sources. So if you had if you had communicated with Milo, it was illegal. I would suggest you flee the country now. Get the fuck out now, because Milo's snaking you all next week to the feds. Speaking of which, Milo has just came out about these charges that Bait Alaska has. <laughs> And he has said this. 
Baked Alaska is a mentally unstable clown and a drug addict with zero political convictions. He just wants to be famous at all costs. His opinions change on a monthly basis depending on who he last spoke to. If you associate with him, you deserve the inevitable problems that he will cause you. One of the worst employees I have ever had. He wept and begged when I fired him from Breitbart, but it was the best decision I ever made. Even Milo. If Milo saying this about you, that's a fucking low blow. Well, see, the thing is, is that's that like Milo Monday recognizes get, be, get my, Milo. My, Milo recognized his behavior a long time ago. He saw the signs, and what we're seeing right now is the manifestation of these behaviors. Mm -hmm. Taking with no one's corralling him, no oh. one's controlling him. He's I know. A, I know a lot of you in chat are America first. I know a lot of you probably in chat have supported Nick Fuentes or Baked Alaska. But I want you to go back and watch the interview where Milo Yiannopoulos interviews Nick Fuentes on his own turf. Godwinson does a video on this, his Michelle Malkin video. We don't have time to show it. But here's the thing. On that video, Milo Yiannopoulos says he's an unreconstructed Zionist. <sighs> it encourages Nick Fuentes to go with him on that path. And Nick Fuentes not only entertains Milo, but endorses Milo on that same call where he says he's an unreconstructed Zionist and an unrepentant homosexual. Oh. I will tell you, I will tell you guys this. If you can stomach that interview and still give money to Nick Fuentes, go ahead. But I'll tell go you ahead. this, guy. Be, be legit with yourselves. This is a show with three degenerates. It is true. more honest to you than America first. A hundred percent true. Drunk, as drunk and as high as we are, yes. it is a more honest show than America first right now. And when you have to face the fact that the degenerate three in the morning crew is more honest than your <laughs> eight o'clock news, it's that's true. a tough fact to face. Well, here's the thing Serious is, to God. Well, here's the thing is too. Some people were like, oh, like, you're making fun of Baked for, like, we, we went over him when he was, it wasn't even, like, making fun of it. I was just, like, like disgusted when he went up to, like, a bunch of employees. Well, no, no, was here's the problem, too, is problems. that, like, but the right, thing is, people, right. people said this, people went, uh, oh, but you think you're better? I'm like, look, I'm not saying I'm better. I've done a lot of fucked up shit. We all have. Everyone's I think we're more honest. But the thing is, oh. Why are you mad at me that I'm going, listen, you've like, you're yelling at like, this is like the eighth employee. You've maced like nine people at this point. You're fucking hanging out with a bunch of druggies. You're doing all this crazy shit. You're taking advantage of mentally ill girls. Like, I can criticize you now. I'm sorry, okay. Bake. Like, don't be, don't be sure mad. Is. You caused these crazy sure situations is. that I criticize. You want to see me go out on a limb and not just criticize Bake and all these guys? You know what? After the Texas decision was dismissed by the Supreme Court today, Donald, Donald Trump will not be president after no. January 20th. Yeah. That's, the, and truth. that's the fucking truth. Nick, and Nick Fuentes will tell you that Donald Trump will be the president after January 20th. Here's how Trump can still win, here, guys. But I'm here to tell you that it's a cope. Black pill, so, yeah. No, it's not no, a black it, pill. It's a real pill. No, it's real. It's for them, the truth. it's a black pill. For them, it's a black pill. They say that the Texas lawsuit is fucking guaranteed. It's going to put Trump into the best. Impossible. But this lawsuit is literally on behalf of, like, New California. Yeah. And these states and that don't Nevada. even exist. Hold on. Let me explain this to you. In the <laughs> briefing, it lists New California and New Nevada as litigants. But they're not even states. <laughs> New Vegas. Man. New Vegas. This guys. comes from like a real Trump supporter. No. Like, I love Trump and I bet John Lacey. My Aunt Cindy's fucking liberal faggot boyfriend. No. No. Liberal funny no. guy. I funny guy. guy. He is that Trump would win. No. No, no, wait, tell him no stars. Trump has let us down. It's just a fucking grip. Hang on. It fucking grip to the individual states for this Texas lawsuit. It's just a LARP. Because they don't want to win. 
They just want to grift us. We they just, just want to grift us for Trump TV. I, I agree with I agree with him, but I have to say I disavow. Trump TV. Right. Hail Saint Ron. All right. No. Oh no, they understand. Well. It slips out once in a while. But here's the thing is uh, Nick Fuentes says the F slur on his show eight eighteen times an episode. And Andy Surfer is and he gets away with it. And he gets and, away with and, it. And, 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 I, have, I have to be careful. I have to be careful. And and, 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 and Surfer is user submitted content. He is. Well, well, he doesn't know. He, yeah, sorry about he that. No, he's user submitted fine. content. It happens. It happens. But um Hang on, let me... Oh, do we have more donos? Holy, there's so many. Go, go. My name is Nobody for a Diamond saying, why biggers always be fronting? Be calling True. for a diamond saying, does PPP plan on having kids? Who does he... And also, who does he respect number one? Do you, are you going to have kids? Well... No, PPP. I think I'll have... She... I, I think that... It if I can find a female to bear my children, sure, I'll have kids. I think it's a good thing. I'm in favor of that. All that sort of thing. So far as I respect the most, it's a tough fucking call. You know, I really am preferential to Kenny Hotz in terms of my comedic <laughs> uh, influence. I love Kenny. I love Kenny versus Spenny. I love the Trailer Park Boys. I respect those yeah. guys a lot. In terms I, of their I comedy, did. in terms of their influence on me. Yo, but I, I also. APPB, I did stand up back in the day with Spenny. A few times. Oh, fuck. A well, you times. probably crushed Huh? My, my brother went to college in Kingston, and Spenny is known as like <laughs> this like, total alcoholic that like sponges for change outside of the bars. <laughs> and for real, like, that's what Spenny is. Like, Spenny is low. Have you seen the uh, the Paldemic team up? Uh, the Kenny and Spenny special they did for COVID. Have you seen it yet, Andy? No. So if you sign up for something called CBC Gem, uh -oh. you can watch it. But look, I recommend you don't watch it. It's actually <laughs> embarrassing to the legacy of the show. <laughs> Spenny is Spenny is so pathetic. He's literally eating toilet paper and drinking hand uh, sanitizer. No. He's doing this shoe nice plunger. too. Yeah, and he's taking a plunger up his ass for like no money. No. It's pretty pathetic. He's doing like those donos like, for like really embarrassing things. Yeah. Yeah, like he's basically at the level of a YouTube streamer. He's like a glorified like <laughs> D live streamer, like it's top. <laughs> Fuck D live. Like, D live. No, like, no, no, no. He's like doing this. Don't take that. Doing yeah, this shit. He's joke. doing this shit when he could no, be on joke. national television. It's tough. Yeah. You pray for Spenny, but most likely he's going to die passed out the puddle of his own puke on the streets of Kingston. He owes thousands <laughs> of child support. No way. He owes David Wolfish $10,000. Oh. No, Wolfish. Remember, Wolfish had to put down his dogs because Spenny didn't come up with the money he owed him. <laughs> Wolfish, Wolfish's beautiful pugs had to be put to sleep. Oh, that's fun. Those of you who, yeah, Wolf, who, wait, who has Wolfish. the bigger fall then? Spenny or Spoony? Well, Spoony, I would say, Spenny. bro. It's, I mean. Kyler is well, gonna get some water. He'll, wait, wait, he's gonna. I'm gonna get some water. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Yeah. All right. Cool. No, Spenny had a bigger fall, but he could at least shove a pl plunger up his ass to make a couple bucks. Spoony's like fucked. He makes like ten yeah. cents a stream. You know. Sad. Well, you know what? I, but the sad thing is, if Spoony actually got off his ass and started working, he would make more than any of us. It's just like Spoony is like fucked up mentally. Where he like hates himself, even though like he was an inspiration to a lot of kids, and you know even guys his age really respect him and his work that he put in, even though he fucked everybody out of money. There are very few guys who can fuck people out of money and still have support and still yeah. have people respect them. Booney somehow is at that level. He transcends anybody on this show. Somehow it is what it is. Rooney is what he is. He is a fucking legend. If he came back, he would do well. But 
he's like fucked up in the head mentally. Like he's 40 years old. When you turn 40, like he has, and you have nothing. Your house has been foreclosed on. You're moving back in. His into girl your left him, right? His girl left him oh. because he she was working a part time job at Subway. He wouldn't even get a part time job to fucking keep the mortgage afloat. Oh. He wouldn't even turn on a webcam. To get donos, like come on, come on, That's man. Fucked, like, man. Yeah, he he gave know? up, man. He gave up. Like it's like his brain, his body, whatever it is. He just gave up. Like there's like this moment where and I said in that video that was popular, and it is true. No matter how talented you are, if you stop working and you stop doing anything, no matter how talented you are. There are a lot of guys who get by on their talent and their brains. I was one of those guys. If you stop working and you be a lazy cunt mm -hmm. at school or at work, you are going to get fucked. It's gonna you, are gonna pay, you are going to pay the price. Be I, careful. I paid the price, dude. When I, when I fucking stopped streaming and I started doing fucking dumbass streams and I did that, I wasn't be, like doing... And then it ended with the culmination of aim, aim, right? But I was comfortable for a while. Then I started doing drugs and shit. And then I like as, had we, spiral, as we all did, mental we spiral, love personal life, and all this. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We all but, had a spiral. And then fucking, it, it took some self reflecting, and obviously, like I've come back. But it, you're right, PPP. If I were to start being a lazy fuck to this like now. Oh, guys, I'm going to miss a stream here or there. I'm going to be late all the time. When we this, I'm playing that. Cyberpunk 1488. Yeah, yeah, exactly. If I do that, people are going to eventually start leaving and then go, fuck you, right? Spoonie is one of those guys. All he has to do is be con in this job, in this career, or even if you do it as a hobby and want viewers, it's about consistency. The moment you fuck off, people like only a few Noted. people they can notice. post once every few months, like a John Tron. Uh, I don't know, but so it just depends. If you're so talented, if you're Spoonie, if you're Mr. Medicare, if you're whoever, you can disappear and it doesn't even matter. You come back, people will watch. But that person is a one in a thousand, one in a million yeah. personality. Most people are not like that and they will not recover. Spoonie to this day, if he went back to work, and he people would be there. Chair, people would be there. Even once a month, he would make enough money to survive. He has just unfortunately given in to depression. He has given in to nihilism. He has given in to apathy because it is comforting to him. Well, and he it, can, 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 can I say real quick that I, I am diagnosed with major depressive disorder? I am. Like, I don't, I'm not sure if I believe in all that, like, psychologic, like, like mumbo jumbo, like, uh, you know, bullshit. But I am diagnosed clinically with major depressive disorder. And I'll say one thing, too, that depression is fucking gay. If you have it, you're fucking gay. <laughs> <laughs> just pick uh, yourself up, you know? You're just, you're just fucking fucked. You're just fucking different than There's, everybody else. Yeah, like, it's okay. Fuck. It's okay to be different. Just, you gotta... Yeah, but the thing, well, 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 the, the thing is, though, is you gotta fucking deal with it. Like, you can't, you can't lay in bed for, like, two months straight and not shower. You gotta fucking... You gotta get up and deal with it. You do. You do really do. You gotta get up and deal with it. Yeah. Uh, hang on. Everybody, that's everybody, that's everybody, fucking, that's everybody the has to get up and do something. You get air. Everyone, point, that's you true. Everybody has to get up and do something. Everybody has to get up and do and something. This is for you, buddy. Keep up the good work. Hell yeah. Let's Thank, fucking you, my fine, sir. Thank you, my fine sir. You got you to fucking fast here, I would ask, by the fucking balls. I have to ask PVP something about uh, something that people were mentioning in chat. What's your thoughts on, on Medicare and what's happened with Medicare? Because he's been gone for a minute, no? Well, I, I wonder if he's faking his cancer or not. I don't know. He might I, be. I just am not sure. You I, never, I think that you never know. Doesn't, yo, your you server never just know. threw a ninja guinea, by the way. <laughs> Surfer, thank you so much. Yo, uh, tell, tell, tell Surfer thank you for thank throwing you. a ninja guinea. Appreciate it. Dude. Thank you for the ninja guinea, buddy. And, he loves you. And, but look, and, and I, I don't, don't know. I don't know. Minute, guys. Yeah. Go ahead. 
I don't know if Jim is being sincere with the cancer or not. What I know is, back in the day, Jim would make fun of anybody that would say that they have cancer or try and milk their illness for money, this sort of thing. So what I do is I make fun of Jim for his illness. Because if he seriously has the illness, he probably appreciates being treated normally, more so than he does being treated like a freak, that he's different because he has cancer. Yeah. So well, he, I well, he is a freak, but not for that reason. Yeah. So I treat him the exact same as if he didn't have cancer, which means I call him out. I say, "Debate me, Jim. You were wrong about the new project, too, Jim. Shit like this." You know, Jim's off doing his own thing, but what Jim has to realize is the last stream he ever did is with me. So unless he wakes up from his cancer. No, unless he wants the last memory of him to be with just me. Just wake up from your Yo, cancer. Just wake up from your cancer. That. You're good. Just I'll, wake up. Just wake up. Yo, I was thinking about that today. I'm like, last time I heard Medicare's voice was on PPP stream, right? And you fucking railed on him for the Dick well, Masterson stuff there. I don't know if he's embarrassed because he was wrong about Dick, if he really has cancer, if he just wants to grift people for subscribe star. Mm -hmm. I don't mm -hmm. fucking know. And, and can we At stay the for the, the day, record we're all here right now? Dick Masterson, Diddler Dax is a fucking pedophile, fucking funny guy. I would I mean he supports can pedophilia. We say he supports can we pedophilia. Say that? He supports I'm pedophilia. Not, I'm not gonna go in. He oh, does yeah, I want a beer. I all right, I'll do the land me, shark logger, the personal me, beer me, of Jimmy let me, Buffett. Let me, let me phrase it differently. He does things that leads us to believe yes, that he that's might more, be. That's he more might appropriate. Be. Yeah. No, but, um, that has, guys, I'm sorry to interrupt, but if I could just smash through a few of these uh, super chats here, and then we'll get into Diddler Dax. Fuck the bait stuff. Three charges. He's released. There we go, everyone. I've kept up. Everyone knows the lore on this. We get it. And bakes a home or whatever. And okay. we'll update yeah. you when we know more. We promise. We got Diddler Dax to Diddler take Dax, on. We have to. Yo, it's 4 a.m. I want to get to Diddler on. Dax. Yeah. You kidding me. Let's go. So Let's first class for a diamond saying, N-word, you better hydrate. Uh, as always, melanated for a diamond Bro. saying, dude, I didn't do anything. Nick calling for a diamond saying, this is why Kyler is the best co-host is when you phone that place. Uh, Dorado, Texas for a diamond saying, has Fuentes responded on baked? I don't think so. Patrix uh, for a diamond saying, Kyler for the win. Dorado, Texas yeah. saying, bait got maxed, then bouncer sipped base like tea. <laughs> Kevin Gouda for a diamond saying, the employee must consider Antifa calling OPSEC. First last for a diamond saying, baked had two seconds to spray after that he fucked up. Dorado, Texas for a diamond saying pepper spray in fanny pack hype, by the way. Drono Texas for a diamond saying, I know fed to fed, fed to be fed for five years. Kevin Kuda for a diamond saying, if Victor Alaska was legit, uh, white nationalist, he would be locked up for 20 years. Bridging Humanist for a diamond saying Milo is correct. Drono Texas for a diamond saying fuck America first. First last for a diamond saying Nick called Milo out on his homo, uh, a homo to his face. Uh, Life in Hell for a diamond saying bait looks like scuffed Tom Green. Ferocious Chihuahua for a diamond saying fuck Baked Alaska and his nose too. Ail Anderson for a diamond saying low IQ white nationalists haven't realized that you won't 14 if you 88. And, and we have Surfers and Ninja Kini there. Thank you again, Surfer, for that. Merry Christmas, bro. I Captain Picard. I suck my fucking cock. Yeah, Rage of Humanist for a diamond. Have MDD, PTSD, GAD. Kyler is my motivation. By the way, everyone following a Raging Humanist. He's an awesome I, guy. I, I have MDD and PTSD as well, my friends. And we got and we're first here. last for it. Ninja Kini. Massive dono. <laughs> Thank you so fucking much. And uh, I... He, I missed what he said, actually. Long, Medicare is king. Long live Medicare. And last one, I think. Hang on. Uh, D Shot Refer Diamond. The jokes are too funny, but Dick does not support pedo. Wait, what? D Shot and 200 to 300,000 died of typhus in the Holocaust, buddy. And no, then the, the rest were killed by it. Yeah. Yeah, it was six, six million. million. Six, 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 it was more. Six it was like million ten. Died in the whole it was like That's ten. Dude. It was a tragedy. That's it sad. should never be forgotten. Oh, yeah. Never again. Somber. Everyone, can we make a can we make a, a promise? Can we make a promise right now? Never again, guys. Never again. 
Never a game will happen. Never I fucking watch. That guy was never. crazy, never dude. Again. Never again means never again, Nick Fuentes. Please stop it. We're trying to save, save it. Be optical. Please oh. be optical, Nick Fuentes, in your choice of operatives. Please be optical. And we have. We're trying. To we have Surfer for a diamond saying, with Jews you win, except with the Lerdax. <laughs> Nick calling for a diamond saying, BP, <laughs> what's your opinion on, okay, uh, you already just talked about that, and Deshattery for a diamond saying, again, jokes, but Dick is a good person, you know this. Okay, so let's Dick talk about- is a good person? Do we, okay, I mean- Oh, I sent, oh I sent no. you a link just now. Actually, I yes. I sent you a link just now. I know what you showed Play me. This. I know what you're gonna show me. Here we go. Play this without interruption to the audience. We're all gonna shut the fuck up. Yeah. And let Digibro speak for himself. Yeah. So Digibro, so, bro. This is, this is. You don't got one. This is um, Dick Masterson's friend who he defends. Here we go. You want vanilla? You want to fuck your vanilla brother? Look, I'm Vincent. describing. I'm describing my fantasy. Let me describe my beautiful fucking fantasy to you. This guy with the higher pitch voice. This guy is Digi Bro, and he's gonna be explaining yeah. his fantasy to everyone. Here we go. Monkey, let me describe what I want from my siblings. life. What I want, all I want, is to have. A cute little lolly sister who's grown up with me, who looks up to me, who we understand everything about each other, we get along just right, and she thinks I'm the coolest in the world, and we just say, we just, we just get away from society, we go out Whoa. to live in the mountains in a cabin, Whoa. just the two of us, and we spend all our time together, she takes care of the house, I make anime videos and make money that way, and we get to have a little sex on the side, and it's just a what? <laughs> what the fuck is this video, dude? Quiet life. It gets it's worse. Quiet life out in the mountains. Nothing complicated. Nothing. Nothing retarded. No. No taboos or any of this other extra no. shit. Just no. Just me no. and my cute little sister quietly enjoying life Tyler, until right. she's too old and we have to commit double suicide because she's not attractive <laughs> anymore. Whoa. Um, and he's also talking about, about CP Lolly, right? This is what he's into. So, this guy reviews like anime, Olicon cartoons, all this sort of shit. He's into it. I think he's a pedophile. I think he's a danger. Children, I really do. And Dick defends this. He defends this comment. What does he defend? defends the like? other disgusting. Well, he says that it's ethical to jerk off to Lollicon because no child is at harm. For pedophiles Ain't like Digibro, it's harmless to enable their pedophilia and build up their urges to the point where when you're masturbating to it, it's not enough. Yes, then you're going to have yeah, It's like blood and in the not, water for a shark, right? And, and not only that, but whenever he said that shit, he said that you... He said, "He said you in in the broad sense, the, the 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 grand sense. Like you imagine yourself as a submissive person, the woman in the porno. Oh, yeah. That was, was weird. Wait wait wait, 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 wait. Whenever he said that, somebody I forgot who was on. They 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 they, they pushed back against. It. I was like, no, you don't. It was Josh Moon. He's like, no, Gosh. you don't. And then and then Dick, here we go, guys. Hold on. <clears throat> Dick was like, yes, you." Fucking oh yeah, he does that a big scream. The one like when he called me a cokehead there, and he was like, when I was You're like, "Hey, you got fucking," I'm like, "If you care about free speech so much, then why did you get fucking Jesse banned off fucking Patreon?" And then oh, for saying the n word to your black friend. And by the way, at this time I wasn't even I didn't even hear the audio, but now I know that what I said is right. But then he goes, you fucking cokehead. It's like, you fucking cokehead. Um, first of all, I don't do coke anymore. Why are you? Go ahead. Look, the reality is Dick does Hollywood lines every day if his lifestyle is to be believed. Yeah. So for him, for him to call anyone a cokehead is joke. You ask Ralph. Now, we shouldn't ask Ralph. But the reality is Ralph is going to witness Dick use coke many times this weekend. The reality is, if if this fucking Digibro guy is at this event, it's not going to go well. I hope he's not there no. at the fucking road rage because he's a greasy fucking dude, greasy as he's fuck. He's a pedophile <laughs> fucking funny guy. He's a pedophile funny guy. But Dick, Dick, this guy is so pathetic that Pantsu would rather get thumbed 
than fucking deal with this shit. Yeah. That's all I'll say, but... But hang on, the, uh... <laughs> the, uh... The the mere fact that that uh, like when you bring this stuff up to them and you go it's like child pornography they go no it's not it's lolly yes, it's like lolly is a different way of saying it. it's like a different it's like a light it's like the methadone of child pornography basically it literally is like this is methadone why, this is why I don't even watch anime look watch <laughs> Dragon Ball Z as a kid Jesus. watch. I watched One Piece, Yu Yu Hakusho, Yu Gi Oh. These Japanese Yu Yu Hakusho is fucking base, dude. It's Japanese you, programs, but this is what I'm gonna say. Right, this is what I'm gonna say. Don't ever, ever, ever start watching like Akira and then be sucked in and be. Oh, it's an animated masterpiece. It's poison. It's fucking because, mind poison, dude. Akira, Akira, Akira is even, the fucking gateway. Akira is the gateway to mind poison. Because very Go soon you're going to be watching octopus tentacle porn, fucking mm -hmm. black high school weird anime. I'm hunting Don't for do girlfriends oh, in a dungeon. Black. And then these guys who started out just as guys who played video games, regular guys, guys you'd hang out with, are suddenly having these weird anime posters in the background, masturbating to girls who look 13 but are 500 years old in the lore, so it's okay there, guys. <laughs> look. And like, all, it, like, let's, let's be let's on. be let's be real here. Like, let's be honest. Before, let's be honest. Like, real honest. Like, right now, um, before, like in World War Two, Japan did some crazy shit. Whatever they sided with certain people and they did some certain things and they got two nuclear bombs dropped on them. Before those two nuclear bombs got dropped on Japan, they were a warrior culture. They did the samurai culture. They had honor. After those two bombs, they weren't the same. And after that, it was Hello Kitty and Tentacle Porn. Something's fucking wrong with their culture. I oh. I love I love Japanese history. I love the samurai stuff. It's fucking amazing. The honor the honor system was I think amazing. Culture is interesting. I think it's interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. Uh, but the thing is, the people now who are just in Japan love Hello Kitty and getting fucked up the anus by tentacles. That shit's nah, fucking. The reality and is, and, is, and, is that well, there's so many areas now now fucking look, who want that how shit. How bad it is. How how bad it's become with the submissive attitude of Japanese men. Low birth a man rate. like Low me is like, rate. Gojira! Gojira! And this somehow gets all the Japanese women over there somehow. Yes. Like, it's the, it's the white conqueror. And the Japanese men are cuckolded because America dropped two nuclear bombs. But if it wasn't for those bombs, Black Pigeon Speaks would never get laid. But let's face True. it, it all worked out for the good. <laughs> At the end of the day, like Black Pigeon we could, is getting we could to get his dick wet because of President Truman dropping those bombs. Sean the Skull today cries out his two hour revisionist history lesson. At the end of the day, is these Japanese motherfuckers were like fashioning bamboo into spears to fight the Americans in the last the man. Right. Hey, come on. There, let's uh, come on. crush them. Come on. Got a million dead. It would take a million dead to make these people submit. We can't even make Iraqis submit today. Fuck's sake. By the 60 way. years ago, we humiliated the Asians. Now we can't even beat brown people in a desert. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> so uh, do, you, do you think... Uh, so okay, that's the DigiBro thing. But, I mean, with the Dax stuff, there's so much to it. And obviously, there is... I, like, I don't know. I, I like... I, I know. I, I don't know if he's doing it for attention or whatever, um, or any of this because. Does like, that make it okay? No, it doesn't does make, it, make okay. it okay. It doesn't make it okay. No, you're right. Because look, look, we're very politically incorrect. We sometimes show support for a lot of things a lot of people wouldn't agree with. But I'll tell you, there's no take that's as hot as we have. That is like that lollycon is okay. Or that child porn is ethical. No. Or that molesting kids is okay. No. And look, Did Diddler Dax is taking us down that slippery slope that the liberals say isn't real. That we've all realized is, is real. real. There is, is real. a slippery slope. Is real. It's not, it's not a fallacy. Look, it's not as though we couldn't possibly tolerate homosexuals or whatever. Look, we let them do their own thing in private. Somehow, the moment we let them get married and it's acceptable in society, then we hear the tranny thing. We got Desmond is amazing. Mm. And look, the homosexual oh. thing, it's like, look, fuck, they're weirdos or whatever. But 
They're they're telling us to I accept mean, people it's that not are not about hating you. homosexuals. Like you should have love for all people. You True. should have a Christian yes. morality. Well, oh, none of us people. are saying anything but bad like, about them. We're just saying homosexuality is a mental illness. The and trend, you know, the we, trend we is leading to help help bad these way. people be fucking cured, whether it be by electroshock therapy or whatever it may be. <laughs> yes. Look, we should help. Look, stop it, sir. Sir. Look, we should have we should have love for our fellow man. Jesus said 100%. we should. Well, the thing is, is though, is 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 we 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 should we should we should find the acts they commit despicable, but we should Look, love the person. I'll say this on the tranny issue: if a guy says that he's Napoleon and he's convinced that he's Napoleon, and he really believes that. It's not true. Well, we do put them in a fucking yeah. hospital. Yeah, we do. We put those people in a mental hospital. But if you say you're a woman, even though you have a penis, even though you look like a big, fat, masculine fuck like the big dog. We're being societally <laughs> conditioned to uh, coddle your mental illness. But they'll even, I've seen it where a person believes they're blind. Doctors yeah. in the UK blind them with acid. You, you, you see well, there's, the one, there's, there's, woman, there's there's the people who amputated her arm. There's people who think that 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 they person like like their their body their person shouldn't have any legs and they put their legs in a in a fucking tub full of ice and salt and shit and freeze their legs to the point where they get they have to get them amputated. That's insane. That's crazy town. But should we as society endorse that even though we know it's completely wrong no. for the individual? No. Now, Diddler, da Diddler Dax says yes. Diddler Dax is a fucking diddler. But most of us here are very libertarian in what terms of what we allow. We yeah, are very absolutely. free speech. We are very individual rights when it comes to firearms, things like this. <laughs> uh, you know, but he... He is supposed to be like libertarian, and we're libertarian. It's okay, but he is like just gone so far to where he's like, you know what? Even if you diddle kids, it's okay because it doesn't violate the NAP. Well, it see, does. Well, PPP, PPP. That's the thing. That's where that's where he disguises his hedonism, his un unabashed yes. hedonism with his liberty. He he, did, he masks it with his libertarianism. Like I'm a hedonist, but I'll mask it with my libertarianism as well. No, nah, he's he, he, it, it, it's you know you know he's, like he's almost a leve satanist he, almost. He, but here's the thing: even a true hedonist knows that his pleasures could be prolonged by not living the lifestyle Dax lives. So a true hedonist that's about you know pleasure over pain wouldn't live the lifestyle Dax lives. He's not even informed by that level of an ideology. What do you he's mean? He's just a base level animal. Like what's he's your... just a base level animal giving into instinct. Well, it's I would say he's almost truth. a Leve Satanist. Almost, almost a, Le a Leve and Satanist. What's a Leve and Satanist? What does that mean? Do as thou wilt. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. A Leve and Satanist at least knows the tenets of what they're claiming to be. Whereas Diddler Dax doesn't give a fuck about That's whatever true. ideological he framework has, he has. Framework yeah. What are you getting, Surfer? Surfer's getting some drug apparatus or something. Why do you suck my fucking cock? I don't know. Look, here's the fucking thing. I honestly think that Dax takes it way too far to even wear guys who are ANCAPs, even guys who are libertarians, and I know they exist out there. Oh, this is the Satanic Bible by Anton LaVey. See, Dax wouldn't own a book like this in his home because he doesn't read books. But he'll tell you how society works, even though he doesn't even read a fucking book ever once in his life. His vocabulary is that of a 16-year-old boy. And I've sent to you, Andy, on Discord, Dax in high school. Because you remember he said to me he's the prom king? Oh, yes. He's the prom king and he was popular in high school? Yes. I want to show you. I want to show everybody out there All how right. Dax actually was in high school. Do you Real know who fast. he was? Yeah. He wasn't even the president of the audiovisual club. He was the <laughs> vice president of the audiovisual club. The fucking gator before gator even existed, sweeping it up in high school for the <laughs> actual Chad of the drama club. Are you fucking kidding me? The second in command to the drama club? But he'll tell me he was the prom king? Real fast I was on here. the football team. Real fast, a fast Jewish benefactor donated 420 <laughs> saying a man with a Twitter, Twitter handle uh, 
the Twitter handle Larry posted a cryptic tweet alleging Dick would seek out 13 to 14 year olds to legally sleep with. Well, he puts legally in quotation marks, by the way. Yeah. Yeah. Would later claim it was a joke. Fun fact Dick's longtime friend for over two decades is also named Larry. Uh, But here we go. I'm going to put it on that thing. It's an interesting thing. That is completely, that is. That is as conjecture. I don't know. I don't have any like. But remember, uh, like, but remember, Dick's close associate or Dax, as we should call him, uh, Pedo Vito, defends Mr. <laughs> no, that guy he is, says that the girl thing. No, sexy. he brings up cuties. Every, I I finally unfollowed him and I bashed him on Killstream the other day. I was like, "Fuck you, Vito! You fucking you're always talk about cuties and all this shit, and that you're talking shit." And I, so I unfollowed him. He's like. Let's have a debate about cuties. I'm like, enough. No. I'm not going to debate cuties every fucking once a month. Oh, and she's there. Hang on. How about this? Don't look at young girls who are scantily clad or in a sexual way. The end. I don't have to debate that. It's it's called the veto challenge. Uh, Don't look. Andy, Andy, this is is what I'll say to you. Is, Is Dick Masterson on the level of Howard Stern? No. Not even close. So, wait a minute. So, when Howard has the whack pack, because this is how Dax excuses this, right? Well, Howard has the whack pack of all these crazy fucks, and so I have a whack pack myself. But the thing of it is, is Howard would never go on and defend the Klansman, say he was right. Wait a minute. Howard would never have one. He would would have them on and and, and goof on them. Yeah, he makes fun of them. Yeah, he would goof on them. So when Dick goes and defends Digibro, oh, it's oh. not like he's in the whack pack. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. You're right. That's wait, all I'm saying. wait, wait. He's not. He's not in. The, Digibro's not in the whack pack. He's in the Dax pack. He's okay. in the Dax pack. What the Dax pack becomes is like your bros for life because it's like unless you do the secret dirty pledge to Diddler Dax, like you're not going to be there for very long. Did anybody see the news, babe? That Diddler Dax brought in this week? Well, no, no I don't. I don't. I don't no. watch that. Sh- I don't. I don't no. watch the show. Uh, of course not. Nobody with a fucking nobody. Conscience no, one does. no, I get. I get the reports from my generals there. <laughs> anyway, I get the, the capos. The capos. I get the. I get the reports from the capos. The briefings. <laughs> the little dogs. <laughs> the little dogs. <laughs> say, the puppies. He say to me that Diddler Dax has hired a 44-year-old Asian woman to be the new news babe, and she's ugly as fuck. No. She's ugly as fuck. Go to Kiwi Farms. Go back a few pages. You can find it if you want, folks. But look, Someone's this ugly like... Asian woman. And Dick is saying it's, it's blessed because... <laughs> fucking nails for you. I get my female cousin. So I got this female cousin, Dorothy. She's like 23. Uh, I have no fucking idea what to get her for Christmas. Uh, you know? So she doesn't read books because she's a fucking woman. And women don't read fucking books with their fucking woman brains. So I go to the nails for you. And I walk up and it says... No mask, no service on the door. I walk in anyways. <laughs> and these fucking Chinese women and their fucking masks are just astonished. <laughs> that I'm just walking without a mask. And I said, listen here, you fucking insectoid fucking cunt. I'm looking for a gift card. <laughs> and they sold me a $25 gift card. I got service, even though I didn't have a mask. Wow. And they didn't even give me pushback. Why did I you suck know? my fucking cock? Listen here, you insectoid fucking cunts. <laughs> I'm exempt. <laughs> no, I oh, solid. Yeah, go ahead. The Lemon Emperor doesn't have a problem with that, but a simple no. F is no. the end of the line for the Lemon Emperor. I don't know where the not Lemon Emperor is. Not for Nick Fuentes. Not for, no, not for Nick Fuentes is fine, but for us, it seems the fucking line. No, we're it's good. Okay. We're, well, good. Owen, it's we're good. We're good. Owen we're good. Ben- we're good. Look, look, look. Owen, they, Owen Benjamin can name them. He can drop the K slur at will. And he, he does. He can drop it at will. 
and he does, and we can't because you know Owen's. But the one, the one show that didn't make on the ADL's hate watch we're list, the only the top ones. ten earners. Yeah, we're the, the only, only show not, that didn't make on the a, fucking hate list. We're not a hate show, this, by this, the way. We're like we're a a show. show. It's just edgy jokes. Who gives a fuck? Like, at some point, at some point in my outline for this show, when I drafted it in my pre work. We're going to talk about the Video Game Awards and Cyberpunk. I swear to God, we're going to get there. But Cyberpunk it might take is so out. fucking good, dude. I'm how about, so in how love. How about I get a fucking... I love How about I get a fucking beer right now? Do I'll it. get a beer right now. No, but I'm playing it with a 2080 no, Ti. No. A 2080 Ti. And it's so smooth right now. The game is so fucking fun and like epic. Andy. Holy fuck. I can't get enough of it. Go oh, Andy. Andy, I have an Xbox One S, buddy. Uh huh. So Andy, Andy, it's not happening. I can't play. Oh uh, yeah, I, I I heard it's all because, fucked for those systems. So like, I'm not. I've not bought it yet because I know that day one it's a lost cause. I'm going to be playing at like nine frames per second. Don't so my wait. Belief, my belief is if I wait at least three months to buy it, I might be able to play at fifteen frames a second. Yeah. Which. The reality is you can play at sub 20 frames per second. And honestly, if you just pretend that it, frame rates don't exist, maybe you can make it through it. Look, before anybody knew what a frame rate was, we used to play on like the Xbox and the GameCube and the PS2 that had frame rates go sub 20 frames all the fucking time. I remember playing Enter the Matrix on the original Xbox. Oh, my God. Shit's going, shit's going sub five frames. Shit's going like fucking so slow. But it's like, well, you're in the Matrix, so it is what it is. You just excuse it at the time. You don't even know what a frame rate is. Nowadays, um, you people know what are I got? By the way, Vito's in chat saying subscribe to Vito. Uh, Vito. Vito. Go, 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 go do more dude. fucking tweets about uh, fucking cuties or whatever, whatever you do. Oh, anyway, you know what? He has this. the opportunity this, to You'll come on this. the kill stream. You'll, 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 he has the this. opportunity to come on the kill stream and blow us all, blow Ralph out. He didn't do it. He, he failed. Did. But yeah. but you, you hear this. I'm playing with uh, fucking 60 frames a second with some yeah. drops during like heavy driving super fast with thousands of people around you. That's where I'll, I'll drop some frames to like 40, 45, but usually it's 60. And it's, it's smooth as butter everywhere else. But ray tracing adds reflections on everything. It's mind boggling. Like, dude, I'm telling you, the graphics on, on a fucking ray tracing ultra, like... People want me to stream it here, but the problem is I have to like lower the quality to medium or high. Sorry, guys, I'm not streaming the game because I have to play with ultra ray tracing. It's a completely different game, man. Like, this is the, this is the, thing. This is the thing. Are you running to because you have a high end PC? Are you running into glitches? Are you running into collision there's, problems where you're driving through cars? Are well, you running into well, the NPC game, space is going to shorter? The game, uh, the new patch fixed a lot of stuff. But uh, there was like, j like one of your characters, Jackie, was eating like chops, uh, you know, like a, a Chinese food with chopsticks. And when he put the chopsticks down, like the chopsticks like floated in the air. There was that. There was like one pedestrian walked through my car once. It was like that. And then so, yeah. uh, I haven't seen any, any of the T posing or stuff. I found one false wall where I walked through and I was like under the city type thing. It was pretty cool though to explore under the city. Like, like, so but, but, have but, you, but have you gone into your inventory and has your penis come in? No, that hasn't happened. No, a lot of people have had it. Even Angry Joe had it. He went into the inventory screen and like his avatar, the penis. Oh, you know what I had? Right you know what I had? When you look at mirrors, so mirrors are usually grayed out like most games because it's too intensive to have full real mirrors. But, um, I, uh, I, I I went in the in the mirror in the bathroom at, at V's place, and the character just was wearing no fucking clothes. And and then the second time I tried it, he uh, was bald. And my character has like a man button as well. Hey, what's day. wrong being fucking bald? What the fuck? No, but it, it, uh, yeah. no, so, no, 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 no. But say game, it. Go ahead. Game go ahead. No, that, no, no, no. Go ahead. Game say, it, say, that, it, say it. Is, say it. Honestly, say it. it's say it. Primo. The music alone. The like, music is really good. Oh actually. my god, dude, when you're in an oh, action scene, it's like fucking does it, does it does it does it recreate an authentic like nighttime city 
where it's like neon and it's like it yes. makes sense as a Beyond. cyberpunk city Beyond. or is it during the daytime the whole time no honestly honestly i'll say this because whenever you think of a neon city usually it's always night even when it's daytime you yeah. go this is what it would look like holy fuck like it's uh, uh, wait, fucking wait, 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 wait. It's Andy, mind Andy, mind, mind Andy. bending Andy, you're playing it on 20. I'm playing it on 20 Ti as well. So Andy, Andy, and I understand. I'm roughly the same hardware. I have a, I have a better CPU and better well, RAM than he does. This, I explained this to him already, but go ahead. But like, it it really depends. Like, I will say that the hardware you play it on really affects the experience. Because like, if you're playing on medium and below, like, like I I call it's that like good, the. the but- the, it's still good, but it's. So like, you feel a difference on medium to low settings between this yes. and Fallout? Well, um, no. Fallout is not even. It depends on it which won't. Fallout. It it's depends on which Fallout. Like, well, the like, thing is, you know is like, like, no, this is leaps and bounds of. This is like a. This is like a, a next generation compared to Fallout Four I, or something. I know, but the guys, the guys who are still playing on Xbox oh. One and PS Four, real fast, real fast. Sorry. White Diablo threw a ninja guinea. Thank you so much for the massive don't know. Uh, he threw a diamond to ask me to read that faster. But he says, When is PPP doing a kick ass commentary with Vicada? Can I do it with you guys too? I love kick ass. It's my favorite movie. I, I was asking, I actually had that on the docket for us to do. That's why I put him in our show links. Kick ass rules. But yeah, PPP, when are you going to do the kick ass commentary with Vicada? Someone's asking. If he genuinely wants to do it, I'll do it with him. I just kind of threw it out jokingly because kick is the sort of movie that if you don't know who the nostalgia critic is, at least, and Spoonie and Angry Joe and Nostalgia Chick, you're fucked. You're, not you're, gonna, fucked. You, you're, you're just going to have – you're going to have a bad time. Yo. If you were there and you were, if you were twelve years old like I was when kick came out, oh, really? you'd be you like, fuck yeah. Holy fuck. I was what older. Was that, 2011. I was, I, 2011. I 2011 was, shit. I would have been. I was 21. 96. So fuck. But how old I are was you? Like I would have been like 15. How old are you now? I would have been like 15. 24. I'm 32, I'm, so I was I'm like, 20, yeah, I was I'm way 20, older. It's kind of weird because Andy's 32, I'm 27, you're 24. It's like the hierarchy. It's like this this generation, that generation, that generation. Yeah, it's the generation. I was, bo- I was born in 88, and then, right? Surfer is 27, though. Surfer okay. Oh, so it's Kyler's age. Cool. That's You seem older to me for some reason. I always thought you were like 29 or something. I thought you were like almost 30 for sure. Oh, the he's... drugs are really aging me. That uh, <laughs> fucked up, obviously. It's tough. I'm gonna, take a, I'm gonna take a piss. I'll be right back, gentlemen. Go ahead. One go ahead. Go ahead. So, have you? Are you so enjoying? We're near, we're... Go ahead. Well, we're nearing five in the morning, and we still haven't even got through Diddler Dax. So I had like. Fuck we, more options we, on the table, but we're gonna. Yeah, I can't even I, find the fucking rubber piece for the boy. Fuck, the, fuck the rubber piece. I'll find it tomorrow. I but would say we'd be, we 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 have touched the tip of the Dax. We did it. not. This might be a multi-part epic. Honestly, it might be because like there's so much uh, shit we gotta talk just, about. We're just, we're so much because he's just so blatant with it, and like um, you know, for instance, Riley. You know, Riley's just posting up. Riley's posting about picking up like fucking QPs of weed in like fucking Washington D.C. and trafficking it across state lines. The fucking road show in Tampa. He's pretty and, you know, young, just, isn't I he? Just, he's pretty young. He's like twenty one, like twenty two. Yeah. So when I was twenty, I I thought stuff like that was cool because when I was twenty, I was selling like QPs of weed and shit, and I was posting about it on social media. I thought I thought it was like a badass. I was cool for doing it. And then I got older. I'm like, that's not cool. It's not badass. People think you're fucking degenerate for doing that stuff. No one likes you. No one likes you. Yeah. I I mean I don't know. Me and Surfer were into fucking the weed hard at twenty twenty one. Yeah. Right? Like fuck what? it. At least I was that age. At the Bethune Manor, we were doing the Mayweather McGregor fights. I was in college. It was a fucking wild time. We were having a fucking good go. Uh, and QPs would come in and out of the house regularly. But, you know, I always knew that that's kind of fucked up. And you always want to oh, keep that to the side. It. I was selling the weed. No, don't Surfer. say that. The I idiot. was bringing the weed into the household. Surfer fucking I kept it the ambiguous. Weed. 
God. When you come in and you confess to crimes on the air, That's all right. That's all they're right. not hey, crimes look. anymore. They're all There's, good now. They're they're not Federation regulation crimes. We're good. I put the I put the so, Starship Enterprise back up. We're good. We're good. Andy, as you were gone, Surfer was confessing to dealing drugs and like committing was, crimes well, on the air. Oh, Kyler, well, 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 he, he used Andy, to have a drug house. Well, while Andy was gone, I'll, I'll tell a story on a different episode, maybe a Patreon show. I did used to run a trap house. But uh, PPP, did you ever expect Andy and I to be against Diddler Dax? Like maybe like a half a year for, ago, like from this point <laughs> forward. Did you even envision that we'd be against him? Well, he was in a saying, way? Well, Ky well, 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 PPP thought that I was doing that whole uh, fucking defense. I was running defense for... Yeah, you know, the, like the, the, McKinley, the, the, Judas the, the McKinley, Judas McKinley, right? The Simplex, because I, I, I no, no, the, the Simplex, no, no, the no, fucking look, new project two, new project oh, two. Oh well, even oh, that, but oh, it's just like the it. way that Toad McKinley handled it. He's a fucking douchebag and a retard. I fucking I guess. hate Toad. He's a piece yeah, he's of a douchebag and, and a fucking retard. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'd say to you, Andy, what? did you ever have a new project? Dude? No, never. Because you were never trusted into the inner circle of Diddler wow. Docs, where you have to molest oh. children. <laughs> Yeah. Look, never let Diddler Docs touch your foreskin. You don't let Diddler Docs touch your foreskin. It's not right. Look, I'm just saying, the reality of it is about Diddler Docs is he's a greasy motherfucker. You don't want to be associated he with him. He looks like a used if car salesman. Smart, even if you want to make money in the future, you should know. That short term, sure, Diddler Dax, the scam artist, might be able to make it rain a little. But he you might just touch wait. your foreskin nicely. <laughs> he might do that. He, he might also run out of fucking boner pill money. I'm just saying. He yes, may just you run out of boner Wait, I want to actually, wait, wait, wait. I want to bring something up, okay? This is actually more, this is the, the interesting thing besides everything that we've discussed. The craziest thing was I watched a video that you made PVP. I can't remember exactly what it was, but it was sort of after the, the Simspiracy and all that shit, right? Where you bring up this random point in the middle of a video, you go, by the way, how does, how does fucking, how does he make 20K on fucking Patreon, yet his YouTube gets like 2,000 views, like, and I was like, wait, you know what? I didn't even think of that. It's like, it's his views to how much money he makes D but what if it's the people on like who used to be Maddox's fans, you know? That's what I was this thinking. This is the excuse. So here's the excuse for how he gets to 20 grand despite never cracking 10,000 views regularly on YouTube. How does that happen? Uh -huh. Money because laundering. In order to have a 20 Wait a minute, guys. How many viewers a month do you need to have to be raking in 20 grand a month on Patreon? Like, how many people have a Patreon that's that successful? Like ContraPoints? No. 150,000 at least. 9,000! <laughs> like, like who? Like, Chapo Trap House has more than that. Over 9,000! You know, like, only, like, real, like, leftists have that number. But somehow Dax has that number. And you go... Well, it's these old fans from the 2000s who knew the about the biggest Maddox. problem in the universe, Maddox. Yeah. All that stuff. Oh, wait yeah. a minute. Wait a minute, gentlemen. How many of you guys knew that? Group? How many? Uh, I didn't sorry, know what. It. What did you say? What did, did you, you ask? Because because Toad McKinley said he was a childhood fan of the biggest problem in the universe, uh -huh. and that's a common thing. Yeah. Were you a childhood fan of the biggest problem in the universe? I watched and here's one episode, thing. and I was like, mm. wait, he. Wait, here, here's my personal experience. I knew of Maddox since I was like seven. Since I was seven, because yeah. Maddox's site was big in the two thousands. From my, I okay. was a little, I was a little fucking kid and, and loved Maddox. I made, I made my own like Maddox clone site on Zanga when I was thirteen. Wow. Um, and when, and then I didn't hear, I didn't know anything about the biggest. Pro I didn't know what the fuck the biggest problem in the universe even was. So, Kyler, you're saying this is a real thing, that there are people who exist that were big Maddox fans yeah. that big then Maddox transitioned. Fans. 
but then transition into the dick show that might be financially supporting him. Because honestly, like I've not seen too much evidence of no, this. No, here's the here's the thing. Here's the thing is like I was a big Maddox fan when I was like seven through like thirteen or so, and I kind of I dropped off because like I didn't give a shit anymore. I did not know a single. Here's my experience. I didn't know anything, any fucking thing about the biggest problem. I didn't know they even existed. I didn't know who Dick was. And then I heard Dick on um, the official podcast with with, with uh, Critical and his friends. Then I heard and I heard of Dick through the kill stream because I was in the kill stream back then, mm. like three years ago. And then I I listened to Dick show. And I liked it. I I supported it on Patreon for like maybe a year. What was your favorite maybe. part? The rages of the of, of the guests. The rage. The, 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 <laughs> I I I, tu- I tuned in to the the to the to the Dick show during the Maddox lawsuit era. That okay. was for me. That was. That was like the big crux of the show. And he was, was on Maddox acid lawsuit. there in um, where was that place he went? Burning to? Man. Burning, Burning Man. Man. Burning and Man. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 Andy, Andy. Burning Man in Israel. No, that's yeah. where it was. Yes, that was the Israel yeah. Burning Man. Yes. Whoa. Yes. Isn't he half Jewish? He admitted he's. Uh, it doesn't matter. I mean, did, we're okay I mean, with all races. No, we love all people. We love yeah. all people. But. Hold on. He's a half Mexican, half Jew. Wait, no, no, no. I'll just tell you this. It, it's wait, rare. But he's a white you, man. No, 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 no. You can't be half Jew. Is his mother Jewish or is his dad Jewish? Not that it matters. Not that it matters. But is his mother yeah, Jewish? No. Because if his if, mom is Jewish, no, no, it means no. he's fully Jewish. Yeah, because if his mom is Jewish, that means he's full Jew. He doesn't matter. It doesn't matter Jew. if he is or not. Who cares? Okay, let's yeah, move on. Let's move on. It doesn't matter. Okay. I don't care about that subject. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. But is, yeah. is, 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 is uh, Dick Masterson's mother a Jew, sir? Or do you know? Buddy, 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 I'm sort of fucked up at this point. I'm not going to lie. Like, uh, I don't smoke weed. I'm only smoking weed for your show, Andy. Like I don't like it. Yes, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Whether it's Andy's mother that's a Jew and Andy's father that's a Mexican. Whether it's Andy's mother that's a Mexican no and Andy's father that's a Jew. This is so I don't know. This is slow. I don't. This is Wendy. Why don't you suck my fucking cock? Uh, we got, hang on, real fast here. Um, first last for a ninja guinea saying, remember, thank you so much. Yes. Whoa. Says, remember the hall dormer above Hall of Domor. Hall of, yes, that's true. Remember that the, the thing is about American schooling systems and maybe even Canadian too. I don't know. I'm not Canadian. I can't tell oh, you what the schooling system ahead. But from a, like from a certain age, after like the fourth grade or so, the, the third grade, the fourth grade, I remember being normal social studies class. But after the fourth grade, social studies becomes slavery in the Holocaust class. That's all you learn about until you're fucking a senior in high school. I'm not kidding. That's true. Yeah. But the but they never teach you about the Holodomor. The Holodomor was fucking brutal, and it was because of communists. Communists caused the Holodomor, and it's I fucked up. To, I used to clash with my high school history teachers because my high school history teacher in grade nine came in with a a, a Chairman Mao T-shirt on. And I said to her, "Right, well, I go, would you come in with an Adolf Hitler shirt on?" She goes. <laughs> Oh, I no, would. I wouldn't. I would. He goes, no, I wouldn't. And I go, well, Mao killed way more than Hitler. Yes, he, yes. And he was a communist. Like, how can you support this? And she goes, you may have a point. <laughs> this was a teacher who actually deducted me marks on a test for answering about the Ottoman Empire at the end of the history test on a bonus question, which said, tell me something not on this test. So I tell her about the Ottoman front of the war and, like, the Battle of Giappelli or whatever the fuck. I write this on the paper and she goes, this is not in the curriculum. But you asked me for something not on the test. <laughs> I wow. write I write something. She goes, this is true, but it's not in the curriculum. Man. Wow. Ducks me points off the paper. Fuck that bitch, like, dude. That's fine. You know, like, so then I start telling the other student she was a fascist, which didn't sit well with her. So then... <laughs> He calls me into the office. Were you, you were sent to the office? 
Yeah, I was I was sent to her office to discuss with her why she was a fascist. Did, so, did, did you tell her about her mouth? Yeah, I did. I told her, well, like, you know, at the time I was like a horseshoe theory, so I thought that, like, fascism and communism are the same, and I'm well, you're just an authoritarian, and you're trying to tell me what to believe about the atomic bomb and President Truman, and da -da 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 -da, and I talked to her off. She fucked off. I didn't get in any real trouble, you know. But it was just bullshit. What, like it's, after it's, you come in, debate philosophy with the history teacher in tenth grade. That's not your fucking place. You're a student. You gotta learn from the fucking people who have their heads screwed on straight. And the thing is, oh, too, yeah. is that. The, like I went to a country ass high school for like years, like a uh, freshman year, night which is ninth grade for Americans to tenth grade. I went to a fucking country ass high school where I can say whatever the fuck I wanted to. The history teacher of my country ass high school was the football coach. So you you do the fucking math on that one. Uh, and oh, then uh, oh, go ahead. Oh, go ahead. Well, uh, uh, real, real, real quick, real, 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 real quick. Yeah, finish that. Real, just, just real quick, just real oh, quick. Good. I you, promise you. You good? You good? And then Go I ahead. went to a large, I, I went to more, like a more, like more Oklahoma is a bigger city, which is more like, um, you know, interesting, I guess you'd say. And people were wearing Che Guevara t-shirts. And I'm like, do you know that, Sh that Che Guevara was a murdering bastard? He was a murdering piece of shit. He was a fucking douchebag and a retard. And they watched couldn't comprehend. CP too. Well, I was in high school. I went up to the English teacher and I said to him, Listen here, you fucking asshole, son of a bitch. You're a fucking alcoholic. <laughs> You're a fucking you did, alcoholic. You did that. Wait, 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 you walked up to the class? True story. He did, because the teacher no, wasn't an alcoholic. I got kicked out of that class. But the teacher actually was an alcoholic. I had a couple of alki teachers in high school, too. You guys to tell me off for whatever reason. I say, listen, you fucking stupid. Yo, you're an alcoholic. Yo, you hear this? You one time. I'm an alcoholic. Yo, I walked. Yo, I, yo, I once walked what in. What are you trying to tell me? And I got fucking kicked out of my class. That I was so mad. You hear this? Hear this? I I walked in. I once walked into my com tech class during lunch, in high school. And I see my fucking teacher, this is old guy, right? And I'm, I, I forgot something in class. And I see him with his coffee mug and he's pouring a fucking flask in it. And I'm like, hey, Mr. K, right? And he's like, he's like, you didn't see anything. I'm like, nope. But he's just like the way he said it. You didn't see anything, right? He's just kind of pouring a fucking flask. Like, I'm like, and he didn't see me for like fucking five seconds. I'm like, bro, this guy's getting fucked. He's getting smashed. I saw him bro. later. You could tell he was fucking. And he like, he's just like staring at me. I'm just like, I never told anyone. I didn't rat him out. Fucking Mr. K was cool. Bro, dude. This guy, this guy that I told off, like literally in one of our fucking classes, he, he pulls open. We're, we're doing our work, right? Yeah. He pulls open his fucking desk drawer and pulls out this bottle. <laughs> and he goes, he goes, look at his glass. He goes, man, 40% alcohol. <laughs> oh, like, actually, actually. Wait, in, is it, it back in is this high school, drawer. dude? Yeah, high school. Oh, oh my God. God. Buddy. Yeah. You know, so this is the guy I called an alcoholic, you know? Like, <laughs> this is post He was such a cocksucker. He was such a cocksucker, though. Like, honestly, we ought to shame him. He wasn't bad, though. Shame you know, him. I look back shame on him. that. I look back on that nowadays. And I think, fuck, like, I shouldn't have done that. Nah. You know, that guy was like, I don't know, but this guy was... Pretty fucking chill guy, you know. Like he was pretty. The alcoholic guy. teachers you had in high school were chill. They were. Yeah. No, but this guy was like he wasn't one of those li liberal fucking idiot teachers like the most of them, you know. Like this guy was actually pretty cool. Like he played piano at the bar, you know. Like he was a good fucking dude, you know. He was pretty good in the class, and I was just a fucking. You know, I I just had a lot of fucking angst, I guess. <laughs> well, the thing the thing is too is like if you're a teacher in goddamn high school, like if you're not if you're not an alcoholic, I'm questionable of you. I'm questionable because I had I had I had a teacher in high school who's he was the astro astronomy teacher, not astrology. Astronomy and astrology are two different things, guys. By the way, astronomy teacher. 
and he was an alcoholic and he was the coolest teacher. He let us give with anything. And then I had a teacher in high school who was straight edge. His name was Mr. Winter Road. Winter Road. Yes, Mr. Winter Road. And then me and my my me and my and my my and my 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 best friend in high school, Mason. Me and Mason would get blown out at lunch. He smoked a fucking blunt. Oh, they get blown at lunch. No, we would fucking get lunch. We would get high as shit. We would get sounds like a Kyler tale. We would get we would get we would get buddies blown there. out like a fucking speaker at lunch. We would get fucking high as shit every goddamn day of high school. And the one day, the one day that Mason was out of weed and we didn't get high, Mr. Winter Road was like, hey guys, you seem like you're on drugs right now. Are you guys like, what's going on? Like, Then Mason was like, are you kidding me? This is the one day we're not fucking high. Come on, dude. Get the fuck, get, get real. Are you kidding me? And the teacher, Mr. Winter, would apologize to us and let us go. Like, we're not high today. Is- Motherfucker, like, we would go into nap time in drama class. I was in fucking drama class. The oh. motherfucker busts out nap time. This fucking dude was a hippie. Wait, he traveled to like time? Spain during nap time. Nap time. Or... <laughs> what the nine, ten, nine, what the... ten, nine, nap... drama time. This is okay. No joke. No word of a lie. This is Mr. Steinman's class. Steinman. No, no Steinman. Oh, Steinman. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Can wait, I add an echo on that real quick? Can I? Can I? Wait, wait, wait. wait. Can wait. I add an echo on that? Steinman. Steinman. <laughs> wait, it's okay. Steinman. It's all good. Steinman. 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 It's Mr. Steinman's drama class. This motherfucking dude's telling us about how like he's a hippie during. Franco's revolution in Spain and how like General Francisco Franco detained him in a jail because he had long hair. Yeah. And then this same motherfucker is like putting us on nap time for half the class. Like half the drama class is literally sleeping. So I just start getting high during the class. Wait, wait, wait. What is the the sleep on the first half? Class. It was asleep no. in the first half of class or the second half of class? It was like the first half of yeah, class. Yeah, you walk in the second half, bake, and go and fucking like sit down, you know? Like, this is what it is. You see, Kyler, Kyler, bro, bro, bro. I'm like a minute and a half behind, so, so I'm not quite up to date on the conversation. <laughs> you fucking said. That uh, you got you and your buddy would go fucking just get blasted every day and go into class, and the one day you weren't high. Well, listen to this. I used to just get fucking blasted <laughs> and go to all of my class. Me too, dude. And so dude. One day in grade eleven, I don't get high. I get a call to the office, <laughs> <laughs> and I go to the office, you know, and they and they fucking go. Okay, well, we're going to send so you, Are you high? I go, no, I'm not high. <laughs> one day I'm not fucking high. Well, you know, one day. Go, are you all right? Are you high? Bro, I was I go, black. Go, oh. Okay, well, we're going to go search your fucking stuff in your class. Stay here. Thinking, <laughs> what the fuck? fuck? I a quarter of weed in my fucking pocket uh. all the time. Ready to fucking sell the people. Oh, shit. You know? And fucking, so I, I'm going with you. And I go with them, and fucking halfway down the office, I just start running towards the class. Oh. And they have two undercover cops They have two undercover cops that just jumped out of the fucking Shut door. the fuck up, wait, what? <laughs> And then fucking, and like four more teachers came out. They surrounded. No me. way. <laughs> what the fuck? They walked me back to the office. Wait, 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 wait what? They Why did they do it? Wait, 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 they what? put it on the table. What? On the table and the fucking. He Why can't did they hear plan us. this? Oh, okay, right, sorry. Weed and the cigarettes on the fucking table. And they get, they're fucking reaming me out, and then they get a phone call. So it's the like female principal and the fucking male. He looks like the fucking mascot of A and W. He was like running 
Feel something. You know, you yeah. know, one bag at a time. So I thought, you know what? Fuck it. And I just spat the chewed up meat <laughs> all over the table. <laughs> so, you know what? Then I looked at them and I said, you know what, guys? I give up. You got me. <laughs> you got me. You got me. <laughs> they say, well, it's a bit too late for that. <laughs> <laughs> and they bring in police officers to the room. And they search through my wallet and find this list of all the girls I had slept with. I'm so I just think I'm zero. And I got this list of all these fucking broads I fucked with star ratings. <laughs> <laughs> And the cop, the cop pulls it out and he goes, oh, this guy obviously has like four daughters because he says, <laughs> oh, you're sick. <laughs> you're, you're sick. You got four Who daughters. What the, fuck? Like that. <laughs> what the fuck? Because he's too affected by it. Yeah. Oh my no. The after I went through court, Andy, so this is my first fucking probation, right? Oh my God. I ended up getting breach times two, another possession charge, <laughs> and some other fucking charge, I don't know. No, I because I, I had a cell phone ban. <laughs> so I got like four fucking charges, you know? Holy shit. <laughs> this is Jesus. my first fucking probation. <laughs> You got four. Yeah. Holy fuck, dude. That's an epic. Like, I don't remember how I was going to finish that story. but oh, dude, it, does, that it doesn't rule. matter. It doesn't that matter. Rule. It doesn't matter. Dude, I'm, I'm not even joking, guys. I, I'm, I'm in tears. That story is. I'm, I'm just picturing it. That's like better than a comedy movie, dude. Because, like, Cause, like I, I ate a gram of weed one time that. in high school. I ate a gram of weed one time, a gram and a half. And then some was like, if you eat weed, it doesn't affect you. If you, if you eat weed, it doesn't affect you. Well, I'll tell you one thing for goddamn sure. It affected me. I was high as shit in English 3. And uh, this chick, Amber, who's fucking hot, Amber is hot, is laughing at me because she knows what I did across the classroom. 
and I laugh like a fucking schoolgirl, and I get caught, and I don't. It, it's just, it turns into this whole thing. It turns into this whole thing. Tyler was talking about DMT and how crazy it is that I should do oh, DMT. Oh, I get it. I, I, I fucking remember now. I remember what I was going to okay, say. Okay, yeah, perfect. Let's yeah. some girls I fuck with. So when I went through fucking court for that probation, they fucking had in the evidence, in the evidence of the disclosure of the crimes I committed, they said that they found a cuff list in my wallet. A cuff list? Wait, a cuff list? Oh, my God. They said it was a cuff list. thinking, you know, like, I'm pretty sure we established it wasn't a fucking cuff list. It was a fuck list. It was a fuck list. I never heard that before. That was how I was going to have the story. That's not the only thing. They're all women doing cuffs to suck. Clock at a party there, I yeah. guess. No, my second time, Danny, you talk about getting caught with a gram of weed. Uh, I wasn't even really committing any crime. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just walking home. You know, I'm just fucking walking home with my buddy. And the cops pull over to talk to us because we're just drunk walking home. Yeah. They come over and talk to us. But I'm high off my mind on magic mushrooms. Yeah. <laughs> so, so this cop, this cop starts asking me questions like what my name is and what my address is. And I couldn't fucking answer him. You had no idea what was going on. <laughs> I'm staring this cop in the face. And his face is just fucking transforming into weird fucking shapes. You know, so they go, you're pretty fucked up. <laughs> you know? <laughs> they go, let's run say, the say the least. Say the least. <laughs> so they go, I go, I convince them that I've just drank like a whole case of beer. So I'm just so oh, fucking so drunk. Oh, yeah, you're right? fucked up. You know, yeah. I'm on mushrooms. It's the lesser so, of two okay, evils. How many beers you got in your bag? So I told them I had like six beers in my bag. So they go, okay, pour them out. So I fucking put my backpack down on the sidewalk, pour out the first beer, open it up, and I start just pouring it on the sidewalk so it pours downhill into my bag. <laughs> <laughs> I just look like a fucking moron. And then the ball runs out, and I just toss it into the first line. Oh, and the no. cop goes, <laughs> So they put me in cuffs. Oh, shit. They put me in cuffs and they put me against the fucking cruiser. They're trying to ask me like what my name is and basic questions like that. But I just as soon as my I name is Surfer. Surfer. My name is Surfer. <laughs> As soon as, as soon as they started asking the question, I started answering the question, I just get up and start to pay. <laughs> they grab me and slam me back against the cruiser and go, don't walk away, stand against the cruiser. Then they'd ask me another question, like what my name is. You'd be rowdy. I'd start, I'd start to answer it, and then as I started to answer I'd walk away. <laughs> And they grab me and slam me into the cruiser. And they did this like four or five times. And then they, they had it Because you were white, buddy. It's what it Put was. Put me into the fucking you know. You, you gave act- me four fucking charges. Gave me four charges. They gave me breach times two. I got a breach for fucking... That's... Fucking crazy! That's like fucking. That's excessive. Breach for being under the influence. Uh-huh. Uh, while I was on. Just realized I had like six more topics planned. I got yeah, we, fucking, we have like eighteen videos. It's already five a.m., dude. Like, I got a on my cell phone because I had a cell phone ban. It's conditions for my first probation. So I was dealing drugs. <laughs> I got a cell phone ban for fucking Wait, three cell months. Phone, cell phone ban. Like a, before my cell phone ban was up, what I the wasn't fuck's a cell phone allowed ban? to cell phone. So, like, you about a week, get... suck my fucking <laughs> cock. Before my cell phone ban was up, I had my cell phone on me. They gave me a breach of probation for having a cell phone on my person. Oh, because oh, you 
because you're on probation. <laughs> they uh, gave me a possession charge, and they gave me some other charge. Dude, I don't know. Yo, yo, you hear this one time? I don't even know what's going on yo, anymore. You hear this? Hear this. PvP, <laughs> PvP. <laughs> Uh, you, you hear this? You find this funny. So, so one day, okay, we're on shrooms and we're walking around this school, Hawthorne School. Actually, it's like an elementary school because it's near our high school, St. Martin's. And we're like stoned out of our minds, like running around in the fucking field and shit, being crazy. So we're fucking flying on mushrooms. Finally, we sit in the front of Hawthorne, and cops arrive, and we're like, "Oh shit!" So we're all like, "Everyone, be careful! Everyone, just chill!" So we're all sitting on this ledge, just me and like four of my buddies, like Logan, Aaron, and a few other people. Anyway, police go over with flashlights, and we're like, "Oh!" And I'm tripping, like I'm fucking. It's like the second time doing shrooms. I don't even know what's happening. We're in space, right? The cop. Now I didn't hear what he said, but the cop. This is this is how it went. The cop went, hey guys, so you guys been doing drugs tonight? Everyone went, no. And I'm like, yes, <laughs> officer. And everyone went, what? And he goes, you all been doing drugs? I'm like, yeah, we're just hanging out. And he's just like, huh. And all my friends, they looked over at me. And I remember tripping uh, balls being like, what happened? Like, what's wrong? He left and they're all like, but he left. He didn't search us or anything. Like for some reason, he probably thought I didn't hear him. Oh, but I just went like, "Yes, yeah, so it was I'm like a mystical experience." Oh, dude! And my friend Aaron's like, "Bro, you just like literally just told the, the, the cops that yes, we were doing drugs." But then you went, "Yeah, we're just hanging out," and the cop was just like, "Just get the fuck out of here," and he like left, bro. And I, I, I had no idea what was happening for like two hours. Two hours later, they told me the story, and I'm like, "That happened? What?" <laughs> I got fucking super fucking lucky. Uh, hang on, after we d- donations, okay. Let me just go ahead. go ahead. We just found through these D Shad referred diamond saying, I concede not a good luck to being around that crowd. D Shad for diamond saying at the methadone comparison is very good about like fucking l- lolly yeah. shit. And yeah, calling for diamond saying Japan's fucked from post war media. True. Uh, Nick calling for a diamond saying, does PPP think Alex Jones is controlled up like Bill Hicks? This is the thing. Is if you're in the business as long as Alex is, you're controlled up. But it's not really True. his fault because he really doesn't have any other choice. Like, it's the, it's the nature of the beast. The it's the nature of the beast. But here's the thing. Alex is such a great entertainer that for me it overrides the fact that a lot of the info he says is fake or bullshit. So, like, at the end of the day, it just depends how entertaining you are. You can really get away with just about anything if you're about as good as Alex Jones. Let's face it. Yeah. That's the truth. He can lie to his audience. They don't give a fuck because it's Alex fucking Jones. So that is what it is. Um, people like Sargon wish they could be like Alex Jones. They will never be oh. like Alex Jones. I heard Sargon's no, new website is what doing is. well. <laughs> <laughs> Kyler, did you hear about this? Is did you hear about Sargon? Wait, is it still down? I haven't heard a goddamn thing about uh, Sargon. No, he's uh, fucking in the sewer. He fucked up, here's dude. Here's what it was. Sargon put up this Lotus Eaters website. The idea is to just get high and do drugs all the time because sure. fuck it anyway. Yeah. You know, you can get behind, but Sargon's not behind that message. Sargon's just a little pussy that plays his gay video games. So anyway, Sargon's just being a straight-edge pussy. Anyway, Sargon has got this gay op going. He starts this website. Lotus As we Eaters. know with Sargon, the Lotus Eaters. Everything with Sargon never delivers. He promises no. the world that delivers fuck all. He's got a he five promises- year plan. He's got a five year yeah, plan. Yeah, it's five year plan. Yeah, five year plan. Uh, Tyler, remember, he promises the alternative to Netflix. Yeah. It's the lotuseaters.com. Wait, yeah. for only he didn't five, say that. For only $5 a month, you can join the alternative to Netflix, the lotuseaters.com. Oh, no. 300, 350 pay pigs pay the five. And for a month now, they have not been able to actually access the website. Now, in the last week and a half, the website has actually worked. But, guys, I wouldn't put too much faith in it. I believe it will have more downtime. Now, remember, guys, you got a coupon. Sargon gave you a free 
coupon that probably didn't even work. Most of you didn't even apply because you want to give Sargon your money. People who actually paid for the LotusEaters.com probably want Sargon. Talk about, by I mean, Yo, what does he talk about? I, I haven't kept up at all, to be honest. So remember, just as of yesterday, Sargon was telling us the Texas lawsuit was definitely going to win, that the yeah. Supreme Court was going to rule in its favor. It totally failed. Sargon is an absolute shill. He will just parrot whatever the right wing wants him to parrot, similar to a Nick Ricada type. He just bows to whatever the prevalent right wing mood is. I'm Wait. sorry to Nick Ricada. I've been oh, on his show. I don't know what Nick's up to. Well, he he Nick Ricada has a tendency to capitulate towards whatever the right is. I hate to say that, but the truth is, any of us who take Nick Ricada seems like a fucking nice guy, but like when it comes to content and the things he puts out online, it seems like he has a tendency to capitulate towards what the mob, the right wing mob, wants. No, it's true, but, but everybody. Does. But you it's can argue with people. us. You can argue with us that we call out things that the left does and we shit. You out. know. No, 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 Andy. And no, 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 oh, no, 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 no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. But we can call out like whoa, grifters wait, 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 wait. On, on the right wait, 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 too, wait. though. We do. No, so. no, 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 no. Andy, we're not saying that Nick Ricada calls out grifter. We're saying he capitulates towards what the right yeah, wants. They, no, I know. I'm but, saying. But I'm we, saying. We, 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 but I, what I'm saying is that what we do, we tell them how it is. Like, the, yeah, the, the, I'm the, saying, Joe Biden is going to be the next president of the. But of I'm United saying. America. I'm True. saying that that you could argue that we do bring up things that the left does more, right? Because obviously we fucking hate them. We think that they're fucking gay or whatever, right? But what I'm saying is the our, difference is, our show that here, we, is that we don't we don't we don't the difference our is, show is that, here we don't fucking just go like Nick well, Fuentes is on the right. All right, hey, we're on his side. Gentlemen, how much did you make tonight and how much have we talked about politics? 46K mm -hmm. lemons plus, uh, I think, 150 on stream but elements, whatever the that is. The reality is there's been a tangential relation to politics, which is fine. But yes. the whole show hasn't been about, is Joe Biden going to be the president? Uh, what is. about the daily COVID toll? Well, we all know our opinions on this shit. Everybody on it's, this side knows that Biden's yeah. a piece of shit. Piece that of we shit. don't support masks. Well, no. The truth of it is, what are you gonna do? Well, you gonna cry every day? Well, that's my no. thing. Is is what I was saying was I I would say our show while we do like anything that's like immediate with politics that's important to talk about. I think we'll mention it and discuss it. But I, doing it every single day for me is something and, I just I can't. It's it stresses me out the, too. It's not the, fun. The, I don't the, think. The, 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 the key to our formula is, Andy, is that we don't capitulate. Capitulating is not good. Oh, look, you just don't bow down to Nick Fuentes no. and his crew on this website. They will pressure you. They will tell you you need to bow to Nick Fuentes and kiss his ring. It's not true. You really don't have to kiss Nick's ring or fucking Owen's ring or even Ralph's ring. Anyone's ring. I, no. It, you, you can be your own entity anywhere. You just have to choose to be so. And I think you guys are on your own. You're doing your own thing. Because let's face it, like, you know, the criticism of Dax isn't easy. A lot of people that you associate with, boys are in with Dax deep. And they, the will learn. they will learn. They will learn, especially after this weekend. I think they will learn the truth. And they will realize that we were ahead of the curve when it came to Diddler Dax, and they will have to come to the position of such. Because the guy is fucked up. When you have Pedo Vito in your Wait, crew... I'm going to say what it is. I'll say what it is as, as a guy who's, who's like done content and sort of like collabed with people. There is this mentality, I find, where I used to have it too. Now I don't give a fuck, right? But you would go oh this guy has how many subs how much money is he making on patreon how many followers does he have on twitter and then you're like yeah and like you're nice to them because somewhere in your brain you think maybe i could bring some of those people over and watch my show and they the, never the reality do. is they, they will never do that. that you might get a couple stragglers maybe 
And I don't know. The truth is, me doing this show is never going to gain me any followers either. But I just enjoy doing this show because I think it's a fun show. I think it's a good show. I think people are being entertained by the show. And and that's all that really matters at the end of the day. People talk a whole bunch of bullshit about politics, about money, about this and about that. All that really matters is that people have had a really fun time and they'll come back again. We're here to have fun. What's your, have what's fun your new... I, I'm watching this PPP fan archive for your videos on, on BitChute, but where yeah. where's your new... Because Daka Daka was flagged. What's your new one? You keep, it is. You, keep so, you keep changing, for, so it's hard, to, it's hard to... It's tough. If you really want to find... JWPPP, Social Justice PPP. Okay. Okay. I thought as long as I put social justice in the title, I won't be flagged. Sadly, that's I love not the Israel, case. the LGBT, was, everything. It's great, guys. That was my vision two years ago. The channel has survived more than two years. It's the longest lasting. Daka Daka is a fan donated channel that we appreciate. Daka Daka. He gave his Warhammer channel up for the sins of this fucking bullshit. Somehow we've survived. Surfer showed his penis. Crazy shit has yeah, happened. It's true. Somehow we survived Surfer pulling out his cock and saying, Suck it, Susan. Doesn't get us a strike. That didn't even get us a strike. That didn't even get us a strike. But like you, somehow Susan. the baked Alaska show where I call a spade a spade gets me to strike. But not wow. the show where he goes. Oh, wait. Suck I know it. It. that was I literally called Kyler and I went. You have to go to PPP's video right now, his, his show, and he rewind did. it. It was like 10 minutes in. I'm like, rewind it 10 minutes. This is probably PPP's magnet opus. Like, it, it, it was so... It's pretty uh, fucking good. It was so funny. <laughs> pretty fucking good. People hated it. People hated no, it because they it was so... Fun. No one hated I it. I don't normally use that. I don't usually use that word. You know what I mean? I don't yeah. usually use it, but when you and somebody really meets that definition to the point where I say even most black people are going to agree, that's when I say it, and that's when it's true, and everybody knows it's true, but people will pretend it's not the case because of whatever political reason. But the truth is, when everybody sits down at home with a drink in their hand and they watch the video, they know that I'm right. You know, and that's what makes that me was, happy at the end of the day. Magnum opus. I, I, I tried saying that. I was stumbling. Uh, no, but I, I don't think were people really on your on your case about because it's about dope district, and you may oh, have no. said a couple of words. I'm sure you could all guess what word it was, and you sort of said it a few times, and Neighbor. it was Neighbor. it was very intense, but. People were mad. No, it's it's a feral cool. neighbor. But but you anger your audience a yeah. lot, by the way. Remember with uh, T clips, you were like, if she yeah. continues making videos, I'm gonna do fat boyfriend eating ASMR sex yeah. boyfriend vids or whatever it was. And it's pictures of you drawing was- naked like a dog eating chicken. And then you did like 10 videos and you got the most dislikes, but you kept doing it. You didn't give a fuck about what your viewers cared about. Uh, I might do it again next week. Who even fucking knows? But ultimately, it led into me leading John Michael Kelly astray. John, John sent Michael me this Kelly. money for a gay ass John, John, John honestly is so autistic that he can't differentiate between what's a joke and what's reality. No, he And cannot. it starts He's to get dumb. Fun. It starts to get to the point where it's sad, and that's why I don't even bully him anymore because it's like, holy fuck, John. Like, you live with your parents at fucking 36 years old. (laughs) I mean, you've never left home. Like, you've never made any money. Like, you know, you've never worked a job. But you're going to tell us all about Catholic ethics and all this bullshit. Fuck off, John. Why why does he stream snipe you every single night that you do a show? Fucking retard. So, no, guys, I'm going to... You so John Michael Kelly believes that he's the Frank Grimes to my Homer Simpson. So have you guys ever <laughs> seen that episode? Have you ever seen that episode that's Homer's enemy, where Frank Grimes is like works really hard in life, but he gets shafted? Like Homer is just this lazy cunt that somehow wins and gets everything. Yeah, well, that's how John. That's how John views me, and he's angry about it. He's resentful that he thinks he's higher IQ, so he deserves viewers. 
because he was the defending. Reality. Uh, he was defending T clips because why we were calling out T clips for many reasons. I mean, she does a lot of dumb shit, but in that particular, uh, she's a clip channel, and she put a paywall behind her clip of someone else's content. So we talked yeah, shit. So- so you made fun of her Wait, for that, and then I, I got he it. I got was it. I got, it. I got it. You. I got it right here. I got it right here. Um, what is it? Everything what? you ever wanted, all your dreams, dreams have come, come true. true. T clip. Yeah. Unfortunately, you are a filthy Jew. We love that clip, by the way. Oh, look, the, the reality about T Clips is. Everybody, hold the fuck on. Oh. If was asking me in chat, please ask PPP if he remembers showing his dick on stream. Yeah, I when, I, when I lit my oh, penis wow. on fire, and then I did. I did a show where Andy was in a shower pretending to be me, like two years ago. Me? And then I did a show. Yeah, you did a show. You were naked in the shower in 2019. Showering in the shower pretending to be me. And then I did a show pretending to be you in the shower naked. And then I accidentally showed my cock on the show. <laughs> and it's called it's called Behold the Great Purple Dragon. And I just whip out my cock. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, I don't remember doing that. Did well, I? you did. You were in the shower. You were like soaping oh, yourself up in the up, shower. Dude. I was probably coked up. I don't remember that you shit at all. Fucking fuck. It's just jokes as fuck. But it is what it is. It is funny. In to... retrospect, I always laugh. I always go like, what was Andy thinking? Like, I don't he's re- in the shower. Wait. Like, I don't remember. What? I was fucking. I, was, I remember like when I look back at old shows of me, like Warpath. I don't even remember that time in my life. Like my brain is like so rewired from that. I must have been so fucked, dude. And I was in like this fucking crazy oh. funk and shit, dude. Like the amount of fucking drugs I did. Holy, like you would be like, how are you not dead? Like, how am I not dead? Seriously, dude. Like fucking too much. Tyler, you're a joke. The clip Tyler, was like, come on. I'm done. I'm so done. You, Someone... haven't, you haven't done the lines of coke that Andy did, Kyler. No one has. He I've was done rolling. Co- I've done he co- was balls deep. Year. You don't even know two, what it's two like. Two years every day. Oh. Fucking. Dude, dude, yo, there was like a six month period where I spent 200 bucks almost a day on coke. 200 yeah, like, a day. Tyler's never even made 200 bucks a day. Like, like, fuck. No, like, fuck, man. Thank God I'm off that stuff. Honestly, guys, like, that stuff was grimy. Like, it's such a bad vibe. Like, look, doing it once in a while, when I would do it, like, once every few months, back in my party days, but not every oh. day, it was fun. I had a, like, let's, awesome memories. Let's remember, based Coach Red Pill's advice when it came oh, to yeah. drugs, Andy. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, the hell of a that's what he said this week. He was like, cocaine is the best drug. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. you know, coaches just, coaches jokes is fun. Tell me, Andy, how was it like to be with the coach of Kino, Coach Red Pill, in he that fucking is hotel? He's the worst human being to be around. He never. It's just a he's, shady fuck. He, I'll tell you this. No, he's he annoying. He's fucked. annoying, dude. He was just annoying. Did he ever actually get fucked up on drugs? <laughs> No, no. Uh, so I'll tell you, he invited me and Godwinson to come to Amsterdam uh, to drop acid with Coach Red Pill. This no was way. the fucking Whoa. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's we a bad trip, Amsterdam. dude. You'll have a bad trip for sure. I said I was down, you know, but Godwinson vetoed it because he said, like, it's Coach Red Pill. Like, he won't drop the acid. He'll just be a snake and try and, like, video us. That's true. I'll trick you. I'll trick you. I'll trick you. I'll trick you. <laughs> So then I said, well, let's go and then not drop the acid and have Coach drop it and then videotape Coach and then ditch him in a nightclub somewhere in Prague or something. <laughs> perfect plan. Perfect plan. But it never got to that point. I don't know. Coach is like this like disheveled, like homeless bum. 
somewhere he, he in like some decent Ukraine. money though, right? On YouTube. Okay, the reality is he is probably making seven grand legit on Patreon a month, yeah. which is like a sad, it's like a sadness of the human condition. Yeah, the people are actually pay coach that. It's these like sad dudes who like have never like no. held a girl's hand. It's true, surfer. Like it's just tough. Like you got a fat fuck like me. Like figure it out. Figure it out, gentlemen. I'm just saying. Like you can make it happen. Just don't be a fat. Oh, oh, sorry, but don't be like that. Don't be like that, and you'll make it. I'm just gonna start to smoke this. Yeah. Do you have uh, Do you have any more stuff We're, to read out, Andy? I, I think we have this? a little bit, but we should wrap it up. Yo, we've gone. Uh, it was bedtime five for me. Hours. It was bed, it was bedtime I, I for me. Go, I can go another two hours if you boys PPP, want. You know, you know what I say? We do. I think we have to. There's got to be a go. part two. There's got to be a part two. I gotta go. I right, gotta go. Right, Kyler, peace oh. out, bro. Peace out, Peace dude. Out, guys. Thank you. Out, Me and people P will wrap this up. Peace out, dude. I'm gonna pass out. Have a good night, guys. Take have, it easy. Have a nice night, it was, Tyler. It was, it was an hour talking See you tomorrow, to you. Bro. It was an hour talking to you, PPP. And we'll circuit. plan a part two. We'll plan a part oh, two. Oh, absolutely. We loved it, Kyler. We'll figure it out. So I have a yeah. few things we gotta cover left. We might go. Give me an hour more, Andy, and then oh, we'll okay, fucking... okay, okay, okay. Give me an hour more to I 6.30. I think part two should be Diddler Dax. Wait. No, be, be, what I was going to say is, I, I say we wrap up now. I'm, I'm getting pretty tired, too. But let's take what you have and do a part two next week. What do you say? I don't Monday. know. I don't know if there is another fucking part to this. Because as I look at it now... We're only at 46.82. They're 3,700 <laughs> shy of oh, the, the benchmark. Wait, seven, eight, nine. Oh, we need point three, 3K more. Fine, then we'll have well, to keep I'll, going I'll let you we... guys deal with that business. Peace. I'm going to tell, tell you guys as much. It was an honor talking to you. It was an honor showing with you, PVP. Andy, of course, it was an honor. You know tell Surfer I said we're up. Tyler, Tyler, one no. more shot. No, no, no. I'm going to puke. I'm going to fucking puke if I take one more shot. Kyler. I, I honestly want to go till 9, 10 in the morning, but we can't. Like, peace. I could. Peace, guys. Peace. peace. I'm done. Kyler. I'm so, Kyler, peace I'm out. so peace done. Out. Peace out. Later, dude. Peace, guys. So I want to get a few things off my list. Okay. How sure. much of the VGAs did you watch last night? Hey, hang on. You know what? Let me grab a water real quick. I like a one second. I, I just I, I finished my water and let me just move that. I'm gonna put us. This is now the PPP and Warski show right now. I'm gonna sort of resize this sh this shit so it looks good. Boom, boom, boom. Grab you. Whoops. There we go. All right. I'm gonna grab a water because I want to talk about that too. Actually, I'm down for that. That convo, because it's fucking... Yeah, I it's fucking gay, dude. Like, I gotta talk to you about some of the shit. I, you have, might have not seen it, but I'll tell you about it. It's right. pretty fun. Uh, uh, one sec, one sec. All right, I'm back. Uh, and by the way, everyone who's been supporting and all that shit, thank you so much. Appreciate all you. You guys fucking rule. So the Game Awards, now, do we just go out and say straight up who won? Because it's fucked. Well, look, so The Last of Us 2 won every, like, award at the Game Awards. And the reality of The Last of Us 2 is it's just like a skin of The Last of Us 1. It's the same third-person shooter mechanics that everybody has played a million times by now. Yeah. Everybody knows how it is. If you played Resident Evil, it's it's actually better than this shit, truly. Yeah. And if you played like, yeah. Resident Evil 5 or 6, like, truly, it's actually halfway better than fucking The Last of Us Part 2. Because The Last of Us Part 2's story is just garbage. Oh, dude, they... And not only is it garbage, but they took the first last of us 
and shit on all the fucking story, the lore, the fond memories of good characters. They literally went, how do we take everything that you liked from a game, the story, which really, in reality, the fucking first game wasn't groundbreaking in terms of gameplay, but the fucking, it was like well-directed and this and that, good voice acting and facial animations. The second one, all it had was the story if it was going to keep that gameplay loop. And it fucking <laughs> was made by the, oh my God, dude. It's infuriating. It's infuriating. So, again, so for those who watched the, the, the awards last night, Free Larson gives out this award to Abby for like best character acting or whatever. I mean, the truth of it is, I mean, I guess if you're an SJW, the acting was good or whatever. It just killed Joel, like just mercs Joel's character. And this was a guy who, again, I play. I had a PS3 at the same time I had a 360. Yeah, yeah. I, I ended up selling my PS3 before Last of Us came out. So I got a PS4 to play Last of Us in Bloodborne and Uncharted 4. And those okay. are the games I played on PS4. And they were fine games. It was just like it didn't justify it to me. But neither does the Xbox justify it. I mean... At this point, if you have the money, go PC. You're yeah. going to get a better bag for your buck. But, you know, it is what it is. Because with PC, you end up dealing with your own problems. You know what I mean? There's but, no expectation it's going to run at your settings. See, with this thing, Xbox One. But, but the, the, uh, the crazy thing is with the new systems that came out, PS5 and all this, all the scalpers try, trying to sell it. They bought like fucking a thousand fucking PlayStation fives yet they're asking for double the price, but everyone's like, what for demon souls? For like, what, what for demon soul? Like, for like demon look, soul? I'm not disrespecting the game. Oh, we, I'm already sure to it. we played it already. Yeah. It's like, what? It has ray Perfect tracing on it. it. This ray tracing has been out for two years. Like chill the fuck out. Like no one gives a fuck. Hey, this. Probably the PS4 version of Bloodborne plays better than the PS5 Demon Souls. People are more into the Bloodborne than they are probably into the Demon Souls at mm -hmm. this point. At least that's what the, the PlayStation fanboys have told me. Although I never really got into any of these Demon Souls games because I, to I me tried. They're, they're too hard. It's annoying. It's not even that they're too hard. It's just that they suck ass. It's truly, just boring. Like, they're it's just, just boring. Like, they are boring, and it's like, oh, get sucked into this world of what? You know, when you play The Witcher 3, CD Projekt Red put together The Witcher oh. 3, it blows away so many games, which is why I'm re I am I will probably at some point buy Cyberpunk. Just yeah, yeah, we'll tell you to this. see what CD Projekt Red did best. I, I, I hate the fact that... I, I love RPGs, even turn-based ones. I don't give a fuck. I grew up with that shit, right? I missed Witcher 3. I only started playing it two weeks ago for the first time ever. I had, I've had i owned it for months on PC. Owned it for months, and I'm like, I was like so itching to play fucking Cyberpunk. I'm like, you know what? I'll try. I missed out on, like, dude, it's so... F the writing... is the, like, the fighting is fine and everything. It's, it, it's pretty challenging and fun. But the writing and the side quests and the fucking story, you're just like... But Cyberpunk takes that. The Witcher 3, you will find, is the next level. I bet you can be on Cyberpunk. Yes, I just, writing. Even writing, I played yes. The Witcher 3, I really was not into RPGs. Even Skyrim didn't really hook me because yeah. I know it's like... You should put more than 40 hours in, you're going to put 300, 400 hours in. It's like, oh, fuck, am I going to put that in? <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Like on World of Warcraft, shit like this, motherfuckers are putting thousands of hours. And it's like, no, man, like you can't do that. So it's like, but with Witcher 3, I went, holy fuck. I didn't even play the other games. Yeah, you don't need to. But Witcher 3, you don't need to. If you get into Witcher 3, it's like, fuck, this is like, an immersive experience. You know what's crazy? And you too? want to spend time everywhere. But it's not even just how the story was written, even though it's written amazing, but the presentation. So you could have a game like let's say World of Warcraft, like you were saying, people put thousands of hours into it. I played like probably like ten hours of that game, just tried it out. I can't 
like the story when it's like a little text box on the bottom left and the characters aren't even animating and shit like talking or whatever and it's just like this re- my brain doesn't give a fuck but, but, Witcher's like great acting as well as great you know writing. it's the truth look there are guys who can just handle the story box and they love it but I mean, for people who are more regular human beings, I mean, shit. You're not going to go for the story box. No. You want to see animation. You want to see what The Witcher 3 does with its quest, with its story. And I know that there were rich stories before that. It's just done so well. Mm-hmm. Even me, who doesn't want to invest time into an RPG, ended up putting more than no. 200 hours into The Witcher 3, 150, 200 hours into the fucking game was a really fun game, and I didn't even do everything that was in the game. I, oh, yeah. You know, I may have dude, played through. I, I heard it's like, like, dude, there's some like, sub-quest. You're like, listen, I would do that sub-quest, but I got like 15 on the fucking, pl- fucking back burner right but now. Surfer, surfer, how many hours did you put into Assassin's Creed Odyssey? I did like 192. Wow. 192 hours into Assassin's Creed, oh, but he God. did everything in the game. So that's the thing is also with these Ubisoft games, if you really like every Assassin's Creed game, Surfer one hundred percent completes it. Yeah. Every game he plays, he goes to a hundred percent. And truly out of those games, even I if you pay full price, you're getting so your money. Dude, I'm gonna say this, what makes Cyberpunk so see so so you know C D Project Red, so you'll understand this. Now, I agree with you with the writing. Now look, the, the writing for Cyberpunk is great. But it isn't like it's sort of like you know, I don't know. Like Witcher Three is just deeper with lore and all that. But Cyberpunk has a lot of lore, a lot of things you find that you could read, background characters. But it's very. But here's what I love about it: the character that you're making is literally how you want to play, not just in dialogue. Like I was like, yo, I want to play this specific way. I wonder if it's possible. Yeah. And you're like, I feel like I'm actually in the city where Witcher, you're sort of playing a body of a character. This game, you actually feel like I am this yeah. V, you know? That's with, what makes with it great. Witcher 3, you're playing Geralt. That's exactly. Geralt. Which is fine. But but. It is that one specific character. And there are benefits and there are negatives to that for sure. With The Witcher, oh, I'm sorry, not with The Witcher, but with Cyberpunk, what is interesting with it and where I don't understand why people complain is it seems to me you can make the character however you want, the color of their skin, their body type, up until they're circumcised or not on their penis. Yeah. All this. And still people complain it's not open enough to creation. Dude, are you kidding? Dude, I'm going to tell you this. There are – so the reviewers are like, I didn't even have to use this system. I didn't even have to do this. First of all, I'm playing on hard mode. I highly recommend playing on hard mode. These people are all playing it on easy, first of all. Secondly, I think the gameplay loop is amazing, in my opinion. It's not revolutionary. It's not game-changing, like, oh, my God, this is like they invented a new w- way to play a game. It's like, imagine a, an amazing new Fallout. If Fallout wasn't gay anymore, you know what I mean? But Andy, Andy, I'll tell you this. Who's going to invent this new loop of gameplay mechanics? Exactly. Because I'll tell you this. I, I go to the Nintendo Switch. I play these Mario games, these Donkey Kong games. Man, they're still just as fun as when I was a kid. Yes. They're just as fun. And it's just timeless fun. And there are timeless patterns to games that people don't understand. And the gameplay is what stands up above everything. Although, with this Cyberpunk and with The Witcher, CG Project Red is trying to create this more expansive world. And they're ambitious with it. And I'm hoping that after launch, it's not ready yet. It's not probably where it needs to be. But maybe six months down the line. It'll be where it needs to be. But there I'm are some problems this. people are going to cry about. I know what you're saying about that. They're crying about it. And I I was, I was, went in with the expectation there will be some bugs and blah, blah, blah. So just expect it. Even with that, the I swear to God, you know in Witcher, sort of like you go from place to place, you meet some characters and explore this world. This world, but you sort of skip over the places you don't need to go. You don't have to explore every piece of of the woods, and every village is very similar, and a lot of re- repeating assets. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, right? 
But in, I swear to God, yeah. every corner of cyberpunk is different. You're like, I swear, you miss a room and you go, like, I once missed a room and I'm like, oh, fuck, let me just head into it. And it's like a whole new style, a whole new fuck it, like, like the the amount of different shit. It's so mind bending, like how they did this. Like, it's actually like it's sort of scary when you're like, how much work did they put into this fucking game? It's too much. Yeah, yeah. Like just well, the modelers they haven't and touched it on PC yet, but they obviously have put in a lot of work. But you know what surprised me the most is have you got a Nintendo Switch yet, Andy, or a Switch I, Lite or any of this? I shit? lost my Switch. You know what? You want to know how I did? When I sold my car a few months ago, because I'm moving to Portugal soon, so I don't need a car. Yeah, so yeah. I sold my car like a few months ago, left my Switch in the glove box. Oh, I and I reckon that I, I realized thing, a week later and I'm like, fuck. But whatever. I sort of. Do you know what? Do you know what? Do you know what just shocks? What it's capable of doing. <laughs> because when I was a kid, you know, and I played Super Mario Sunshine, I wished there was a way. Play Super Mario Sunshine on the Game Boy wherever I went, or Super Mario sixty four, yeah. or these games. And now it's like you can play them better than they ever were, wherever you are in your bed. And not only that, but it can in your bed. But not only that, but you can play The Witcher three in public. That's you can play The Breath of the Wild retarded in public anywhere. It's just crazy to me to think because I never thought, never. Ever Dude, thought it would I was like, blown get beyond. away. I was blown away when I can get an app on my phone to play PS1 games. I'm like, they could, you, I could play Final um, Fantasy fucking 7, 8, and 9 on my phone. And it my that like blew me away. And now it's like, bro, you can play fucking all the remasters. You could play this, that, the other. Like, you could play. And then wait for the next one. The next one, it's going to be like having a PS4. Or PS5 on your fucking. But that's where. The, isn't that where the future really is? The VR that's where I too. Think it is. The VR and the AR, the augmented reality, is coming first in a way that we're just not even going to understand. Like in five years, people just don't know where it's going to be at. Where it's like on the mobile, on the go. Oh, it's it's going to be silly. I remember, it's going to be silly. I remember two, three years ago. So I got PlayStation VR a few uh, years ago. And for so Resident Evil 7 on VR, like, made me have a panic attacks. Like, it's too much. Like, the horror is too real when you're in that fucking headset. But I remember I was playing Skyrim VR, and I, I was so stoned. And I just sat on the edge of a fake waterfall, looking at the moon high, drinking beer with my headset like this. And it was the most amazing. Now, with that was 720p. Now, imagine 1080p with cyberpunk fucking graphics. When I play this game, it feels like I'm already playing VR. In VR, which I'm gonna buy a VR when that's on VR for sure. But that, man, like that, now imagine whatever the next level where you could have like these, have you seen those jackets you could buy that when someone shoots you, it actually shakes where you're shot and stuff? It's insane. I knew a guy who had one. It was crazy, even fuck. 2014 what they had with those fucking jackets where you put them on the guy would play like edm and shit because he was a dj he had one of these well, fuck it would hit you everywhere but now like six years from now like where we're at now even is the consumer version of that five years from now the consumer version is just gonna be fucking stupid Andy. yeah you Cause, know because it's crazy because the vr to the right point where they it's the, the new world order is winning because they're going to convince people to just accept the VR reality and dude, just say, fuck it. It's odd. Like, people are going to go for it. They well, will. Well, you know, it's, uh, I think the craziest thing. So, you know how we have some people who are right wing watching, obviously, like the show. So, I'm talking about cyberpunk. It's a very mature game. There's sex, there's drug use. They like, there's ads for speed. It's like, try speed. Like, why be slow when you can be speed? Um, so all this stuff, right? And people in chat were like, oh my God, this is degenerate and blah, 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 and all this stuff. And I'm like, it is. What do you funny... think the future will look well, like? Well, they were like, oh, oh, there's you could be a tranny in the game. You could do that. And, and I was just like, guys, we're getting there. The game is just a 
It's like a fucking preview of what's to come. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? No, but this is this this shit's guaranteed to happen. Like this shit's no. I mean, fuck, man. If they really get their way, it's five years away. This shit. Yeah. Like seriously. Well, imagine it's just the shit if they really. If they made 2077, and it was like, what? You America's all white people, and they're like, guys, it's not, it's not happening. Like, the, 2077 is like is the bleak look when you look Be realistic. When you look down the street and everything's an ad, you go, this is what's happening right now. This is like, but it's just all they need is holograms, and we're fucked. Sandy. Andy, you live in Toronto. You know what it's like. You walk downtown, everything is an ad. Like, yep. seriously. Like, I go to Toronto, shit is an ad. You young and done that? Like, it is not. Uh, yeah, dude, it's not far from what cyberpunk is, really. I mean, you get a little bit more loose on the drug laws. Like, it's not. And a little bit more loose on immigration. Not even Look at really. This. Wait, the immigration wait. is One like. Second. That. Mario 88. I like you, dude. But he's like, I can't take the escapism. I'm out. But you're having fun in that world, Andy. Yeah, it's interesting. It's 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 fascinating to me. If you want to leave now, he goes, peace, man. If you hate escapism and you can't watch us talk about it, bye. Like, what, like, what is your problem? I, like, like, I don't, why I don't, are you like, living that way? And I, I like this guy, too. It's not even like, like just like a troll trying to fucking troll me. It's oh, like... He's Oh, he's righteous. He's righteous. Oh, it's hang just on. That you're too righteous, my brother. Yeah. Hey, hey, don't play. Hey, don't play Red Dead too, because back then, uh, cowboys were degenerate because they were shooting people for money. That's interesting to me. Why do you watch movies? Do you watch movies because they're reflections on your life? No, you watch it because it's like a horror movie, a murdering fucking crazy dude. Andy, you, you enjoy escapism. Andy, you're wrong. Some of these motherfuckers really identify with the characters in these movies. They can't discern it from reality, unfortunately. Like, some people really think they're the Joker from that Joker movie. You know yeah. what I mean? They're, like, they're just fucked up. They're just fucked up, and they're misguided. There's nothing you can really do. They're just an unfortunate casualty of allowing adult media to exist. And I don't really view them as a real problem. I just view them as an inevitable consequence of a, a media that's free and where we're allowed to have adult content. Some people are going to get fucked up by it. That's not my fault. I'm and, not fucked up by it. And 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 the funny thing is, it's like the cyberpunk thing. Yeah, I'm having fun in the world because it's like, holy fuck, I get to do what I want in this crazy world. It's what will happen. And it's interesting to talk about because... It will also keep our eyes open and vigilant when we do start seeing these trends happen that maybe there could be a pushback or, I mean, right now, I mean, are, like, I don't want to be defeated. I'll just tell you this. I don't know how there can be a pushback against a game like Cyberpunk from the left. I really don't understand that yeah. because it's everything they've ever dreamed of brought to reality in, in a, a universe that they can immerse into it. Well, the right, and, well, like, he's, that's he's probably, probably a right the guy. The best thing for them in terms of their health is that they can cope through something like cyberpunk. I hope that they do cope through something like cyberpunk instead of actually cutting off their penis or doing serious permanent damage to themselves. I hope they can cope through something like this. I think something like this is more helpful than something like when Digibro says Lollicon is an actual cure. I think something like this is an actual cure maybe for a transgender person who wishes to LARP as that fantasy. They can do it in a video game safely and not actually hurt themselves. I don't know. There are ways with this sort of game where even though it's degenerate, it can be helpful. And I think that well, this sort of also, future, people need a warning. They need a warning that this could happen. Also, by the way, do you know how good it feels? Like, listen, my character, I'm specifically a melee, which is possible. Thank God, finally, an RPG like this where you could actually, like, because Fallout, you can't use melee. You'll be fucking, you'll die in five seconds every battle. You, but this one? You, you can. Just, you have to cheese everything. You have to and cheese it, yeah. Dirty no, no, this one, dude, you stay behind a box. You scan a camera. You, you, you hack the camera. You're looking at it. You mark all your targets. You fucking, you could use, like, 
uh, a reset their their eyewear so their eyes turn and they're blind for five seconds. Run up, hack, 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 hide this body, go back here, blah, blah, blah. You fucking hack these guys. Someone sees you over here. You bust out the shotgun. You shoot here. Two dudes behind you. Throw grenade. It's such an exhilarating. You're at the end. You're like, that was, you feel like a fucking badass. That's what it is. It's like, a, this like is the thing. And, and here's the thing. So the last AAA release I bought, Andy, was Call of Duty Black Ops Propaganda. Cold War. All right, well then, don't play it then, White Future. Have you have you played it? White Future? Oh, the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold yes, War. Yes, yes, yes. It's fucking cool. I love it. I love it. I really like the campaign. Me and Surfer played through it a couple times, got the different endings and stuff. We're yeah. still going to play through it even a few more times because the, the, the campaign is fun. really fun. You have that like code breaking mission as well that's kind of like interesting. It might take you a little bit to solve that puzzle. You know what I mean? It's a tough puzzle actually in the, in the campaign. It was fun. Um, and the different endings added to it. My biggest issue was so. You know, have you ever done the, the, the Mountain Dew double XP thing for any sort of games before in the past? Mountain Dew double XP? You mean like you you put in the, a, a code or something? Yeah, like the code under the cap of the no, bottle. Oh, no, I haven't done that. This shit. So this, shit, this promotion's been running for like more than 10 years now. Like, you know what I mean? It's like a really iconic promotion. And previously in the past, you get like two hours XP an hour double XP. You know, that's what you'd expect. This time, you know, I go out, I buy the game. It's like it's like pre-ordered. It's loading on my Xbox day one. I go out, get like 12 bottles of Mountain Dew. You know, these <laughs> bottles of Mountain Dew, double XP on them is 15 minutes per cap. Shut the fuck up. 15 minutes that's per nothing. Mountain Dew bottle. That's nothing. It's nothing. It has to be at least two hours, or at least an hour, for God's sake. Have 15. fucking mercy. Wait, is it 15 minutes that, one? Isn't that one fucking, like, multiplayer match? One, one match. One match. Oh. Less than one zombies match, you know? <laughs> so, like, 15, 15 minutes for one cap. It's, like, two fifty a Mountain Dew at the store. I'm getting them, like... Three for six dollars, you know, like fucking spend like twenty dollars on Mount Dew to get like four hours. And the fucking kick in the nutsack, the kick in the nutsack is you have to sign up with your email address for a Mount Dew and Doritos account, which I was, I just wasn't willing to do at that point. I just gave up on my double XP fifteen minute fucking Mount Dew. And what a bunch of bullshit. And I fucking try and play zombies multiplayer with Surfer local. And they've just disabled local co op. <laughs> there is no. Wait, there wait, is yeah. no. There is, wait, wait, wait. Imagine right. this. They, 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 they like decided no one plays multiplayer in the same house anymore. Like they just decided that like anymore. three years ago. Three years ago, they're like, but, no more. Yeah. Even longer. Yeah. So, but here's the thing. So you go into zombies, there's an option for a split screen for okay. someone to join. The so surfer goes to join. It takes him two I hours. <laughs> it takes him. Okay, so he named his character Jew Slayer, but spelled a way that Microsoft will accept. Yeah. So any so anyway, he's trying to sign up for an Activision account. It takes two <laughs> hours because the game is glitching out so hard on Xbox that you can't even accept the terms of service for an Activision account. <laughs> Two hours later, I'm not even joking, like 20 attempts, like 25, like multiple dozens of attempts later, he manages to sign into an Activision account he created, only to be greeted by a screen telling us that there's no local multiplayer, even though it said press A for split screen in zombies mode. That's fucked up, dude. Yeah. That's fucked up. Did it work, though? No, it never worked. No. We still haven't been able to play Zombies Co-op. And they don't have dedicated servers. So, like, we've been trying to do this Dead Ops arcade mode, which is like a twin-stick shooter. And we can't get through it because every time we get far, the host disconnects. Oh. Because, is, because it's like peer-to-peer -peer garbage. And, like, 
this is like the most profitable game in the world. They can't afford dedicated <laughs> servers that I might play their boats online. Really? Yeah. That... This is what I'm. I'm in like the fucking dark ages on this Xbox. Like praying to God for like a revival miracle. Like this shit's just terrible. We fucking play the campaign war ski. Like this fucking shit's going gray. Like the cutscenes are going gray and like glitching out. It won't even load on an Xbox One. Like this is my whole point. Is like, look, if it won't work. Why release it oh, on that console? It's oh, it's like Cyberpunk uh, for PS4, and apparently, it's got a 1.8 on Metacritic. Cyberpunk on PS4 just does not work. It just does not work. It's like why release it there? Like that—that that was the worst choice you could have ever done. Now they have to update it. Like maybe like you should have waited a little bit and made like a new version that like can run on a PS4 or something. I don't know, like. Oh. It's, no, they should have just released it for PS5 and Xbox One X and, and not said, Fuck PS4. You. Yeah, they, they did that thing. Remember Tony because, Hawk when Tony Hawk went from PS1 to PS2, but they made Tony Hawk 3 on PS2, but also on PS1. But so PS1 people like me were like, "Oh, I'm gonna rent it from the Blockbuster, and it's gonna be like this." And then I played it. And I'm like. What is this? this? Is fucking garbage. It's nothing like what you saw. Cause, yeah, it's like like cyberpunk. If you see like the characters, like models, there's some people. Dude, it's fuck. Actually, yo, there's a video. Yo, check this you out. You know, like it this should. Funny. It shouldn't be like this. Like what? Look, like this console should be so powerful. Like it should be able to play this crap. Do you know what I mean? Like what is it going should. on? Hang on. It was a 12 second video. Fuck, where is they it? can't sell you shit that just doesn't work like this. Like, there's multiple videos that are like this that go on for, like, 10 minutes long. <clears throat> which is why I just know, like, on last gen, like I am, like, until I buy a fucking 4K TV and a fucking there PS5 is. or an <clears throat> Xbox. You check this out. Check this out, all right? Yeah, I just... Yeah. Oh, <clears throat> fuck. Yeah, I'm going to put you over there. All right. Everyone watch this. This is, this is 18 seconds long. It's called Cyberpunk on PS4 high rate of violence and more people living below the poverty line than anywhere else. <laughs> no, but it goes like N64 mode. Like, for real. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> like, good luck. Dude, this opening was great. Yeah. But this is fucking bad. <laughs> like that's... that's how it probably really is. Like, it's not even an exaggeration. Like, the shit just flat out will not work on, like, an Xbox One or a PS4. Yeah, like, there's some people there. It, I mean, it will not. I'm sure it's, like, maybe in three months. Is it 30 frames per second. I'm trying to see if it's exaggerated. Like, a young Ye. You trusted us in his sign. Shut up, young Ye. Shut the fuck up. Uh, hang on. I don't know. Uh, I might play it to see it how it is, but it's just don't want to be the guinea pig. Like, so look at this. <sighs> I guess the, the the textures just look really flat. I guess I don't know. It doesn't look That's terrible. Not too it looks bad. All not right. Too bad. Not too bad. But it looks like a fallout. How can almost. I help you? Yeah. Yeah. Like. Yeah, like like if you uh, see uh, typical if, Bethesda, if you see my like with with RTX on and fucking all ultra settings, the God, game is how you got is every reflection, every puddle shows the city in it. It's like holy, and everything's shiny and reflective. But look at Looking this! A little Whoa! Put out there, input. Ooh, dirty! Just, you want a cream BD? Oh my God! There, you oh know, God, that's what she's supposed to look like. That's like a minute though. Sweet little face you have. My, uh -oh. what a sweet little kiss my face. This bitch, every time you walk by her, she says that. Uh, what a sweet little face you have. I'm like, shut. They couldn't put a second voice uh, acting there. That's glitched. It should, it, it should be polished beyond that. It should be better. That. Yeah. That's what you expect from CD Projekt. And then when you like see... you expect this level of unpolished for a Bethesda or Ubisoft, but and when CD Projekt Red says we have this open world, 
to expect it to be unblemished. And I'll tell you, like, when Breath of the Wild runs on a portable, why can't this run on a fucking actual console? What is going on? You look what it looks like when you're playing on ultra ray tracing. Look at those fucking graphics. Like, it's, yeah. it's honestly, hang on, wait for, I'm going to find... You can't, even, you can't even load it because it's like... You know what I mean? Like the the bandwidth in Canada is just right, poor. Yeah. yeah, look at that. Did anything interesting happen over there? You see how clean, yeah. like, no one out? this is it's fucking night and day. I'm looking for uh like a it's just the difference. Like you have to build a PC for this game. I actually you bought have the twenty eighty to... Ti basically to play this game properly. We must look at that detail. And... Like the game is actually like it's so buttery on the eyes, it's it's fucking unbelievable. I it, I I just like at some point I keep just I stare at everything. It's the first game where I actually like look at the reflection of the floor, every like little thing while I'm running it, through an it's area. It's just like it's just tough, Andy. When like everybody you talk to about this shit is, like, exactly. oh my god, but what about the frame rate and what about this and what about that? I don't know. Like most games I play nowadays are pretty fucking good. You know, like people like really cry their ass out about like small insignificant things about a game that just really get bum hurt. Like I don't know. I don't what, know. What, like, look, you pay the you pay the same price for this fucking badass game than you do with any fucking game in the market. This, like if they made this game two hundred dollars. And then, then you could bitch all you want. It's the same price as any game. You could fucking buy the remake of Sunshine and the and fucking um, Mario sixty four or whatever for like seventy. You'll fucking pay that, and you won't bitch at all. But you go CD Projekt Red. By the way, isn't like the biggest no. game company ever. And Andy, Andy, in Canada, it's ninety dollars to play the Mario Sunshine remake, the '64, and the yeah. Galaxy, and it's not even a remake; it's just a fucking straight port. Yes, you're right. Sorry, it's not even a remake. You're right. It's yeah. not even a remake; it's just a joke. But you know, I still, I still love it because I grew up with those games. But, but you don't still, it's like about it, right. Nobody, nobody cries about it. Nintendo charges full price, but you feel justified because. Nintendo has gameplay that is better than just about anybody out there. It's addictive gameplay, and people play it. It's similar to like Grand Theft Auto and Call of Duty. These games, like they they lock people in and, and they look, get invested. I love New Vegas, right? It's one of my favorite games, Fallout games. New Vegas, I love that game. So why wouldn't I love this? Look at this game. Oh, look. it looks gorgeous, actually. So, uh, so low uh, is on left. With ray tracings on right. This is how I'm playing. See, so you see here, it's just like a shiny fake reflection. Here is an actual reflection. So, yeah, the, the fucking... It's crazy. And if you were to play this in VR, it would just be crazy. It, it would you blow your here. mind, dude. It still looks pretty good on low, though. Like, if you look at it, like, on left there, it's not bad. To be it's honest. not bad. Like... Nobody should complain about this shit, really. But, you know, like, truly, like, I remember playing, like, fuck. I played the Super Nintendo till I was, like, 10 or 12. And the, the jump from, it. like, the jump from, like, Super Nintendo to, like, GameCube was, like, fucking retarded. Dude, Even the Star jump Fox? from, like, Nintendo. Yeah. You know, when I played Star it, Fox, I was like, what the fuck is this, dude? They did it. And uh, I'll tell you, like, every generation since that 360 and PS3, it's just like, I don't care as much anymore. And it's just sad. Like, it's just... Yeah, well, that's why I, I appreciate what this game is. It's beyond. I mean, look at the, the city building. The RPG elements are cool. The story is fucking awesome. It's badass. I, I, I don't think they can improve the graphics. All they can really improve nowadays is, like, the level of detail like so it's like sure because yeah. you're not gonna have real life for another two console generations three generations even like no but you know what before we're dead we'll get it you know mm. before we're dead we'll get that shit you know we'll be like seven oh, one second my cat wants to like, escape hang on one second go into like real life it'll be crazy but you know that's that's quite some time away there will be a lot of people that just choose not to live in real life rather than 
choose to live in this sort of fantasy world. No, I, you know, I, I, I legitimately, dude, like, I'm so excited to see. I'm glad, you know, what's the best part about being, uh, me being 32, right? Like, you're a bit younger, but I was able, I grew up during playing Atari, playing Nintendo, playing Super Nintendo, playing PlayStation, playing every console generation, playing VR to whatever it was going to be in the next. I, w I lived through the entire evolution of games, minus the like, early Atari, because I, I was too young for that, obviously. My cousins had Atari, and we played it when we were like young, but it was like, almost fucked. But I had a Nintendo when I was, I think, like three or something, three and four, and then a Super Nintendo onwards, right? I had fucking SNES, Super Mario World, Mortal Kombat, and Street Fighter. My dad, my parents gave away my Nintendo, so I cried. I'm like, what the fuck's wrong with you? Next day, fucking Super Nintendo with new games and shit. I'm like... Never mind. I'm not. I was like, I hate you. You know, when I, you're a kid, you hate your parents. Take away your games. But then I was like, I love you more now. You've 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 won my trust back. I remember the first my first blockbuster experience. The first game I blockbuster yeah. I ever got, Donkey Kong. That was my first. No. I remember that DK and oh, me going, whoa, fuck. yeah, fucking Dundas you know, and Blore, Dundas and Blore. Uh, I used to get when I went to Blockbuster VHS of Big Bad Beetleborgs. I don't know if you ever saw that shit, but it was like nah. the knockoff of Power Rangers. It was fucking good. <laughs> I don't know. Like I used to play Super Smash Brothers for the Nintendo 64 when I went to Video 99 or Blockbuster. I would get like Paper Mario. I would get you know I get Mario, Mario 64 Rude. going. But I never played anything beyond like N64. PlayStation. I had a PlayStation growing up. I played like Crash Bandicoot, Spyro, stuff like this, and I played Super Nintendo. Yeah. I kind of missed N64 but when it came to the GameCube. And the first game I played on GameCube was like Bomberman Generations. And like Bomberman Generations was so far beyond even the, any of the graphics I had seen on anything before. I was shocked. And then I played Super Mario Sunshine. It was just like Wow. Yeah, it yeah. Was, it was so far beyond anything I had seen before. I, I, I'm I, I've remember, never been more blown away than that. My, my, so my blow away uh, moment in my life was I'm a big Final Fantasy. I, I love Final Fantasy VI. That's what I grew up. That's what taught me how to read, basically. Right? So it was FF6. And then I remember my cousin, I went over to his house for whatever, and I just like slept over because he had video games and it was like whatever. And he's like, yo, PlayStation 1, check this shit out. He fires up Final Fantasy 7. So at this oh, point, fuck. I had only seen Super Nintendo. Didn't, I wasn't in, like, like, I didn't really have access to see what new games looked like. My first encounter with 3D games was fucking FF7 opening cutscene. I'm just like, like, I remember just like screaming. Like, I'm like, oh. what the fuck? Because I love Final Fantasy. See, and I'm like, see anything like that. Oh, dude, that. And then even when it cut to the actual gameplay, even because, you know, like the videos are different than the, the FMVs were different than the actual gameplay. Even seeing the blocky hands and the spiky, and it looks like it looks like dog shit now when you look at it. Even I was like, we oh, did it. Man. This is it. This is the, the pinnacle of games right here. And now the new Final Fantasy VII remake, you're like, the graphics are like, uh, whoa, dude. But people will complain about it. They'll still complain. I just can't believe it. It's just got to a point where even, like, the lowest, like, shit now is, like, better than anything you would have seen <laughs> 10 years ago. Like, the best. Oh, they go. You know, what? people are like, oh. No, you know what? PvP, sorry. But the old Final Fantasy Seven. Is better than the new one. I'm like, well, I mean, like, because your nostalgia, sure, like your glasses, your nostalgia glasses are, yeah, of course, you see it's better. But I've tried playing FF7 recently. It's too, I can't do it. It's like, I, I love this game. It, it's my, it, I played, I beat it like 10 times when I was a kid. But from what I played now, sure, I love that game because it's like an old book. But I can't get, I, I'm sorry, after playing like, 
things like Fallout and Cyberpunk and fucking Call of Duty, the new one, and new RPGs. And it, I look at an old RPG and I'm like, I still have that like love for you, but I can't put 60 hours into FF7, you know? Well, and that's where I don't know where guys are at, where they're like, well, the original Ultimas were the best RPG of all time. I mean, really, no, guys? No. Like, really? Like, come on. Like, I know the flavor text looked good. At the time. Like, surely it was great, the flavor text. But, like, live in the real world. Like, people now are playing shit that's, like, fuck, so far beyond that now. Mm. It just pales in comparison. And it's only going to get worse but you know, I, it's only I would gonna say, get though, there are some timeless, and the, t the most timeless in gameplay, I would say, is Nintendo. Like, Super Mario World, you, can, you can fire that up. You can fire up Super Mario World. The controls are so tight that it, like, beats, like, a lot of, like, actual, like, platformers, like, modern platformers. And Mario Maker was, like, fucking, that was, like crazy ass like taking all the physics oh. from every game and like putting it in there it was amazing people don't people don't give nintendo enough credit but when you really think about it with like the nintendo console like you get a lot of games that they come out with that are exclusive for nintendo that are really fun like really fun games like the smash brothers games the mario kart games especially you have friends and you know, then you add, like, Odyssey on top of that. You add, like, Breath of the Wild on mm. top of that. Like, even Luigi's Mansion and Donkey Kong Country Tropical fun. Freeze yeah. from Wii U. I really like Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. Like, I think it's better than, like, the Super Nintendo games. Well, but well, a lot of people I cry agree. about that. Well, people, well, they cry about it because, again, I'm sorry, but nostalgia. Like, they literally, yeah. it's like, I get it. Like, there are some new styles of game that I hate, and I think pixel art will still uh, will, 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 it'll trump every time. So, for example, pixel art looks in FF6 or whatever looks better than that vector animation gay shit that you were seeing in animation a lot. Like, remember, like when drawings used to be drawings and they were fucking badass. Like, it looks like talented animators did it and yeah. now it's like these ve vectors it's like all like power puff girl looking motherfucking cartoons you know what i mean and well, some that's games do that's that why shit. i haven't been able to get into anime in recent years is it just doesn't look the same as it, as it used to be and like everybody has yeah. just gotten lazier with the computer mm. but it's still like with video games i think it's the art that with the technological advancements gets better and better but like, for instance, at the Video Game Awards last night, there's zero reason for Christopher Nolan to be presenting Game of the Year. Seriously. It was him doing Movies it? Are, it was him doing it, and it's like bullshit, like him tipping the cap to games. He doesn't consider games to be art. He doesn't consider games to be legitimate. He really believes that movies are the peak of art. He doesn't believe games can go beyond that. And I think that certain games could go beyond what's capable in movies because of the immersive aspect of it. Mm -hmm. But it will only be in 20, 30 years' time that the experts start to recognize gaming as legitimate to movies or other things. That's just the truth. Like, by the end of our lifespan, well, we will see it. It's very pretentious. That's why. It's like this, like... Because you imagine people gaming and they're, they're drinking their Mountain Dew and they're eating their Doritos and they're all fucking neck beard pieces of shit, whatever. But if you think like like the reality is, a ton, oh, so many people play games. No, and, and everyone under thirty, everyone under thirty plays, plays games. Videos. Plays video games. I'll and tell also, you, also, the under Cyberpunk, twenty, it's like a hundred percent. Like and then, under 20, it's 100%. And by the way, when you look at new movies now, a lot of them are garbage. In fact, Kyler brought this up. If you go on Google and search the term movie, uh, new movies and then hit images, look at the fucking... Or just hit new movies and then hit, hit view wall. Look at all the movie yeah. posters. They all look like what video games use as fake ads. To put like in Resident it's true. Evil, it looks like you're like I it's don't recognize. True. You know these posters aren't they're recognizable. Trying, they're trying to re they're trying to recapture the masses that have gone on to video games, but they won't. They will only capture older people, 
and it's going to be older and older. And I hate it because I love the movie theater. Me too. I yeah. love movies. I try to be discerning with my movie selections. I try and go to see the art films each year if they're in the theater and this sort of thing. But truly, they're dying. They're dying like opera died or like theater died. Stand up they're dying, is dying actually, right? Well, stand up I've always thought is a joke. And I, I, I always have thought it's not really legitimate. There are a lot of guys who in stand-up were funny, but when their the push comes to shove, they're in improv. Yeah, they're not funny. Diddler Dax, I think, is guilty of the same thing. Mm. And I'll tell you this, and I hate to fucking do it, but I went up against a professional comedian and a lawyer. And most people will tell you somehow I embarrassed the professional comedian and the lawyer. The lawyer has some excuse, but the professional comedian does not have any excuse. He was calling in Zoom and other people. Honestly, Diddler Dak should be ashamed of what he did. You know what? Really. Yeah, I, I think there's this, this thing with comedians. Like, I honestly, like, most comedians now are fucking, the, like, they're so... They think they're better. Like, oh, I'm a comedian. I did stand up for fucking ten years. I, oh, well, I'm a comedian, so I'm better. No, it doesn't fucking matter. People are funny and different. But he's like, oh, I made people laugh on stage once. All right, yeah, but how many times did you bomb before you did good? Every comedian when they start, are well, either wait a minute. okay how or many, me how many times? This is where I say, how many times did they make somebody laugh in a bar with their group of friends? How many times did they actually create something that in real life was funny? And a lot of these guys come up on fucking empty when it comes to that. I'm just saying they just can't create those moments that like a, a real organic comedian, a real mm -hmm. funny guy could do because they're so congested with this idea of scripted material. Everything has to be perfect. You get the punchline. No, anything can be funny. Literally anything can be funny but here's the if crazy it's delivered the is, right way to the right audience. How much times like comedians make you laugh through fake, exaggerated? Like sure, sure, we'll, we'll all exaggerate to be funny on on like a show here, for example. But they everything they say is not real. It's like. Yeah, well, you can construct anything to sound funny, but are you funny? Like just like 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 a lot of like like comics you speak to aren't really funny off the cuff, like you said. A lot of them are though. A lot of are. But here's the thing: my thing with stand up beyond that, beyond that is the art of stand up. It's so boring now for me. Like I used to love it too when I was younger. Like Louis C.K. Louis C.K., I would see one of his new specials. I'd be like, yo, Louis, you know, live at the Beacon Theater. I, I purchased all his yeah. fucking... And then one day, I'm like watching it on Netflix. I'm like trying to watch stand-up, and I'm like, I can't do it anymore. Like, I can't, like... I know. It's face. It's, 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 I give it... I, give, I disrespect it too much because there are stand-up comedians who are great. And, yes. And, you know, yes. I should show respect to them. But it's gotten to the point now where anybody on Netflix can get a fucking special. It's no longer as big of a deal to have a special and to have everybody notice it. You get these comedians that just are fucking terrible. Now, Dave Chappelle's last special, is it politically incorrect on the right to like it? Yes. Did I like it? Yeah, I did like Dave Chappelle's last special. I thought it was all right. I think a lot of right-wing guys are too sensitive. I think with Borat 2, for instance, right-wing guys are too sensitive to Borat 2. Yeah. And they need to just re they need to just realize it's a funny movie and we just well, fucking dude, move let's on. Be I mean, the guy is yeah, let's be honest. Beyond movies and games or whatever, it's like the right, I find, and like we saw here tonight when I said I like Cyberpunk. A lot of the people on the right, if you're not if you're not saying exactly the points that every person on the right, if you don't believe everything or like, oh, you do drugs degenerate. What about trad life? What you fuck, you, you fuck the girl and then like, you know, you don't want to marry her or have kids. You don't want to like push the white race or, you know, all this bullshit. It's like, I'm not this, I'm not fucking what these, a lot of these people say they are, which they're not behind the scenes, but they're like, you know what I mean? Anything, it's like the I find the well, right is the, too. The, a lot of them the are Paragon, too sensitive. 
The paragons of virtue have to be truthful with themselves and ask how close are they to actually what they're embodying. Most of them are not there. There are the odd person that is there and is like legitimate with that, but that sort of person lives like a pretty boring life. I really would not want to live that life. I know it's like righteous or whatever. It's not the life I've chosen to live. I live a little bit looser than that. Yes, exactly. I understand, I understand some people are upset with that. Now, as I get older in life, will I get stricter? Probably. You know, like it happens yeah. to just about everybody. Like, I don't think I'm on the trajectory in life that my necessity leads to total ruin because I'm only 24 years old. A lot of people are just ridiculous. They're like, oh, you've gambled on a sports game. You're going straight to hell. No, that's not actually the reality. You couldn't point me to a scripture that would justify what your position is. Mm. You know, you'll tell me, but these people have no idea. I, I know more about scripture and I've forgotten more than most of the people know. And that's what just gets sad to me is when they come at me with garbage that I can easily refute. And they really think they have a gotcha on me. Yeah. And they just don't. It's sad. But, you know, Andy, these video game awards, I was going to get into it in greater detail. At one point, Swedish chef arrives. At one no. point, the Swedish chef from the Muppets actually shows up to present an award for, like, mobile game of the wait, year wait, to wasn't himself. Wait, was he there last year and shit, too? He was there last year, too. All right. I don't even know. Yeah, he like, was. Why are we having? Why are why are gamers having to listen to the Swedish chef? Does the Swedish chef have anything <clears throat> to do with anything? Like, what the fuck is going on? Like, the opening award had some weird woman with like a shaved fucking half head. I don't know if you saw this weird shaved half head. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Brie Larson arrives to deliver an award That's to the last retarded. year. Too. By the way, I think oh, oh. I think it would be cool if, if they got like you know the, you know what they could do with like uh, putting CGI on a screen, but someone's not there. Have some awards presented by game characters who are famous, and have, have the voice oh. actor do it. You know what I mean? Like especially with Corona. Oh, just, Sorry, go ahead. Well, just about anything is better than anything. What they anything do, but is... what they're doing. I mean, I've never known a games award where people have gone, oh, that was really legitimate, well done, and tasteful. Whereas people have gone like, oh, that Academy Awards was good, or that MTV Awards was good, or that Grammys was good. I've never met anyone who said, oh, that video game awards was good. Have you? <laughs> no, no, of course not. Everyone hates it. But yo, hang on, PvP, I, I, I'm Ken, honestly, very, very tired. Uh, oh, and you know I, I, it I'm, can't I'm be. Honestly, if I had one more energy drink, I'm actually about to pass. Like, I'm, I'm it, it, the wall hit me hard, dude. The last five minutes, it's like, whoosh, I need to pass out. But fucking, right, we man. have to do this again. We have to do this again because I can keep going. Believe me, with video game talk, especially. I can go on and on and on, but well, you know what? Andy, six hours wait, street, wait, wait, not wait, bad though, right? One more thing I gotta show you. I promised sure. I'd show this. Sure. Let me show you this. Can we have a lot? You know what's funny is like, oh, you like you want to do some show prep like before, and I'm like, trust me, man, we're not gonna need it. All right. Let me get this to you. This is some interesting shit. All right. This is this is some street beef, street boxing, you know. Uh -huh. This is some real deal shit. This is some interesting stuff. Click on this okay. and let's get it going. All right, all right. Can okay. you tell me what you think initially as to who will win this fight? Uh, Look at this guy. <laughs> Wait, what is this? Do you think this guy's making it? <laughs> Uh, do this. <laughs> what the fuck? We got an MMA match for you. In this corner, we have G Tell. What the? In this corner, Where is this? This is street beefs. They just have fights in backyards and okay. like barns and shit. Okay. Shinigami. <laughs> it's Shinigami, buddy. <laughs> Fight! 
Black guy over here. He's like, "What the fuck just happened?" <clears throat> you know, like, what that is going kick. on? So then they give. So then, hold on, Andy. But look at look at this crazy shit. So they give this guy a second fight in the same in the same day. Who? who? The red guy. They give Shinigami. Uh, yeah, the red guy. They had kicked the guy. They give him a second fight in the same day. I just sent it to you. They have him oh, fight another guy because they can't. <laughs> They can't even believe this head kick knockout. Like, <laughs> look at this. This fucking dude's look like from that. Naruto or some shit. You know, <laughs> like, what is this? That's a high kick too. <laughs> he's like so fat. He's like three hundred pounds. The dude, you just can't uh, even imagine to do this. Imagine getting kicked by that man. You'd fucking it'd break your neck. I think. Oh no, there's another one. Dude's just like blown out. The ref knows it's over. Oh yeah, he's like, don't please don't hit him, please don't hit him. You're, you're gonna kill this motherfucker. All right. here but here's go. like the second fight, Andy. Where okay. He fights a second guy in the same day. Okay. Because he's okay. He, he didn't even get winded. Uh oh. You got me. One more. One more. One more. One last match for you out here. This guy should be shitting himself, man, dude. After seeing that last match, I'd be scared as fuck. You know. <laughs> I had to show, I had to show this to you. This is like my late night hour special to pull out. Like, I love this shit. Here we go. This is where we could go for another three hours because I can just pull the goodie bag. Like, you know, we just go. Oh. Look at this fucking guy. Oh, shit. Oh. You know. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, holy fuck. But he's trying his jujitsu. Now he's got this big fat fuck on top of him. And it's not good. It's not good. Oh, he's done. He's done. Look at him. He's like trying to. Oh, no. He's getting molested against the hay bale. Into the hay bale. He's done. You know, at this point. Just the elbow to the head. Rules, dude. Dude, this shit just base. He punches him in the nuts. Just bleed. Oh, that doesn't happen in MMA, brother. Bust her up, bro. Bust her up. Go, rain him down. Oh my God. And do you end up against the hay bale in MMA? Oh, here oh no, he's the last oh, thing in the house. Putting his. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. You're good. not good, buddy. Like you're just gonna get. <laughs> Wait, does he? Got your winner, Shinigami. Hell yeah, Shinigami! This guy's a fucking. Yo, what is this guy? What is this guy? What the fights fuck? the black guy in the uh, title Dojo fight Dojo now that just came out. Oh my god, dude. Martial arts guys special needs I want to get this guy on the show, kind of, you know? You no. Know, <laughs> you oh, you're interview him and shit? Are you like the white trash? You know, you'd be based to get on for it. Yeah. I, I feel like he's in a fuck. He, he like has like this ninja stance, too. Let's see this he's one. He's going for these characters. This guy oh, has the no. Ethan Ralph energy. Like, it's totally... oh, yeah. yeah, there's the new Shinigame fight surfer. This is the new Shinigame fight. He's just fighting this white trash. <laughs> but, like, buddy's going. Like, he's going. Like, these are just two big fat boys going. This is like the preview of me and Ralph. It's just kind of boring, you know? These big fat fox going. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh. I love Shinigame. Uh, like, he's. He, he pushes them on, like, the fucking wall and nonstop. You know, like, he's, he's just out of some, like, Naruto universe or something that shouldn't even be real. Dude, they're still going. Holy <laughs> fuck, three he's minutes? He's, like, throwing the body kick. Like, oh, shit, look at him go. <laughs> okay, they're on the next round. 
Oh my yeah. god. But you want to see some fun shit even beyond this is like the rowdy matches are fucking amazing. You know, if we want to watch, if we're going to watch maybe one more of these, because we're fucking going now. Yeah. But if you want to watch one more of these, we'll type in more. felony fights. Let me see if I can find felony fights. Felony fights. It's like karate kid versus like neo-Nazi. <laughs> I found it. Okay, so, so hold on, hold on. We're gonna have to skip to a time code. Though. I mean, we could sit here and watch all this, but it's kind of, it's kind of superfluous. Let me see if I can get. We'll do. Hold we'll do a stream where we fucking just tear through a bunch of fucking fights. That'd be fun. Here's here's straight jacket versus the karate kid. Okay, so neo Nazi versus karate kid. Yeah. It's just like this you might have to skip ahead a little bit. Uh oh! I'm oh oh on. no! Hang on, let me put. Let me Save use it. Hold on, I'm going for a piss. So just do it. Do it. Let me log in. Shit. Firefox. So so annoying. Fuck off. There we go. And go both. Watching. There we go. So I have to skip through a bunch of it. This is just setting up who they are. I'm about to fuck some shit up, and you're gonna have to fucking rewind this video over and over and over and over again, because someone's about to get knocked off. Fuck out! Wait, what the fuck? Holy shit. Bro, bro do these that guys... Like the, that was like the longest piss I've ever taken. <laughs> Yo, these guys, I couldn't these even fucking... believe how long I pissed. <laughs> I have to piss too soon, but I'll hold it for this. Do Are they battling with sticks, though? All right, here we go. Yeah, they're going to battle with sticks. I don't know if we can show this, actually. Huh? This is some wild shit. I mean, no. the, so this neo-Nazi from this gangster is this too much fight to show? this like karate. What? Is this too much to show on D Live, you think? I don't know. We probably can get away with yeah, it. I've shown just... it on YouTube many times. Oh, okay. Look at him go. He's just like Look at it. here we go. We'll go from here. We'll play from here. This is where it gets like legitimate. Black on my screen, but whatever. Oh, 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 is it? My bad. Hang on, hang on. Let me do this. Both. After I, I forgot, I have to switch the browser because. Hang on, switch the share screen to. Uh, where is it? Stop share, reshare. Boom, boom. Okay, do you see that? Wait, now you're muted, by the way. Did you switch All something? All right, now we're in on some real race war action here, folks. All right. Here, the bottle over there. Here we go. What, what are they using? These are like Tendo sticks from like wrestling. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty big shit. Yo, I want to, I want to battle big glass like that. You know what I mean? Like this is how our fight should be, in. This is how I see it. This how I see it, Andy. Like Straight up, you know, bro. you sell these fuckers used to sell these DVD tapes for millions. You know, like what a bunch of bullshit. We all got fucked. Yeah. It was too early. We, yeah, but Big Glasgow, obviously, he doesn't want to fight me. Even though he Hold on, he's, st he's stolen oh. the karate kid stick. Oh. oh. Hold on, it's gonna get serious now. Oh, no. 
They changed the fucking aspect ratio for this part. Wait, he's biting him. Wait, is there any like like ear being ripped off or anything? No, no, nothing gets ripped off. He just gets bit pretty bad. Oh. No way, motherfucker. And he comes in and he's just ruthless. Oh. It's tapping, but it's not enough. He's gonna bite his face off. Oh. Okay, I don't know if I can. Okay, oh, this is too much. I can't. Just, just ruthless. Just ruthless. Like he just gets so fucked up. Oh. It's not that bad, but he gets he gets yeah, fucked uh, up pretty okay bad. Three sixty. It was okay till he bit my face. Well, that's why you don't fight meth heads, kiddos. Damn, he bit me good. Look at the guy's crazy as shit. The guy's like what? legit fucking insane. What the? Like a full on psychopath. <laughs> like, holy. Why would you ever do that? Why would you ever fight this guy? If I saw this guy you know, like walk into a bar, I would go, "Guys, you want to leave this bar? Like, I don't, I don't know if we're in the right neighborhood anymore." You know, this motherfucker like didn't even have a fight in his life. Like, lived at his mom's house and then like fought this dude with like a kendo stick, got molested, then got his face ripped off by his teeth. Oh, you know that's why. Like, you know, Moon holy Rock shit, felony fight six. What, not the, look at these comments. Not fair. One of them wasn't human. You know, this dude bit a nose off. Let's face him against a kid from the suburbs. <laughs> what a mismatch. But you know, like, a are, hardened what are they thinking? Psychopathic versus a Jewish kid from the San Fernando Valley who makes these matchups. Lost the fight and is now HIV positive from the bite. Not a gr great day. This is really sad. An anime nerd versus a violent drug addict. <laughs> what the f Where did you find this, dude? This shit I wa I've watched for years. Felony fights, you know, street beefs. But rough and Rowdy, which is like the boxing version. They've got all sorts of crazy fights, midgets and shit. Street beef <laughs> strapped two fucking disabled guys into a wheelchair and had them beat the shit out of each other and handicap boxing like a couple months ago. That was a new high for the sport, really. Fuck, man. All right, well, let's wrap it up. I, I, I would love to keep going, but I need to go fucking pass out. I'm, I'm, I'm we tired. didn't we didn't even get to mundane Matt for oh, fuck's sake. Oh, dude. Oh, we, dude, next next time, wheel man. We have to show you an app. I have. There's one. We'll do, we'll do special... some wheel man. Yeah. We didn't do enough on Dax. We did get through Bake. We got through a whole bunch of video games and shit like that. Yeah. I hope people had a good show. We yeah. got through mostly what I wanted to get through. It we was... didn't show Dick in high school, but whoops. Hang on. Oh, to read lastly, Andy, what do you think of all this Star Wars shit they're doing? What do all you these mean? New Star Wars. Well, they're launching all these different Star Wars shows. They're doing like a droid story. They're doing like Obi Wan Kenobi. Here's they're the doing... thing: I've never watched any Star Wars in my life. Wow, never. Oh. Not a. I think I watched a few scenes from Star Wars Episode Three. Well, my friends, but it was like on the background. I wasn't even. I didn't like. I don't. I don't know what's going on. Oh, I, sorry. I lied. I watched. Rogue One, but I was so high I don't know what happened. To be honest with you, I saw Darth Vader for a second. It is, it is. Yeah. Sadly, we came three thousand, three thousand lemon short for Andy. We tried, but we if tried you, for Andy. I would have. But, but if you take how much stream elements we got, we probably landed around sixty k. To be honest, if you add up, uh, it is. It is what it is, you know. I'm hoping that they just come through with a ninjet here last second. Somebody's oh, no, not the it's, retard it's, it's, there. So they've been so Griff supportive. Just they, 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 they've been so supportive. But I really enjoyed having you on, man. Like, this was like, dude, we never had a cast on for six hours before. Actually, we have. That's a lie. BPS and Raging Humanist. I was once yeah. drunk and they just did. I, I almost fell asleep. 
uh, on the show and they just like carried it for a few hours. So yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I think we've done a good show. I could go another two hours, Andy. I'm not going to lie. I could go two, three, however many more hours you need, you know buddy. Do? You know what we should do one day? Is. You know what we should plan one day? We should do a marathon show. Uh, maybe it will be. Maybe. But, you know, I don't know. I think it, we I think we had a good show. We don't want to get it too often. You, you know, don't want to do wanna, a show. Yeah, you don't want to, like, but there is the one thing is the mundane Matt stuff and the Dax stuff. There's, like, uh, one, one more thing, I think, that I really wanted to get to, but you know what? Next time, we'll... There was Cog the Cock. Oh, and then cock that's by cog what it was. Should, should we play that real quick? It's Fine. like a minute long. Fine, guys. Cog, what? So, so set this up. <laughs> set this up real quick. Let me get it pulled up because I sent it to you. One so more, basic one more segment, ladies and gentlemen. So basically, here's what happens: these fucking like total degenerate losers. I don't know. I don't know how to describe them. They're a couple. They're pagan. They believe in like satanic rituals or whatever. I don't know how to describe them, but they're they're like alt right or whatever. They're gonna battle Cog in this debate. Now, what they have to say to each other is completely irrelevant. But what I'm going to send to Andy here is pretty I have funny. it. I have it. You have it. So you go to 17 minutes in and you play this, yeah. and Cog's girlfriend comes in, and she's pretty horny for Godwinson. <laughs> Wait, what? She's pretty, she's pretty horny for Godwinson because like, Cog lives in like government housing and like squalor and poverty and filth. Yeah. But like Godwinson is this posh aristocrat, so she's like, all horny for Godwinson's vocabulary and his education. Just listen to this. Wait, wait. And does think, does um, I, I sorry. Did he delete this off his channel? Is someone out to re-upload it? I don't know. These people put it up. It was their conversation with Oh, Cog. I it's see. Not up I on see. Cog's channel. I see. Okay. That, 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 right, here we go. And then I'm just resizing your window here. And then go back. It's like 17, 17 minutes into this fucking All clip. Right. A not so cognitive conversation. All right. Cog. So, and Cog has issues with, with Godwinson or what? Yeah, well, like Cog here is saying Godwinson is like not a real white nationalist because he donated to Ralph and this and that. But really, who gives a fuck? Godwinson's just like donating basically his equivalent to a nickel in a bagger's cup multi-millionaire estate that he has so it is what it is all right yeah, here we go <clears throat> um, yeah we're not the same person cog does not watch Godwinson. what's up with I... these people who have shows who use like microphones you buy at a gas station that's attached to earphones and they're using like you know what i mean like it sounds like she's yeah. like using a walkie-talkie that's plugged in with. It US. sounds like terrible. Like it, they're like in the car, like trying to destroy Cog, and it's just not really working. Dude, that's like that's like uh, Tonka. You ever hear Tonka's audio now? It's like his mic gets worse oh, over man. the years. You know, it's like he's like strapped into a chair where he just smokes meth all day with Tonka. Like I don't even know what he's doing. Yeah. But you said, fucking, you don't. I do, I, I, do, I, do, I do find Godwinson entertaining. I find Listen his language entertaining. By the way, he talks, the vocabulary. Whoa. If my girl said that about a man right beside me, you know, you would hear. And that would be me just tapping her on the shoulder. That's it, D-Live, I swear. No, seriously, your bitch can't say that in front of you, dude. That's a dumping. That's at least. That's at least a bitch. Can you imagine? Yo, he's hot. Wow. Like he's hot. His like vocabulary. His, you know, it's just terrible. And like Aid Zero and Tachi are doing this show where they describe Godwinson as like this high-powered, mysterious CEO. It's like slightly <laughs> feared. Like this is crazy. Like what the fuck, I've guys? Like girls, have some dignity for fuck. It's yeah. yeah. not gonna you take you up him. on this shit, Derek. Oh my god! Is that this it for Cog's that? girlfriend? This is Cog's is girlfriend, hot? like petitioning Godwinson. To... I don't. I don't oh, know. She, I have oh, she no never idea. Revealed her face? I... Okay, she never revealed her face. Okay. Oh my god. Maybe she has. I have no idea, but she's like 
trying to suck Godwinson's cock. Yo, that and is this so- is like cock like girlfriend. It's tough, <laughs> isn't it? Like shit. Have you heard his rap songs? Oh, I have. And I have. And they're fucking bad. <laughs> They're so bad. He's like our audience. Okay, our our. Oh wait, someone said no, Andy. No, she isn't. Oh, she isn't. Hang on, did someone? All right, she's been on on, on the stream before. Oh, true. You'd smash cats. Don't lie. All right, yo, PPP, I'm gonna go pass out. Thank you for being on the show. All right, Andy. All right, man. That was fucking if- fun, dude. I'll hit you up later, yeah. right, buddy. I hope you had a good time, Andy. I hope it was a good show for you, man. Uh, Excellent. It was fun. I I hope you had fun being on the show, dude. I didn't get to everything. I kind of fucking went on forever about random bullshit. We, we, look, look, this is what happens. That's what happens. Honestly, having topics is always just a base in case we don't have anything to say. It's like, okay, well. But we went on, so it was amazing. It was great, great times, dude. All right. All right. It was All good right. to have you, Andy. You have too, man. Night. All right. Peace out, dude. Later. Have a nice night. Well, I'm so fucking tired, guys. That was so much fun. Uh, great show with PvP there um, and Kyler as well you guys have been very supportive i want to thank all the top donators here first last mr bill shikori larry and md a-hole anderson my name is nobody um who was being a fucking dick and he's he's banned because he's being a fucking retard uh d shattenry jessica government gouda drunken surfer thank you so much oh i think he was trying to dox someone in chat that's what it was. My name was nobody. He was being annoying, but I let him stay. But then he, I, he was like putting people's addresses in chat. So I was like, bro, I don't, I don't deal with that. Sorry, man. Not cool. Not cool. I don't know why you couldn't just be chill. Uh, I opened up the lemon test uh, chest already, guys. Guys, thank you for watching, and we'll see you all next week. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna spend this weekend playing Cyberpunk 2077. Peace. I opened the chest already. The chest was already open. So, all right, guys. Who was he trying to dox? I don't know, but there was an address in the chat, and nope. Franklin B. Groypen, be here next week. I'm too tired. Peace. Love you all. Bye.